gifts. To start I was making it for me and then my friends saw what I was wearing and then one of my friends said well why don't you have a go at selling so I thought well I'll give it a go and see how it goes. I do like a challenge it's because sometimes you, you look at something that you can't do it but then you don't know if you don't try to do it. <laughs> when you've made it and you've just made it you think that's nice put it on. When you get it out the next time that's when you think yeah, that looks really good. That looks quite professional. I'm proud to wear it. Quite often at work, they'll, they'll ask me what I'm wearing. They're astonished, first of all. You think something's so simple and they're, they're astonished at the, the piece of jewellery that you've made. They say it looks so professional and when I show them how easy it is to do, um, they'll say, oh, can I have a go of it? These necklaces are great for layering up, for happiness with your sort of holidays. Because they're there in the living room with you, you get to see the same people on a regular basis and you feel a bit like, like you know them. It's like a family, you know all the, the guests that are on the, on the TV. And then when you come to something like a workshop, it's really good because you, you seem to know everybody, you know about the people that you're working with. It just feels like your own family, that you're actually there with them and you are part of their family, you're part of their, you know, their community. There are four easy ways to stay in touch with Jewellery Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join a community of over 54,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions, send photos of your designs and enter our Wall of Fame competition. Or if you need any help or advice, you can email our friendly help team. Make sure to get involved and stay up to date with Jewellery Maker. Jewelry Maker, how are you? I'm Ali Defoy. It is so good to see you. Boy, oh boy, have we got a special treat coming up for you tonight. Well, actually, that's probably not fair to say. I've got more than one special treat. I've got loads coming up for you. Lots and lots of fun and so many deals. We have got one of the ultimate wire DVDs I've ever seen. It's a bundle of seven wire work DVDs. You're going to love it. We've got portfolio bags. I've got lapis lazuli, which our gemologists could not believe the strength of colour. Neither could we, so we all had to check the documentation. Probably triple checked it to make sure that these are totally natural, and they are. They are gorgeous. Natural Colombian emeralds. Mmm. Turquoise coming up your way tonight. Hmm, so many deals, so many treats, you do not want to miss them. And I've got a very, very special lady with me tonight. It is her debut to the Late Show. It is her fourth show with us here on Jewelry Maker. However, she has been jewelry making for a fair wee while before Jewelry Maker came along, I think. It's a lovely lady and she is so talented. You will not believe the kit that she's had and you won't believe what she's made with it. Boy, oh boy, will you want it. It's going to come up at seven o'clock and with me all night long, it's Karen Gray. Karen, how are you? I'm very well, thank you. Nice are you to looking? be here. I am looking forward to it, yeah. Yeah? Yes. And you like your kits? The kit was beautiful. Mm -hmm. Pearls. Can't go wrong with pearls. Can't go wrong with pearls. No. A little bit of natural Peruvian opal in there oh, as well. Oh, they were lovely. Mm -hmm. Graduated, it was, they were, it was just a joy, a joy to work with. And you're going to get to do it all over again later? Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. yeah. Karen's chosen one of her favourite parts uh, of tonight's kit and I absolutely my producer Tom the minute what was he like Karen the minute he saw it he was like whoa can we do this um, so partly thanks to producer Tom we're going to be showing you one of the most gorgeous pendants I think it looks a bit like a, she a seashell yes it, do it is quite um, I think it's the colours yeah and maybe the and the pearl yeah maybe it's got pearl maybe because uh, the pearls make me think yeah. of the beach and sea automatically uh -huh. maybe it's that Oh, it's fabulous. So Karen's going to be with us all night long, so please do send in your messages. Her wire work is fabulous, and she's just a lovely lady. So we're going to have lots and lots of fun tonight. So drop us a message if you feel free. Um, if you feel free. Feel free to drop us a message. If you feel free as well, you can message us too. I feel free. I want to send in a message. I feel happy. Maybe let me know what you did all weekend. Were you watching Jewelry Maker? Were you watching my, my friends? Or were you elsewhere? Were you doing something fun? Maybe you were on a boat in Belgium. So was I. Um, uh, maybe you were anywhere, maybe you were on another boat, maybe you weren't on a boat, maybe you were hanging out. Just let me know what you're up to. I'm thrilled to find out what you do at the weekends. What did you get up to at the weekend, Karen? 
Uh, yesterday was Father's Day. Yes, so it, it was. was a family day. Oh, lovely. So that was lovely all day. Although my husband cooked. Oh. Um, he did a big paella for us all, and it was wonderful. So. Oh, nice. And then Saturday was. Um, I was getting ready to come here and getting all the kit together oh. and making some more pieces. Jewelry making mm, for us. What a brilliant day. Yeah. Were you jewelry making over the weekend? What did you get up to? Drop us a message. Sam, what did you do? You went to car boot sale? Well, I went to the Red Arrows with my dad. You went to see the Red Arrows with your dad? But that was fun. We went to work, watch a whole air display. Went to watch a whole air display. How fabulous. <gasps> what did you do? What did you get up to? Drop us a message. Either 60777. Normal network charges will apply. Put James Studio at the start of your text. Because if you don't, it doesn't come through to us. It just kind of floats about in the ethos. Um, yeah, there's more than one place that has that same number. I noticed it when I was in the, driving my car and the radio station were like, text is in, 60777. I was like, that's our number. But they, you had to put whatever radio station was in front of it. So do bear that in mind. Do put James Stewart at the start. Or if you want to drop us a message on jewelrymaker.com, you can do that too. It's free on there if you want. It'd be, be lovely to hear from you. Right, lots and lots coming your way. Should I get it started for you? Should we do the tote bag? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's the very, very last of stock. It's, I, I couldn't show it to you earlier because there's only a few that love it or love it. There are only seven of these left. This makes me so happy, this bag. This is one of the first tote bags we ever did colour-wise. It's got one of the sturdiest handles out there. And the last thing you want when you've got all your heavy tools in here, whether you've got your hammers in here, or maybe you've just got loads of wire or gemstones, or whatever it is you, you carry in your tote bag, you need a strong handle. You don't want it to give in the middle. You don't want to sort of fold in. You want that handle to be sturdy and strong. And it's definitely so. It's got a really comfortable grip on there. I don't know if you've ever tried to carry them when they're full, but they are really, really heavy. Um, and they're very, very comfortable. Most guest designers um, have got one sort of way of carrying their tools. Many of them like to do it in this tote bag. I'm not saying all of them, because that'd be a big generalization, but lots of them do. Um, it's got big, big pockets on the side which double velcros uh, on either side and then an even bigger one just in case you weren't sure if you were a jewelry maker bag or not we've gone and put our name on it just to make sure a lot of people do say that when when they're using jewelry maker products a lot of people do buy from them because of that so that might be something you want to can advertise but in your own wee quiet ways out without being like jewelry maker like we do um you've got as over the shoulder handle on there as well uh, which you can adjust if you wish oh you don't have to use it you can just tuck it inside the bag into one of the pockets. There's two pockets on each side. You've got a zip pocket on this side, so if you want to put some valuables in there, there's that option too. And you've got a zip pocket on the other side. You've also got something really quite nifty, which you can clip your purse to or your handbag to on there. Or maybe if you've got one of these fancy key rings, you want to clip it onto there, or you've got the option of cl clipping something onto that side as well. Maybe your house keys or whatever it might be that you've got in it, wherever you want to have it. But this treat is $17.95. It's the last seven installed, and that's been your price. So we've just kept it at the same price for you because that's what we like to do. In this side, I don't know if you've noticed, but you probably haven't because you probably can't see unless you've used it before. There's actually a little groove so you can put your tools in, you can balance them in there in the top as well. So you don't have to have them sort of hanging about at the bottom in here all the way along. You put all you can't see it because it's dark but you have got in fact I've got some tools here let me just sort of see if I can shimmy these in for you but um what way would round would you put them you put them in that way wouldn't you with the handles oh no you wouldn't you put them in that way but you can pop them in like that. I don't know if you can see can you see it when I put that in there maybe in between the blue but they balance in there you can put them that way or you could might want to put them in a different way it's up to you but all the way along one two three four there's about four compartments on each side for you to put your tools in there or to slide them down. So you've got that option in there too. Um, it might be something you want to get somebody as a gift for someone. Maybe you're thinking, actually, they really love jewelry maker. They've got loads. They, they do their, their jewelry making. Maybe they, they go on tour. Maybe you go to different places and you think it would be quite nice of them to have something to put their tools into. As a nice gesture, as a nice gift, that might be an option too. If you'd spend maybe 20 pounds on a family friend or maybe maybe family, then that might be an, a, a thought for you. It's 17.95. Enjoy it and don't miss it out. It's midsummer madness mm -hmm. thanking you Sam Sam's my floor manager sorry uh, sorry she's not my floor manager that's massive fib Sam is my camera operator sometimes does four as well you sometimes swap with Pete but she's our uh, camera operator we've got Becky as our floor manager tonight looking after us Becky's got the most fabulous purple hair there she is giving you a Be and Becky's contract it did not say she would be on TV so I will not subject you to being on TV Becky I apologize that's it for the night all right <laughs> yeah, she didn't believe me. <laughs> um, this one is coming up. I just had to pick it up because I love it. Half an hour's time. You could have both. You could be matching on both sides. 
coming up, but not yet. That's one of our star buys coming up tonight. Our superstar buys Colombia or showstopper is Colombian emeralds that are natural. Mm, right. Lots and lots. Sh should we do some silver chains? Oh my gosh, I had a dream about chains last night. I don't know why. I was looking on a website that had a 50% discount. I know. <laughs> this is how weird I am, jo Karen. This is what I do uh -huh. like my life. I, no, it's not that fun a story. I just woke up and I thought to myself, oh my word, I can't believe that chain went from 69.95 down to 59.95 and it's just chain. That's what was going on in my head. I was like, we do chain on Jewelry Maker for much less. That was my dream. I told you it wasn't exciting. He's just gone, wow. <laughs> told you, I didn't say it was exciting. I just said it was a bad dream. Um, this, the, this is exciting. Oh, it's got stars all the way along it. That's pretty. How pretty, how many? 60, 16. I'm not happy anymore. I want this as an anklet chain. Not that I often wear anklets, but in the summertime, people tend to get their ankles out a wee bit more than we do in the winter, don't we? So with that, oh, 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 I'm sorry, <laughs> turned into a monkey again. I get a little bit excited, especially when I haven't seen you all weekend. Um, this, you could cut wee sections, could you, Karen? Could you cut wee sections and have like an, a little inch with a star and have them as like little drops on earrings? They, that would be good. And then have a little drop of a, a gem at the bottom. <gasps> oh, wrap open the bottom. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like this chain. Oh, I do. There are only 16 of them. Two metres uh, in the star for you. Or two millimetres, sorry, that is. Not two metres. Um, a metre in length and you've got two millimetre. That must be your star that's two millimetre. Is that the length that's two millimetre? It's not telling me about the star. I want to know about the star. What size is the star? It doesn't tell me about the star. Maybe it's not meant to be there. Maybe it's just a wee surprise. Maybe it's just meant to be two millimetre chain and somebody's just gone and popped stars in for you. Could be. Could be. Um, maybe you've got a little star in your life and you want to tell them there is a star. Mm -hmm. That could be a nice way of doing it, couldn't it? would be lovely. Make a nice headpiece as well. Ooh, I like that, a headpiece. Ryan's getting worried. I always put things up at my head. He's thinking, please don't, don't, don't <laughs> we, we, we at home don't want to see wrinkle lines anymore. They're dehydration lines, the lady in the shop told me. <laughs> I'm going to stick no to that for the No such thing as wrinkle lines. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> dehydration lines. I'm going to stick to that for my whole life. <laughs> 40, you took your you can't drop the price, drink it out of your coffee cup and give me a thumbs up. That's not how it works. Or it is. In Producer Tom's world. Producer Tom is in the gallery. Oh yes, he had a weekend at home. He went for a family birthday and he enjoyed himself. There he is. Went to Brighton. I didn't know your home was Brighton. Half an hour from Brighton. There we go. 14.99, no, 95 even. I nearly give you a wee extra four fee on top of that. No, sorry, forgive me, 14.95. That's what happens when you have a couple of days off. You forget to breathe and you get too excited and make monkey noises. Kate Ness there, Lincolnshire with us, Moira's in Somerset, Pat's in Berkshire, lovely to see you all. Oh, so many treats. You will need to check these out. Gosh, it's a wee bit, wee bit uh, dilly-dallying going on tonight. Oh, dear. If you dilly-dally, you miss out. I was buying, no, this is, this is how bad, I was buying something yesterday on the internet. It was a cover for my phone. Um, because I, I got a brand new phone, a cover, not a cupboard. I'm not going to buy a cupboard for my phone. It's a cover. Cover. You put on it. How do you get a cupboard from that, Karen? I don't know. Mm -hmm. um, and I went on the internet, and it wasn't a lot for this cover. And I, I went to buy it. It got rejected by my card company. They sent me a message and said, did you really try to buy this? So I obviously don't buy things on the internet very often because they just rejected it because it was so unusual that I bought something on the internet. And I was like, it was me. They were like, well, that's all right. You're going to have to do it again. I was like, I literally used my card that little that they were shocked when I wanted to spend, um, well, it was two things I was buying, a wallet and that, and it was £20 for the two combined. And it was like, nope, <laughs> rejected. Sorry, what was that next? Too busy thinking about my rejection. Um, tree charms. These are gorgeous. Limited edition. I haven't seen these before. Karen, have you seen these yet? Limited edition. It's like a tree of life charm. They're pretty. Can you well, I put the, them behind the blackboard and then you can see if you... I'll show them for you as well. <laughs> <laughs> Not just Karen and I here tonight. <laughs> you, you might like to see as well. All right. I don't know if you can see it better from there. You get loads, you get 10. Now, I haven't had a chance to see these because these are limited and low in stock. I've got very, very few of them, but there is a space if you fancy them. Oh, there's, some, uh, there's them. That's terrible English. There they are against 
<laughs> the blackboard. What happens when I have a few days off? Forget to learn how to talk. And it's got, if I move that away, you have, you know, hang out in a boat and that's what happens. Um, you've got a lovely loop at the top. These are gorgeous, sterling silver plated. They're very solid in their, their makeup. 35 by 28 millimeter, 30 grams. Oh, these are lovely. Oh, I really like these. Oh, because you can actually just kind of wrap into those. Could, yeah. 9 95 They're the final 10 opportunities. Could you sew into those? You could, you could wrap Use them as a focal and wrap around them and add beads or even a stone at the bottom of a cabochon. Ooh. That would be quite nice. That would be lovely. That sounds really nice. Resin in the yeah. gaps. Maybe put a wee bit of tape behind it and then pop some resin in and then peel that away. Look like a stained glass window. Oops. It'd look lovely. That would be super lovely. Oh my word. Kathleen's in, loving your work out Mom the Street. Has anyone spotted I've painted all nails bar one? Look, I missed that one. I don't know how I missed it. I was literally like, what's happened there? I've missed one nail out of ten. Nine out of ten ain't bad. Now, how, I don't know how I managed that. Um, when Kathleen's in and Mom the Street, I was probably thinking about jewellery maker treats today. Devon, Gwent, Lanarkshire, Lancashire in there as well. Lots, lots of people showing an interest in the phone lines and the web. Thank you so much. At £9.95, that's a pound each. For that gram weight, I appreciate it's brass, but there's sterling silver plated there as well. That's 30 grams of both. Angela's got two in Dorset. Susan's in there in Devon. So that, what, 30 divided by 10 means there's three grams in each one. That's a weighty, weighty pendant, isn't it? And silver plated on top of that. That's, yeah. Beautiful. Quite durable as well. Yeah, they don't bend. That's lovely. I like those. Mm. Right, an acrylic earring stand suits you. Oops. You know when you pile them up like coins and then you hold them top and bottom while the middle's spurting it? So you do get it, Jen. Um, here's your earring display in a wave. I don't know why it's waving. I think it's waving because it's quite stylish, producer Tom. Please excuse me, I'm going to go onto the floor and find those uh, charms. I'm not going to find them, I haven't lost them, they're all there. So you've got your option. Oh, I found a strand of lapidorite down here. <laughs> Genuinely found a strand of lapidorite. There we go, I think I've got them all. I don't know if there's any missing, Sam, you can let me know. There we go. Count them for me. Sorry, thank you. Oh no, I found another one. There we go. Oh, there's another one. This is like an Easter egg hunt for <laughs> Jeff. This is brilliant. Sorry, I found them all now. There we go. Right. There we go. Ah, right. Two point five by fourteen. You never know what's going to happen. I did apologise to Karen in advance. I did just say, Karen, that you only got four hours and forty-five minutes left of me. Sorry. Um, I did apologise to Karen in advance. I said, if I do ever just disappear at any point, don't panic. Just continue. I'll be fine. Um, everything will be all right. Right. I don't know where that came from. Lovely. Right. Um, so twenty-two point five by fourteen centimetres. Brilliant for eating. It's only four. No, is it? Is that? Did I do that to distract myself? I didn't know 4.95 was coming. That's super low, and you could stack those up, couldn't you? Because even though they go, they've got the wave sort of front ways, they don't have it in the back, so they would all stack up nicely against each other. That would be great for being portable, um, and also, of course, for the amount of gaps that are on there, the way you could hang. If you had some drops, <coughs> they would hang quite well. If you had them over the edge, because of the swirl, I think that's quite nifty. Able to keep it clean very, very easily, and that's something I always think is quite important. Presentation can be key in many occasions and something like this you've got that option to keep it clean you keep it wipe it down it's not going to damage it in any way and you've got the option for putting your earrings in there just studs you can actually put charms in here as well if you make letter charms or any type of charms that would be really quite cool wouldn't it because you could put that on there too oh, i quite like these right lots and lots of you coming through lots and lots of you treating yourselves i'm loving your work shall i leave those with you gtp 43 i think that was Oh, should I show you my lapis lazuli? Wait to see these. These. Believe it or not, because we struggled, we had to do lots of checks with all of our um, information. These are totally natural. And the reason I'm so surprised is because of how strong they are in colour. 
natural lapis lazuli. Should we do a cheeky low? I think we will. It's coming up for us before the end of this hour. We'll do it around 5.50 p.m. for you. Mm -mm -mm. Not yet. I'm going to do a tea bar and a toggle class. Now, I launched this on one of uh, my first shows with producer Tom, which actually was only about a month and a half, maybe two months ago now. Ooh. Um, two months today, is it? I don't know. To know. Either way, we're both still here, producer Tom and I. Um, and Ryan's with us tonight. Yay! He's producing in the gallery. Directing, sorry, sorry. There he is. There they are. Um, and we've got Sam in the studio and Becky. Oh, sorry, I'm not I said I wasn't going to make it, but mention Becky again, but Becky's with us. Um, and we've got Karen with us, ladies and gentlemen. So do get your messages in if you want to get to know Karen if you've not met her yet. Um, was Karen down? Where were you? Were you hiding as well? No, I was looking for wire. Looking for wire. <laughs> yeah. We're surrounded by treats, we are uh -huh. in, this, in this studio, aren't we? We are. Right, let's get have a look at this. Now, I love this. This reminds me, I remember I spoke about it, reminded me of Mulan when I saw this. Because Mulan goes into like a little, it's almost like a little temple in her own back garden that they've got. And she goes in and she talks to her little cricket. Well, if you've never watched it, then you've missed out seriously. And that, that's something you should try and watch. Um, well, I think so. Love a good wee Disney movie. Other movies are available. Still love Disney though. Oh, Hong Kong Fui. I'm just going to hold it. I was trying to give the impression of where the tea bar would go through the toggle. I think it's more of a charm, and I think a lot of people purchased it first way as a charm because that as a charm on its own is fantastic. But it reminds me of the little sort of mini temple that she had in the back garden. I don't know the name either. Sam and I have both forgot the name. Wait, did we didn't launch it at 4 95 did we? What were we thinking? What night was that? Well, that was your first night, wasn't it? If it was your first night, then you really didn't mind. You just went to town on everything. Oh, my gosh, and you've repeated that same price, almost as if that's allowed. <laughs> what do you think, Karen? A sterling silver charm for £4.95. It's easy. actually a class. It's, it's got a function, beautiful. but if you wanted, you could use it as a charm. You could use either, side as either piece as a charm as well, because yeah. the little toggle parts look like. It's almost like a little branch, isn't it? Yes. That's really pretty. For four ninety five, mm. would you? Oh yes. Oh yes. <laughs> oh yes. These are the final six. Oh, Tatiana straight in London, gone for a multi purchase. Lovely. They're Dorothy Mays and Mary's inside. Yorkshire have got two. West Yorkshire, sorry, should I say? And I've got six left. I would like these. Thinking of all the, you know, there was a wonderful sort of oriental dresses that come out they're always going to come out at the same time of year and we all love them i remember that's wonder that's oh, when i auditioned for my first ever television job i wore one of those oriental dresses it was a black one with blue flowers it was lovely it wasn't my first television job that's a fib my first one was called you cool and i played the best friend of the girlfriend i didn't have a name <laughs> but i got 150 pound for my check from the bbc and I was really chuffed and I framed it. And that was me. Right. Oh my gosh, did we do text in for your first ever job? What was your first ever job? Can you remember? What was mine? I used to stand on the corner at Love Street and sell football programmes before the football games. That was my first ever proper job. Your first job was in a nursing home and you did what? Delivered cake and tea everybody in the in the old folks home how cool and just hang out with them all day have conversations with cake and tea it sounds like a pretty cushy first job <laughs> oh lovely karen can you remember your first ever job at school when i was at school i had a saturday job selling christmas cards so it was a christmas in a well-known high street store did you and they were one and eleven a pack <laughs> i love that you remember and, it yeah because yeah it was just before decimalisation, so they were right. 1 in 11 for a pack, and you had to add the, uh, them up in your head. <gasps> you couldn't add them up on the till, you had to add up all the packages. So you had to be good head. at maths. Mm. And that was quite scary. Yeah, I can imagine. On a Saturday, all day Saturday, adding up 1 in 11s that were coming at you. Oh, oh I couldn't yes. handle that. Mine was £2 ago, £2 <laughs> a programme. Uh, it's fine. <laughs> no Until, change. Yeah, no. <laughs> 
<laughs> and then when you ran up the stairs, because they were run out of programmes, I then became programme coordinator, and I ran up the stairs to go and give somebody some extra programmes. What did I do? Fall. All these two pound coins went downstairs in front of hundreds of Rangers fans, and they all started picking them up. I was like, oh no, oh no. I was one pound over by the time I counted it all. So I, ended up, I, I do not know how that's possible, but I didn't lose anyone. Anyway. I made money. She did that more often. Um, oh. Yeah, I did panic and beg quite a lot. I was like, please give it me back. <laughs> but no, they were wonderful. They were great. It's still going. <gasps> a skipping rope of emerald, anybody? Suit you, it pal? It goes on forever. It does, That's isn't it? lovely. An emerald skipping I wonder if I could do one of my dances with it. No, I shouldn't. I shouldn't. Dan, don't egg me on. You know I'll do it. I'll say I have to stand up. Health and safety. I am a first aider, this is alright. Ready? I don't know. Don't panic, Ryan, it's alright. Ready? It's not that good, you can't really see it. It's fun and it was more fun in my head. <laughs> it looks better when it's a ribbon and it's got loads flowing. That was so there we go, that's what you can do with a metre of emerald, or you can make jewellery with it. Which is why I guess you're probably watching. Um, 120 carats, oh, it's got all the colours you look for in emeralds, hasn't it? It's got some of the Brazilian emeralds, some of the Zambian emerald tones, Colombian emerald tones in there. It's a lovely shine. It's all the way from Brazil. Brazil. Doesn't sound quite as fun as Colombian, does it? Um, got a wee message in from Debbie, New Jersey. My first job was working in a bakery the fall after the summer that I lost 50 pounds. Loved the job, but the weight didn't stay off long. Oh, oh. well. Oh, that's the shade and all that hard work. <laughs> I bet you enjoyed it though. A bakery. Oh, I couldn't handle working in a bakery. I'd be so hungry all the time. Oh. Oh, wow. Wow. I cannot believe how many emeralds I've got. One of the extra great things about this is the fact that it graduates all the way up to 4 by 2 mil. So when you have a graduated strand, it allows you to do lots of different things, I imagine. Yes. But when you've got a metre of a graduated strand, I mean, that's given you plenty of, of normal oh, strands gorgeous. of each. Yeah. Yeah. What would lovely. you do? If you, had a, if you had half a chance to play with these, what would you do? With um... There's a lot there. There's a lot that, uh, yeah. Channel setting springs to mind, obviously, Ooh, because yes. of that. Um, and they make lovely earrings in drops if you had tiny rosary links and just had three or four strands with half a dozen on each, that would look quite nice. That sounds lovely. Um, but no, they're lovely colours. Aren't they? It's, it's almost like every colour of green you could imagine. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's like you've driven all the way from sort of England all the way through to Wales and then up to Scotland and you've got a hint of like all the different it's vegetation like a forest on the way. On a strand, yeah. yeah, it is like a forest on a strand, isn't it? Yeah. Looks like Tarzan there. Expect to see him swinging through all the branches there. Um, these are totally genuine. They've been oiled. However, there's no other treatment to them. In 1995, for a, a meter. I don't want to forget about it. I'm enjoying it. Jai B, you may say J, are you at uh, 95 even? That's the code for them if you wonder why I just randomly said some letters there. £12.95. So on the phone lines, if you ever call us, 0800 6245, do press your button one because we can see you, but we can't actually speak to you until you press that button one. So if you're waiting and we're waiting, it's going to be a very long wait. Um, so just press your button one and then we can speak to you. You don't have to confirm it. The call centre are there to help you. If you've got any questions, please do ask them. They're lovely. They're really, really helpful. I always call, which is why my uh, card company didn't understand why I was buying something online yesterday. Um, at £12.95, I just love talking to people. It's lovely. <laughs> it's good fun. That's why I call. Genuinely, I'd like to hear somebody say, yes, that's fine. You've got it. I don't know why. I'm just, Sam's the same. How do you shop, Karen? Do you do it on the internet? On t internet. Oh, that all internet. internet, all the time. <laughs> so easy. Yeah, it is. It's so quick. It's yeah. super easy, unless yeah. you've got a bank like me who are like, uh -huh. you're shopping? With <laughs> what? what are Decline? you doing? No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> Decline for £20. I mean, come on. Uh-huh. I thought they might have at least get, let me get to £25. Um, I mean, message saying, my brother used to produce the footy programmes for St Mirren. Think he still does a lot on Martin. Really? I don't know if I've ever met your brother then. How 
funny is that? Yeah, I used to be the person that used to like stand on the street corner and hand them out. But what happened about? I sold them, obviously. I got my two pounds for each one. People will be like, oh, if I buy two, can I get one for three pounds? I was like, well, yeah, but that's going to cost you more. <laughs> they didn't, I think they meant two for three pounds. But <laughs> I was like, yeah, you can do that. That'll be, that'll be, that'll be five pounds then for two programs. Thanking you. Uh, maybe that's how I got my extra pound. 12 pounds and 95 pence. Join me as soon as you can. Oh, I love that. Love, love, love. A full meter. Imagine you had that on your glasses. That would be like the longest glasses strand ever. People see the back of you, your neck and there's mm -hmm. a strand of emeralds. Oh yes, look at my emerald glasses chain. Oh yes, let me. <sighs> Love it. Right, it's not star by time already, is it? Oh my gosh. Right, you don't want to miss this because this is fabulous. Star by time. <laughs> I love this portfolio bag. This is so, so handy. It's the size of almost a sort of mini laptop bag. It's really, really quite dinky. Um, Colour-wise, well, it's bright and bold, so if you don't like bright and bold, this is not the bag for you. Um, we've got handle on there for you. It's actually, do you know what I like about this handle? It's close to the bag. Normally, there's, there's quite a big gap, and it almost seems like it's flapping around, but this is actually quite close to the bag. It feels very secure. I feel as if I'm, I'm in, in touch with the bag. That sounds ridiculously silly, but... No, it is, but you know if a handle's too big and it swings about, and if you've got precious things in there, you don't want it swinging about, do you? It feels like solid, secure, and it's right there. I like that. You've also got a longer handle if you want to make it like a handbag style. You can make it as long as you wish. Well, obviously, within the strap. That's quite long indeed. That could be over the shoulder. Oh yeah! I feel really fashionable. I'm going to go to the shop. If only I'd had this for the weekend. It would look like a right tourist in Belgium, wouldn't I? Right. Let's get in here. Oh, I haven't seen this in ages. This was so popular when it first came in. Oh, I love it. I remember it's got all the flip pages in there. Oh, it's not been seen since May this year. I haven't seen it in forever. So you've got all the different compartments. What I love about them is the fact that they're see-through. So of course you can put things in and know exactly where you've put them. You don't need to rummage through boxes or try and find them underneath. Great. A lot of our guest designers, uh, if my memory serves me correctly, Laura Binding in particular will have one of these bags and she brings all her treats in that she's made for us for the show. And then she'll say, oh, I've got that in that bag. That's the bracelet for that. That's the necklace that goes with that. And we'll have a look at whatever she's made from the kit and it will be in here. And then you've got the option of having leftover pieces not that they would be leftovers but say you haven't used all of the gemstones or all of the wire in your kit you've got options to put them in here you've got the bag I think that's just zip there I've just closed it there we go so you've got a larger compartment in there as well if you want to put your phone or your keys or maybe some tools or whatever it is you want to carry in there there's also an option actually that's not just the front part there's oh, oh I love it so good for showing off your work if you're wanting to sell your work or if you're wanting to make sort of commission pieces it's a really really good way for you to show things quite easily quite openly but then also really good for just to store your gemstones if you're just collecting um we're down to just 14.95 on this one you've got the back uh oh it's velcro as well i didn't realize that velcro in there too so it's got yeah, extra added security you can maybe put one of those um, sort of pad eye things, the tablets in there, they would fit in there quite nicely. And then you've got that extra section here at the front. Let's have a looky looky in here. Oh, it's just a nice big compartment. It's almost, it's padded there. So it'd be extra security. So if you've got something valuable in there, it's a little bit a little bit padded. So you've got special projects you might want to put in there, finished pieces, or alternatively again, if you want to put something, maybe like an electrical in there, like one of the tablets or your phones or something, you don't need to worry about them getting bumped. It's a good idea. Jewellery. A toolkit. Oh, you could slide your toolkit in there. Do you think it would fit? Let's have a wee looky looky here. Here's the toolkit. Oh! Fits in perfectly. Well, that is perfect. Look, it doesn't even take much away from the, the size. Brilliant. Loving your work. So many ways to use this. Right, do check it out. Gosh, I haven't even told you how much, well, I have told you how much I have. 
have a nine. Fourteen ninety five. Do you have any bags that you keep your jewellery in at the minute, or what do you do with yours? Do you put them in storage boxes? In or? Box, storage yeah. boxes. Storage boxes. Mm, lots of them. Yeah, <laughs> lots of them. All piled up. Yeah. <gasps> Brilliant. I've got my. I've got a storage box and I've got a bag. I love my. I've got the round bag, the little tote bag, or oh, one of the first bags we ever had. They always really. sell out. Yeah, well, I only got it because my mum was watching that day. My mum got it for ah. me, otherwise I wouldn't have got it at all. She got it for herself, but it sort of managed to make its way to my house. Of course it does. Um, should we do the toolkit then? Last? What do you mean, last toolkit? Oh, large, that's all right then. It's like, it can't be our last toolkit. Heaven forbid we've got no more toolkit. I have this one. When did I buy it? Oh, why did I buy it? I bought it because I wanted the um, deluxe crimping, crimping pliers. <laughs> that bad? That is why I bought it. Um, because the, and I wanted this as well because it looked really cool, even though I didn't know what it was at the time when I when I got it. Um, this is a oh I used this file the other day. Probably wasn't the right thing to do, but one of my friend's mums had a lovely pendant, but it kept catching on her blouse. It, had, it was silver, but it had a little bit of a... It, I don't know if she dropped it or bumped it, but it was a bit sticking out. So I got this in one of the files, put it in, and filed it a little bit, and she's fine. Okay. Well, that's what she told me. She's still wearing it. So all is good. Um, yeah, this is a brilliant, brilliant, brilliant tool. Let me show you this. I don't know if you've got one of these. If you haven't, you need one. So it comes with a wee packet with all of these individual files on there. They are great files, they really, really are. So you've got a flat file, you've got two round ones of different gauges, look how extra long that one is. And then you've got this one. All of these files fit in here, so you give it a wee twist. Let me just use this one. Pop it in, I opened it. So you wind it up to get it in, and then you pop it in, and then you wind it down to close it, and then you've got your tool ready and ready to go. And then open the bottom, and you store all your tools in there. Nine ninety-five. I imagine elsewhere you'd be paying not too far off for one of the tools like this. This is a fantastic, fabulous file. Um, I, well, it's a bee dream where it's called with replacement tips. I love it. You've got the sliding gauge, you've got all in there as well. You still get that. You've got flat nose pliers, you've got chain nose pliers, you've got round nose pliers, you've got cutters, you've got snips, you've got a measuring gauge, you've got a shovel tweezer set, which I really, really like. It's got the wee shovel on one end, it's got the tweezers on the other. And then you've got the deluxe crimping pliers, which I'm absolutely in love with. I think these are so fabulous. They're great if you're not very good at... Um, Oh, they've got crimping pliers, sorry, I don't know if they're the deluxe ones, but they're the crimping ones, I think the deluxe. No, these are the deluxe ones, aren't they? Let me just, can I get the info again on these? I think they're deluxe crimping ones. Oh, one more time. I can't see it. Oh, oh, hold on, stay there, stay there. Um, they're just called crimping pliers, maybe they're not, the deluxe ones. Well, I got them for the crimping pliers then. But you can close a crimp with the round bit. Or, you, well, of course, you use both parts to it. You make it almost like a W. You make it, and then you close it over into its little square. And then you use that to close a crimp cover over the top of it, or at least I do. Please forgive me, I think I'm about to sneeze. Oh, there we go. Right, £9.95 for the entire kit and you get the folder to keep it in as well. I think it's fantastic. I love my toolkit. Makes me very happy. And if you're ever in the middle of a project and you've lost your beaning board like me, you can actually just close it over and then zip it up and then nothing falls out and you don't lose it. And then you open it up again. I keep my glue in there as well. I don't know if that's a wise idea, but that's where I keep mine. Right, Citrine, this is so gorgeous. The colour of it, the glow, it really is something quite delicious. Wait till you see these. They are, oh my, I just want to put them on. Can I, well, I'm going to do it anyway. Is that okay? <laughs> I was going to ask and then I thought, I'm in the mid, mid, midway doing it anyway. I'll just pop them on. <sighs> Love them. I think purple sort of amethyst colours go gorgeous so with citrine and ametrine, the gemstone, well, makes that happen because you get a bit of both. So I think Mother Nature agrees. In fact, you probably come up with the idea first. I think that's probably more accurate. What do you think, Karen? I think probably 
<laughs> been around a bit. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit. Not a lot, but been a bit. Been around a while. November's birthstone, the first birthstone that I ever purchased was a, a citrine. The Happiness Gemstone. I bought it because it was called the Happiness Gemstone. And the sunshine makes me happy and it reminds me of sunshine, which is why I've decided it's the Happiness Gemstone. But you might have your thoughts as to why. Right, it's an 84 centimetre strand, 2 by one to 10 by 2 millimetre for you in its length. The glow coming from these is one of the most exciting, glistening, almost like the sun. Is it? For citrine? Oh, come on. 22 available, these will be allocated on a first come, first serve basis. So whether you want to call me or join me on the web, it's whichever is most convenient for you. It's ZQDW61 is the code that you require for this. So if the contact centre asks you, we haven't had any other citrine on our show, but there might have been other citrines on throughout the day. So just to make sure you get the right one, the code is ZQDW61. Now, if you're joining us on the web, you'll probably see it there and you just click it and pop it into the basket. Do make sure you check it out before the end of the night. In fact, try and check them out as and when you go along because it doesn't cost you any more at post and packaging wise it's once in any one day oh my gosh one of the things I was looking at when I told you I was trying to use my card the other day on the internet and it wouldn't let me and got declined um, simply if you just tuned in simply because I haven't used it online really at all very often um, and the post and packaging for one of the other things I was looking at before I decided which one to go with was five pounds for the post and packaging mm -hmm. five pounds but if I spent over £60, it was free. I wasn't, it was like an accessories place for like a phone cover. So I wasn't going to be spending £60 for a phone cover, was I? So, but I don't know, you might do that, I don't. Um, £4.95 pence, and it's £2.95 all night long, no matter how much you get. So you can get as much as you want, or as little as you want. You're just looking at £2.95, pence, which is what? That's hardly anything. I think it's fab. Mrs. B's in Hampshire, loving your work, Mrs. B. Laying Cardiff, well done to you, Jeannie. You're in as well. Cheshire, multi purchases going to Cardiff. Tatiana's in in London. Oh, having a great night. Just to have citrine on your, whether it's something that you make or just to have it in time for somebody's birthday, I think is such a lovely, lovely thought. Maybe you want to get it as a first purchase because you haven't seen citrine like this before. We don't do many like this. Karen, have you got citrine in your collection? I haven't. Um, yellows are colours that I've stayed away from, although okay. it was in my first kit right. on here, and mm -hmm. it was absolutely glorious, it was really? lovely, so that's now creeping into my um, collection, Collection, yes, and that I is know. so pretty, really isn't sparkly. It? Super sparkly mm. for citrine, isn't it, yeah. and for only £5, for £4.95, uh -huh. it's a lot to get your teeth into, as you say, if it's something you're just trying, you haven't yes. really got your head around it, whether you want to use it, or maybe now and again you think, oh, if only I had a wee sort of light pastel lemon, that would be quite nice. Yes. You've just got it there for your stash. I mean, it's a great stash treat at 4 95 if you've got an order open already. If you haven't, don't worry. Um, it would look divine with the lapis lazuli. Blues and gold. This is a premier lapis lazuli coming up very, very shortly, and it's totally natural. Everybody wants to get their hands on this. Cannot wait. Natural rounds. Really lovely. Right, should we do a jumbo clasp? Are you feeling it? Me too. Oh, not long until we do those. Mm -hmm. Right. A jumbo, last time I had a jumbo clasp one, it flew out the door. Do you know what I love about this jumbo clasp? It's not just that it's jumbo. No, no, there's so much more than that. Genuinely is, on the findings, you can attach things to them. So you don't have to use glue at all. Let me show you. What do you think? Look, it's got a loop in there. So you can loop through it and attach threads, attach cords, attach chains. I really like it. Then you've got this option here, if I open it, you can see you've got it as a possible clasp as a function, but you could also make it a main feature. Very sizable, very stylish. And I love the fact that it's not just for your cords or your ribbon endings. You could put your beading threads in there. You could loop jump rings to that. There's so much you could do with that. 
It's really lovely. You could put an eye loop and connect it to that as well. The fact that it's got that option. You can still glue it. You can do treat it as a sort of bead cap in that way. What do you think of uh, kind of cord endings like that, Karen? That's class like endings. Because um, it's so versatile. It is, isn't yeah. it? And it's quite masculine as well. Yeah. The size of it is yeah. quite... Well, it's really chunky. It's lovely. I mean, there's a lot... I mean, it's sterling silver on it. So it's 3.33 grams of sterling silver, isn't it? That's a lot of silver. It's a lot of silver for just the clasp, mm -hmm. isn't it? It is. So for £8.95, that's a pretty sizable piece for a really, what seems to be, for me, quite a, an easy price for silver. It is. It's lovely. It's that, why not? So you could use it as a feature anyway. Yeah. Rather than just as a clasp, it could be a lovely feature. Definitely. So if we only charge five ninety five, oh, yeah. it's got your ninety five stamp on it. You like it? Uh -huh. Like Very it even much. more? I like it a lot more. A lot more. <laughs> <laughs> good That's at eight ninety five. Really good. good at five ninety five. In fact, going on to great, great things available for you here. Maybe you just want to get it. You don't know what you're going to do with it just now, but you can get it and put it by for mm -hmm. that special occasion where you do have something. We say that's exactly when I'm going to use that class. But when I mean, you see things on sale, I do, I, well I did it yesterday actually, that's why I, I got the, the cover that I wanted from my phone because it was on sale. I wasn't going to buy it at full price because I hadn't tried the company before, I didn't know anything about it. But because it was on sale, mm -hmm. I thought I don't mind parting with that because it's not as much and I'll see you and I'll try it out. So the next time if I do want to get something else, I'll know the quality, I'll have seen the, the delivery and I'll, I'll decide whether it's something for me or not. Oh. Darvish is with us as well. Uh, Isle of Man, is that? Isle of Man showing us an interest. West Midlands, West Glamorgan showing an interest in those. Join those who's already got it. Jan, you've got yours in the Isle of Man. My first ever pair of earrings, aside from the ones I got my ears pierced with, were from my dad. And he went and got them from the Isle of Man. Yep, he did like little running feet in a wee circle. And then I got really upset because I lost the, ba the backing to it. They were the tiniest little earrings, dainty little earrings. And I lost the backing and I thought that was them. I thought I couldn't use them. I didn't realise I could just put another backing on them. I cried so hard I could not find it on my carpet. Trying to find a butterfly earring ba backing when it's tiny, tiny on your carpet is just not good. Yeah. Well, it was impossible for me. I never found it. Yeah. Enjoy that. Right, it's time. It would look gorgeous with the lapis lazuli, actually. It's natural. It's all yours. It's Lapis Lazuli Premier. Oh, what a colour. Seriously, this afternoon, I could not get my head around this. My producer and myself... We're both looking at these and, um, and we were both wondering, they can't be natural, can they? For the amount that's on there, maybe, I have to be honest, maybe it's because we saw the price and we saw the, the, the piece and we thought for that price, these won't be natural. Boy, were we wrong. The price is fabulous. The quality is out of this world. When we showed it to our gemologist earlier today, oh my goodness, all we could talk about was the colour. We couldn't stop talking about the colour, the uniformity of colour, the strength of colour, the size of them, how uniform they are, everything that you look for in a rich blue, azure blue gem. And you have it, and boy oh boy. Now, if you're new to Children Maker, maybe you're a regular viewer, but you don't know much about lapis lazuli, this gemstone tends to have a lot of calcite, which is a lot of, so almost like a white, you probably go as far as, like a greyish white, um, quite a dark, quite a dull white um, that you get within the gem, which is lovely, it's just part of the gemstone. You get little flashes of gold through it, which is pyrite within the gemstone, so you get pyrite inside your lapis lazuli, and then within that, you've got this lovely, rich lapis lazuli blue, coming from the Greek words lapis and azura, uh, coming meaning blue so you've got really sizable rounds here and then you've got a gorgeous carrot weight the carrot weight is 90 carats of lapis lazuli there are 106 lapis lazuli is here for you as in opportunities we have 106 it's deep it's rich it's intense 
and it's six millimeter round with 90 carats. We're going down and boy oh boy will you fancy these. 0800 644 is our phone number to call us on or jewelrymaker.com. Whichever is more convenient for you, whichever you prefer, but you will need to get as quick as you can on these phone lines because these stones we know lapis lazuli, we know it's popular. We had some pairs on the other night of the green and the two-tone lapis lazuli. They sold out super quickly. But 90 carats for this colour, for this quality, this is not going to be here for long at all. Lovely to see so many of you involved. Thank you for joining us on our Jewelry Maker Night. W-O-K-Y. 62 is your code. Enjoy them, treat yourself. Look at the luster that they have. There's no polishing, there's no waxing, there's no oiling, nothing. That is a totally natural six millimeter round lapis lazuli. And the whole strand is there. It's rich, it's intense. And I'm gonna count them for you. In fact, I'm gonna get some tweezers and let's just do it. I folded it over. So let's see if we can do a little bit of a, let's line them up and see if we can count them a little bit quicker. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Oh no, I missed that there. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. How many are we on now? Thirty. Two, three. It's about thirty-three. Um, and then plus the other half of the strand. So it's about sixty-six that you've got on that strand. 66 lapis lazuli of that intensity of colour. Imagine just one of those is a little charm. One of those is a wee extra. Lots of you coming through already in Kent, in Greater Manchester and Kent. I would, you'd be thinking, really? I would print my authentic, or actually not print, we used to print. I would get these um, for 25 pence, your authenticity certificate. 25 pence. The only reason I say that is because these are natural and both my producer and I and our gemologist all had to look up and have a look at the, um, the information on the certificate to prove to ourselves that this intensity of colour, maybe it's because we knew the price as well though was natural. 1895. For that quality, for that strength of colour, that's what we would expect. That's what you're seeing available to you. Um, Greater London, Devon, West Lothian, you're with us as well. Um, no, there's something I saw earlier on the show and something that I, I knew about today was that today was midsummer madness and I don't think that's just to do with the weather. I think, I think it's got a little bit to do with maybe what my producers are allowed to do with the price. I mean, it could be wrong. Just putting that out there. Just dangling that little carrot. Is that an option? Is that a thought? Oh, I think it is. I see arrows. I see us going down. Which makes me think... 9.95. For the colour, the quality, everything we look... Are you shocked? Are you amazed? Do you know not what to say? As Shakespeare would say. At £9.95, pence, check it out as many you can. Enjoy it. Treat yourself. What do you reckon? We've only got about 100... Well, gosh, not even 100 of these anymore. Um, so for £9.95, pence, it's a quality in colour. If you have a look at lapis lazuli jewellery elsewhere, you'll know the prices you can pay. Karen, you've been playing with this, actually. Mm -hmm. Have you enjoyed it? Yes. How is it to work with? They're, they're lovely. The beautiful colours, and they're so... Um, uniform in their size and the colour. Yeah. No, not colour, the, the shine on them, but the, the colours that come through are so different. It's lovely. Yeah, the beautiful. lovely sort of golds that you see. The golds it. and the little crackles of silver that are coming through as well. It's, yeah, it's a joy. Can we, oh wow, we're having a wee sneaky peek now. That's lovely. Have you done sort of almost like a figure of eight? Yes. yes. Go, go, turn it, go for it. Thank you. That's stunning. Wire-wise, were the drill holes small or were they... No, they were a generous size. I've used they? 0.4 for the rosary links, but I think probably a 0.8 would have gone through. Right. Certainly a 0.6 Ooh. would go through, so they're a generous um, drill hole. It makes it a wee bit easier as a jewellery yes, maker if you've got lots of different options of what you can wire-wise and yes. what you can put through. Yeah. And maybe you could, could you doubly pass through sort of beading threads of different things as well? If yes, the holes a bit you bigger could like you'd that. probably get two, easily two lots of beading thread through. So it's um, leaving options really open on that one. And I'm just going to get two, four, six, eight. Did you use eight stones on that? I think it is. Yes. 
Because out of 33, that's a complete necklace. It looks divine. It's in Because of the strength of colour on them, it's really quite a strong look, isn't it? So yes. you don't actually... I mean, look how many you've got left. I know, a whole bag full. <laughs> that's about 15 pennies a stone huh. for totally natural in that quality and that colour. I mean, there's a lot... But that necklace, it doesn't look like... Oh, you've used the gemstones sparingly, does it? It looks like there's a lot on there. The colour, the impact is striking. And yet for only £9.95, I pay more than £9.95 for a piece of jewellery with an eight of those on there. Mm. I think that's a lovely piece. Mm. Mm. Matching earrings as well, but yeah. quite easily. You could do a set for, what, £15, £20 maybe? Easily. And we were, uh, bear in mind I'm basing that on the fact that these are only 9 95 and this is what I tell you not to do. Don't base it on the price that we're in. We should have been, what, 18 95 for that quality? That's what we were meant to be. Um, and we're under 10. So enjoy them, treat yourself. Don't miss out, whatever you do, because I don't think I can get any more, which is a sad thing. But also great, if you do manage to get it, I'll be over the moon for you. Really, really enjoy that. Deep azure blue is what we all crave for. It's what we look for in Lapis Lazuli. With the gold and pyrite, you do, as you say, Karen, you do get silvers and pyrite as well. Yes. So to get both of them, the silver, it's almost sometimes I think it looks like you've melted down gold and you've melted down platinum and you've swirled it together and then you made it go hard and that's what the little flat flakes are. It's almost like a little bit of both. Now, I have a thought. I have a few spaces. I've got lots of you who've got it already. I have a few spaces. I'm thinking that I would like to go lower. Is that wrong? Should we discuss it? I have a reason for why we should go lower. Let me think of one. Let me think of one. Um, yeah. Well, I could say it's Midsummer Madness, but I used that a minute ago to get it to 9 95. It's not going to work. Today, I became chairperson for youth opportunities in my Rotary Club. I think that deserves a price crash. <laughs> Why not? And my induction today. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Well done, you. Thank you. I think that deserves a price crash for everyone at home. <laughs> oh, you know you want to. Is he going to... Oh! Four pounds and ninety-five pence. Seriously. Uh -huh. Fine. Now you've worked with them. Would you expect that to be? I mean, what did you think when you were working with them? Did you think of price at all, or did that not even come into your it mind? It didn't come into my mind. No, you're just enjoying them. Yes. Yeah. I've enjoyed them a lot more. Four ninety-five. <laughs> 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 Lovely. I mean, what's that? It's not even eight pence a stone, is it? <laughs> Um, do join me though, you will need to check these all out because if there's any left at 4 95 I'll then have to maybe explain why I went to 4 95 and I don't know if my boss will be that fussed and um, I'm your <laughs> person of youth opportunities or not. <laughs> I think he'd be pleased for me, I don't think he'd be pleased that we just went down from 9 95 to, well 18 to then 9 and now to 4. However, I haven't seen him today and maybe I won't see him tomorrow so. Was he in a good mood earlier? No. Oh. Talking about tug of war, all right then. There we go, we've got a festival coming up, we're having a wee festival party, but I think I'm meant to be working, so I don't think I'll be there. Um, but Tom's allowed to go, because he's in the tug of war team. Right. He's, um, he's tall, see, if only I was tall and strong, maybe they would want me in the tug of war team, Karen. You couldn't even be an anchor, could you? No. You're too small. Well, I was thinking I could like, just lift my feet off the ground and put all my weight on it, but then I didn't, I didn't know, it didn't work. Then Tom, one of the gents, um, the broadcasting engineer, man who does sorts of everything, um, he said I could maybe cheer. I could cheer, cheer them, cheer them on. Yay! <laughs> hey ho! <laughs> I used to be a cheerleader for St. Mirren basketball team. Yeah. With pom poms. With wee pom poms. Mm -hmm. We made our own pom poms. They were from bin bags, plastic bags. We cut them up, made pom poms. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Why not? Uh, four pounds and eight You need to get these as soon as you can as an add to order, a start your try us on for the first time. We've got a really, really short break. I don't want to have one, but 
probably should to make up for this price. Oh, I need to think about what my excuse is going to be. We do need to discuss this, don't we? I've got some chocolates and sweets. I started a diet today. It's just to be healthy. I'm not having any chocolate or sweeties or sugar. No, I don't want them. Nope. I was about to come on TV and I've got a big box of chocolate rolls, peanuts and shortbread chocolates in them and I didn't eat them and I had a bix of the Wheata. No sugar on it, no, literally, oh. semi skim milk and a bix of the Wheata bit. Bix. Wheat. That's all I've had. I'm behaving myself so far. I had a salad for my lunch and soup. What did I have for breakfast? Oh, I had a rice cracker, two rice crackers with nut butter. Yeah. Ooh, we'll see what happens at 10 o'clock at night. <laughs> I'll be like, give me my chocolates. <laughs> Feed me. <laughs> I can't even do a day. I haven't even got through half a day and I'm proud of myself. Um, why don't you drop me a wee message? Have you ever kept a New Year's resolution? That's a funny one. Six months into the year. What? Two weeks my producers lasted. If you want to know what that was, join us on the other side of the break. Colombian Emerald Serpentine coming your way. Premier Abalone prayers. So much. Oh, those amethysts are amazing. They're coming up. Got appetite. Oh, got loads. See on the other side. And of course, don't forget, we've got our kit with Karen. You can't be going anywhere. Wire bundles, wire DVDs. Oh, it's awesome. See you in a sec. There are two easy ways you can purchase from Jewelry Maker. You can watch our show on Sky, Virgin, Freeview and Freesat and call our free phone number where you'll be put through to our friendly help team who can place your order. Alternatively, you can go to our website and click to register. Once you've filled in the required details, you can start shopping. You can watch the show by clicking on the Watch Live Show button on the home page. You can also use our quick search tool and narrow down your results. Once you have found an item that you like, simply click on the Add to Basket button and you can continue shopping or check out right away. Don't forget you can add as many items to your basket per day for only one P&P. Enjoy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Emerald is a member of the Beryl family. It's one of the only gemstone families named for its chemical composition, beryllium aluminium silicate. Emeralds often display free phase inclusions, and these can include a liquid filled cavity, which can sometimes have either a little gas bubble or even a crystal, and it's really interesting to see in the case of emerald, because as you turn the stone, the elements within the inclusions can actually move as well. The finest examples of emerald do come from Colombia still, and there's quite an array of colours in the different tones of green. Other localities for emerald include Pakistan and Namibia. When you place your first order with Jewelry Maker, we'll send you a free DVD and booklet to help you get started. The booklet is jam-packed full of information on gemstones, tools, threading, materials and findings. There are step-by-step -step instructions on how to make bracelets, earrings and necklaces. And the DVD includes easy-to-follow video tutorials. So what are you waiting for? Start your jewelry making journey today. Why, hello there. How are you doing? It's Midsummer Madness and boy, oh boy, we've got craziness going on for you tonight. So many fabulous deals, so many treats. Did I mention that between nine and uh, maybe just after, I might have a little bit of a mini clearance on a particular gemstone? Can you guess what gemstone that might be? Maybe it's your favourite. 
Could be. What's your favourite? Drop us a message. Can you guess what our mini clearance is today? It's coming up just after nine o'clock, but nine just after. We'll do a wee mini cheeky clearance on one particular gemstone variety. And boy, oh boy, is it good. And boy, oh boy, is it popular. 60777, text is in. JM Studio at the start of your text. Your normal network charge will apply. Or jewelrymaker.com or in the app, whichever is most convenient for us. For you, sorry, get in contact and also reject texting in tonight is what was your first job? My, mine was selling programs um, at a football game on Saturday and Tuesdays. Producer Toms was working in an old folks' home serving tea and cake. Um, and he got to watch TV all day, he said it was a good job. Um, you're supposed to talk to people. Um, and then you've got, mm. and then you watched old films. All oh, right, I like it. And Karen's first job was, I've just, just gone out of my head. Selling Christmas cards. Packs Selling Christmas, Christmas cards. cards. Packs of Christmas cards on a Saturday. Oh, what was your first job, Sam? Do you remember? I was a party host. A party host. How fun. I think your job's just trumped all of ours. <laughs> that sounds like awesome fun. Oh, brilliant. Love it. We're finding out jobs. Um, what was your first ever job? Have a look at this. Because we're doing wire work. Oh, yeah. This launched on the birthday show, which was on the 4th of May. Actually, we had a birthday week. Six days, just shy of a week. Six days for our birthday this year. A little bit, little bit like the Queen. We tried to long it out and stretch out as long as we could. Um, well, it was fabulous. I wasn't complaining. Loads and loads of treats were coming our way. The Rachel Norris Wirework Bird DVD. Oh, my word. Everybody loved it. It flew out, and we've just got it back in stock. Woohoo! Um, this is an amazing treat which you cannot miss. It's a gorgeous piece. This is taking your jewellery making to the next level. It really, really is. It's got an introduction to it, the structure, weaving, embellishing the body, embellishing the wings, and then embellishing, uh, assembling, sorry, the bird and putting it all together. So you've got different sections <coughs> and they're all individual on the DVD so you can skip them if you've watched one and you can move to the next part. Oh, sorry, it's clear, sorry. Do you know what it is? I've been talking about DVDs all week. I've um, been talking about DVDs literally before I came on. I'm meant to be filming a DVD with Rachel Norris on Friday night. That's where it came from. My apologies, sincere apologies. Um, Claire and Eleanor on the DVD for you. That's what happens when you're trying to talk about two DVDs in one day. And they've got a seven DVD bundle, oh gosh. Um, Oh, there we go. Forgive me, please, please accept my sincere apologies. Oh, how gorgeous. Now, this is a DVD that I do not have because it sold out so quickly. So if you're in the same boat as me and you missed it, maybe you just love Claire, probably love Rachel as well, um, £4.95, pens. you've got your DVD, which has got hours of tutorial, a whole, well, a whole hour, we can't go over an hour on the DVD, it only takes an hour's worth of footage on it. Um, and you've got yourself the option of creating this divine bird. And so many people wanted it. Over 700 in the launch, wasn't it? 700 were allocated in the launch. That's how popular this DVD is. And that was back in May when we, we had our birthday. So do be reminded, a couple of months on, if you haven't yet got it and you fancied it, or maybe you, you've had one of your friends, or maybe uh, on the, the Facebook community, I know you're on the, the Facebook community there, Karen, maybe you've heard people talking about it and thought, actually, you know what, I might give that DVD a go. I might, I might try and make something like that. I mean, it is something pretty spectacular. It is. Make a nice gift as well. Wouldn't it somebody. just? Mm. And if you know somebody, for example, that likes wire work like Karen, like you do, mm -hmm. then maybe that's a thought to give somebody, maybe you don't know what wires they have or they don't have, or you don't know about their tools, what they might have or what they might already have, so you might not want to get something they've already got. A DVD like this, when it only launched on our birthday, it's a limited amount of people manage to get it. Maybe that would be, that's a lovely thought, Karen. Mm -hmm. I mean, a nice treat for the summer. Maybe you're not going away over the holidays or maybe you are. Um, maybe you want to get something, maybe you're going to a caravan or somewhere, a static caravan or somewhere where you could take jewellery making with you, or maybe you're not going anywhere. Maybe you're thinking, oh, I'll go out in the sunshine, but if the sunshine's not there, you might want to do some projects. However, you could still do it in the garden if you've got one of these fancy laptops and you could sit and put it in the laptop and do it in the garden. That would be fun. I don't have a garden, so I can't do that. My parents have a garden, though. I'm going to go all the way up to Scotland just to hang out in their garden. <laughs> right, a lapis lazuli, sorry, we've had lapis lazuli, those of you asking, it's already gone, however, if you have a look on the, the 
Julian Maker page, JulianMaker.com, or have a look uh, with the Speak with the Contact Centre, they can help you. Now, this is a Labradorite bundle. Have you ever even seen one? A bundle of pure Labradorite. Nothing not else but bundle. Labradorite. Not a bundle. No. It's a wee bit cheeky, this one, Karen. I've got oh. a tassel strand of ovals. <gasps> look at the peaches and oranges and blues and yellows and greens coming through from here. This is a strand of Everest. So when look at the shiller going on here. Oh, wow. Let me turn that around. Maybe you can see it from the, the different angle. Ooh. So there's strand numero uno, meaning one. Second strand, fat. Whoa. Ooh, look at the blues here. Faceted rounds and what I call the golf ball facet because it reminds me of the dimples that you get in the golf ball. Might be alone with Ooh, that. Some blue, beautiful blues. They are amazing. Yeah. It doesn't seem to come across on the TV quite so well. Maybe you, you see a couple of them, but it literally is exploding, isn't it? Mm. There's so much going on. Then, aha, a heart strand of Labradorite. Oh. We do that. Have you seen a heart of Labrador? No, we don't do no, them often. No, I've, d I've not seen those. They're very, very rare. Then, five, there's more. I told you, a Labrador bundle. Five, if I move, my ha move them along my hand, five half drilled Labrador rounds. Oh. <sighs> likey? Uh, very much. Very much likey. Then, if that wasn't enough, wait till you see these. Look at this one on its own. Hello. Wow. <laughs> Just wow. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, these are so gorgeous. I've got so much lapis lazuli in my hand. So lapis lazuli, so much Labrador in my hand I don't know what to do with. This is a treat and a half. I've got rounds going everywhere. So we've got half drilled. We've got the faceted rounds are coming in at eight mil. There's 15, 15 carats on the plain rounds. That's not right. Must be 150. There's not 15 carats on there. Um, that must be wrong. 170 carats of the puffy hearts at 12 mil. 240 carats of the fat. Oh, there they are. 240 carats. Oh, that's what it is. These five, that's right. These are eight mil. And these are, I was gonna say that's not right. I was looking at this strand and so fasted rounds. Um, the half drill plain rounds, forgive me, I read that information far too fast. These are 8 mil and you get 5 of them at 15 carats across the 5. You've got here, fasted at 10 mil, 240 carats. First one's already gone, well done to you, congratulations. 60 carats in the plain ovals, which is the first strand. And then you've got these gorgeous hearts, it's amazing. It's literally Labradorite love we've got going on here. Now, I cannot get my head around the price for all of it. I mean, they are mesmerizing. But just get another one of these fabulous, almost like slices of, of Labradorite. They're so huge. Oh, where's your Schiller? Come, come now. It's so, so, there it is. There it is. You don't have to look for it hard when you look with your naked eye, but when you're trying to show across television, the strip lighting, tends to somewhat take away the, the fun and, and natural phenomenon, which makes sense because the television is not designed for natural phenomena, is it? Now, this is the gemstone bundle uh, of 1,065 carats. It's got a variety of shapes, sizes, textures, facets, um, and plain. And add to that the fact that your producer put this bundle together. It wasn't given to him. He put it all together. He invented it for you. And then add to that the fact that it's a favourite gemstone 2012, 13 and 14 of jewellery makers. Oh and Karen's, mm. is this your favourite yeah. gem? <gasps> See, I'm still learning about Karen. Karen and I, this is our first time meeting ever today, which is an yeah. absolute pleasure. Um, and if you're the same as me, maybe you're new to jewellery maker, do send your messages in um, and we'll do a get to know Karen in the seven o'clock hour. I think that might be fun. Do you like that? Mm-hmm, that's fine. Perfect. Now, she hasn't been on the show. She's been on. This is her fourth show. Um, however, lots of us can't watch all day, every day. And it's her first evening show. So for all our regular evening viewers, if you're thinking, I want to know about Karen. I want to get to know her. So uh, so do I. So £39.95 for over 1,065 carats of possibly the most 
coveted lapis lazuli shapes, sizes, facets. It's wonderful. Out in Kent, you've got yours, Shropshire, you've got yours, Greater London, Surrey, Dorset, you're in as well. What a treat. That is a big, big bundle for just one post and packaging, one price point. Well done to those of you who've got that. I'm over the moon for you. I think it's a lovely bundle. Do you like that bundle? Seems as you like Labradorite. That's a lovely bundle. To and to go with cabochons as well to um, compliment, them. compliment them and act as accents. Definitely. Really nice. Ooh, a lot of love for this. So enjoy that if you manage to get it. A massive congratulations to you. Don't forget, we've got our Colombian emerald. You haven't even seen it yet. Have you ever seen this colour ever in a Colombian emerald? It is the strongest rich greens we've ever seen, I think, on Julian Maker. We were talking about this with our gemologist earlier. They are so intense. A lot of love for these. And then the abalone is coming up too as well. That will be, oh, what a perfect combination to put these two together. So complimentary. Wow, right, let's do this light blue coloured wine that I've got in. I've done this before and bought, in fact, I think I launched it. And it was so popular. Every time we have it, it sells out and they reorder it and then I happen to get it again. It's really, really fortunate for me, actually. Unfortunate for anyone who doesn't watch the evening show on our shift side, but fortunate for, for you if you watch because you've got the chance to get it. Um, these are so so popular these silk wire so it's wire underneath and then it's covered with genuine silk how pretty is that have you not no they always Very sell few out. people have <laughs> yeah i was going to say i think only one of the guest designs that i know is used because they were using it with us on the show so we cut it open because it was brand new we hadn't seen it before so we cut it open and they did the most wonderful sort of gizmo coil and it coiled back on itself and it made little sections of links in right. between the jewelry it's on facebook actually i think on our facebook page somewhere it was you have to search for it though i think it was a couple of weeks back now um, in fact when was the first date this launched will we be able to find it via that look on facebook oh somebody's turned the sound on on this i don't know how to turn it on oh there we go sound off wonderful just in case i end up start playing a game or something it starts beeping you never know Probably set an alarm or something. I'm not very good with these things. Um, 10 metres. What was the date? Sorry, you just told me. 14th of May this launch with myself. Oh, it was a Saturday. It was very, ah. very popular. 0.5 millimetre gauge for the wire. And it's 10 metres that you get in length. And it's only 4.95. So for 0.5 mil wire, do you think it's 0.4 then? Because we've color covered it in silk, it's made it at Probably. a point one of a millimetre thicker. It quite flexible as well? It's the same as normal wire. Can I cut this one open? Or how about I just take a wee bit from it? If I take a wee bit from it, it's fine. I can't get it out. Oh, that's because I'm pulling the wrong bit. Thank you. Oh, actually, I want to use these pliers. I'm going to give you a wee bit so you can have a play with can if you want. Oh. If I can get it out, that is. I need to get round the... Is this wise? While I'm fiddling, you go to a picture. Thanks for that. I'm just trying to see where it is. I'm not sure. I think I'm going to have to cut it open. Have we got many, Tom? 95, we've got fine. On my head, be it. <laughs> Cutters. In fact... Oh... <laughs> Did that get you? It's okay. I am so sorry. It's right. no, it's okay. Oh my gosh, your first night in the show and I attack her with the cup. There we go. Thank Have a much. play. Thank you. I'm so sorry. Don't worry. <laughs> Flying bits of plastic, my apologies. So you can't take me anywhere. It's still stuck in my hair, so if you see anything... It's no, 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 it's down <laughs> in the air. <laughs> it, it got in the oh. hair and then it bounced out. But have a wee bit. What do you think? That's nice. Do you like it? Yeah. Go have a wee play. I will. I've got the other bit off as well. Da, da, da. Thank you, Sam. Sam's just caught a money spider for me. <laughs> oh, Sam, I love you. Sam's scared of spiders just like I am. She can see good at saving other people. She just saved me. I love you. And then she literally just ran away and was like, oh. <laughs> um, Wonderful, thank you so much. Oh, I'm not good with money spiders. Thank you, Sam's as, as red as I feel. Um, wonderful, right. White shell drop. Oh, they are gorgeous. Imagine those with little bits of that wire that you've got, Karen. 
What do you think? Oh. Quite nautical? Very. Very nautical. Oh. Oh. Oh, I like these. These are really nice. Thank you for saving me there. I don't like things that legs move faster than normal. Don't think it's normal. So teachers is fine. Like spiders, things that move, like daddy long legs and th things with like really tiny legs. But they've got big legs though. I don't like thin legs, thin small little, leave me alone. <laughs> but 16 by 10 millimeter for is a white shell drop. Um, CYPO31 is your code. These are lush. They are genuine white shell and they are just divine. Should we put a different background behind it? Because they are white against a white background, that's probably not the best way to show them off. What was I thinking? In fact, I wasn't. I was thinking about spiders. Um, there was a problem. These are fat. I want to count them. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 20. They've actually got, I don't know if you can see, but they've got these wonderful swirling marks within them. Like actual shell. Because they are genuine shell, but I don't know if you can see these sort of swirling marks. It's just coming across as a sort of block colour on the TV, but you can maybe slightly see the sort of swirls on them. Can you see? They're more predominant when you look at them with your own naked eye. And this one as well, actually, I don't know, I'll try and bring this one over. There's loads of gorgeous swirls going on here. They're not plain, they're really lovely. Can you see that there? It's really nice. Really like these and very sizable. So that's 20 drops coming your way. And we're looking for only what? Six pounds and 95 pence. That's not normal. This is fabulous. 34 pennies each. I like it quite like that. Something in between. I think that's really, really cool. Um, great to see you. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for joining us on the phone lines and the web. Make sure whatever you do, you do not miss out. It's £6 in it. I can't get my head around that. Knowing how much you can pay for shells elsewhere. Have you ever been outside and gone to the sort of seaside or a seaside town and they've got shells to sell? Oh, that was quite hard to say. Shells to sell. Mm -hmm. They sell seashells by the seashore. Um, these, £9.95. pence. You could pay £5, £10 for shells elsewhere, can't you? And for £6.95, pence, you've got a whole strand of 20 shell drops. I've got a lot of love for these. Making me very, very happy. What would you do with these, Karen, if you got a hand of a half a chance? I think you could use those uh, in quite a classic, mm -hmm. um, even just knotted, even though they're sort of drops, you could a uh, very classic style, or go really over the top and very contemporary and add some brighter coloured, they'd go lovely with a lapis. Oh yeah, wouldn't they? Mm. Lapis slash that, which has already gone back because it was super popular. These are lovely and I really, really like them. I'm over the moon if you manage to get them. They've got a lovely weight to them mm. as well, I think that feels I quite pens. nice. Yeah, lovely, sizeable, smooth. They've got a really good texture to them. I really like it. Now, at 16 by 10 millimeter, for that price, lots of you've got it. Georgina's in, Geraldine's in, West Yorkshire, Mary and Jerry are in, Hertfordshire, Aziza's in. Ah, oh, Aziza, that's a lovely name. In Farsi, Aziza means darling. Aziza, that's a beautiful name. I love that. Love that you were first in in Kent, loving your work. Lots and lots of treats coming your way now. Don't. Oh, that's just perfect. Can I show you what I've got coming up together with my pink tourmaline? Because this just looks fabulous. Wait till you see this. Look at this as a combination. We'll do the rose quartz at 9.30 for you tonight. Rose quartz drums. I've never brought them to you. There's a first. Rose quartz I haven't brought you. Say what? Pink tourmaline and these huge, looking at the quality of those amethysts. Do you like those? Love amethysts. Do you? And nice with the pearls. Oh, yes. Loads of treats coming up your way tonight. So let's take away the rose quartz and the amethyst and let's just do the rarity that is pink tourmaline. In fact, there's something else coming up tonight that would look lovely with that too. Oh! <gasps> 
I don't think I've ever done Appetite and Pink Tourmaline together and I think it's now one of my new favourite combinations. What do you think? Do you like? Appetite's coming up for you tonight as well as a star buy. That'll be around 8.30. What do you think? Very lovely. I love the Appetite. Isn't it gorgeous? Faceted it draw. really well with the pink. Yeah, they look great together, don't they? Oh, it's my new favourite combination. Well, so far. <laughs> I've got a long show to go, you never know. Lots of hours still to play. <gasps> are, they, are these natural? You are... Whoa, 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 stop, stop, please stop. I'm not going to wave goodbye to them. No. They are so... Do you know, I got a strand of 16 centimetres, 16 centimetres with a two-inch extender chain, for £24 of pink tourmaline. <coughs> <gasps> and it was nuggets just like these. You are, and they weren't even as strong a pink as these. You are having a kid on. You are giving away pink tourmaline. Oh my word. This is arguably one of the rarest collectible tourmalines in the world. It's natural and it's yours for one of the most easy price points on jewelry maker isn't it it's an easy price point i genuinely think it could be fair to say this for pink tourmaline is a no-brainer usually it's super considered have you ever seen pink tourmaline for 15 pounds never mind 6.95 oh, i'm so envious only because i know i paid more elsewhere and that was with the company where we buy it through and that was at staff discount so you've got a brilliant deal. I hope you don't mind me saying that. I don't usually like to comment on the deal, but I genuinely feel this is fabulous. It uh, is. <laughs> you think? <laughs> oh, yes. Whether you know pink tourmaline or not, if you don't, I don't think you've any idea of what you've just managed to achieve. Congratulations to you. That is a stormer. I would get that valued and appraised. Put it with pearls, put it in jewellery, silver findings or gold findings and have that valued and appraised. And then I would keep it for myself because I'm just, I like it. Right. Oh, you ready for a star buy? Really? All right then. Abalone under 10. No. Is it? <laughs> This is fabulous. These are 12 by 8 millimeter in your size. They are flat pairs of abalone, and boy, oh boy, are these popular. Wait, you see. The color is there. They are really, really spectacular in their display of color. What color can't you see? You've got a triplet here. Do you know what a triplet is? It simply means there's three layers. So you've got yourself your <laughs> abalone shell on top, then you've got a piece in between to stick the two to. It's not as simple as that, but that's a, a splitting it down base, uh, to make it very basic, just so we all know what a triplet is. It's three parts to it, and that means it's double-sided for your abalone. Abalone. So you've got 12 by 8 millimeter in their pairs, and boy, oh boy, are these popular. Sorry, that was me not putting that toolkit back together properly. They all fell out. It's all right, it's all gravy. So, I've got plenty of people at home who've got colours that work with abalone. Have you got any purple? Oh, it'll work. Have you got green? Oh, that'll work too. <gasps> Yellow? That'll work too. Gold? Oh, that'll work too. Blue? Ah, uh, you see, that's going to work as well. Purple, yep, that too. Black, you see, that's gonna work as well. Orange, oh, I'm really sorry to say, it's gonna work with that as well. It's gonna work with everything. It's the ultimate gemstone strand. It goes with a bit, it, sorry, t-shirt yarn. Well, yeah, go with all the colors of t-shirt yarn. All the ones coming up tonight anyway. 
Yeah, I've got t-shirt yarn just like that, putting it out there. T-shirt yarn coming your way. Let's get all the colours going on. Fancy some t-shirt yarn in your life? I hope so, because it's coming up. Love t-shirt yarn. It's one of my favourite things. Oh, look at that one! Your abalone will go with all of them. Is there anything abalone won't go with? Can't think of anything. I can't think of anything. Do you like an abalone, Karen? You partial yes, to an abalone? Very much so, because yeah. as you said, because it goes with everything. It does. Every colour. That's a good that's a good thought then. So it means if you're a regular viewer, you'll maybe have other treats at home. If you're a brand new viewer, it means you can wear it on it. You don't have to put it with anything, you wear it on its own. But it's good that if you might have something you could put it with. You could just go with anything. It just goes with absolutely anything. That's a positive, isn't it? If I've ever heard one. So it's going to go with everything. Oh, hold on a minute then. What about the shape? Do we like a pear shape? I think, I think the pear shape's super elegant. I was just say, it's really elegant, really feminine, isn't it? Yeah. And, yeah. and quite the, dainty and delicate. Delicate, dainty, feminine, elegant. Did I mention elegant? For six ninety-five. Enjoy them. We're doing everything we can to make it as affordable and as appealing as possible. Um, but just because we have it and we want it to be shared, we don't want it to go back to the vault. Because the vault is great, the people there are fabulous, but if you're jewellery, you want to be worn as a gemstone. You want to be made into jewellery. You don't just want to sit there and be like, someone work with me, please. Uh, 246810. 246810. Two, four, six, eight, ten, two, four, five. Is that 35? Is it or 25? Sounds like 35. Good. We think 35. Pennies of 20 pence, Mac, well, 19 pence each. 19.8 pence each. Let's call it 20 pence. Let's push the boat out and call it 20 pence. So a pair of earrings, if you use one in each ear, you'll be looking at 40p. 40 pence. I appreciate you're going to have the rest of your earring findings, but that allows mm. you to charge quite an affordable price point yes. for earrings, and you don't need to do a lot. They do a lot yeah. on their own. Even if you just made, what was that, 35? So if you made 15, 16, 17, 17 and a half. Okay, get rid of that. 17 pairs of earrings... Imagine you charged, what, a, what'd you say you just charged a pound each? Who would charge a pound for a pair of abalone mm. earrings? I know, but I'm being redonkulous. If you're not confident in your jewellery making, you're thinking, well, I don't know if anyone will buy them. It's my first thing I've ever made. Should I? If you say you charge, and I don't think you should, but this is far too low, but imagine you just charged a pound. That would be 17 pounds. And the strand's only 6.95. And if you've had any of our earring deals, brilliant. If you haven't, you can make earrings out of wire. But Karen earring. has tonight in the show. Earring paintings, yeah. Yeah, you can, can't you? Certainly, yeah. So What's easy. a good gauge of wire to do it um, with? 0.8. Right. Um, but I often use one mil. There I we like go. one mil. It's nice and strong. It looks good. It's sturdy. Um, so you don't need much, a couple of inches, and you've got an earring painting. There you go. So you might be sitting at home just now thinking, actually... You know what, I've got loads of wire, one mil or 0.8 mil sitting at home. Haven't done anything with that. Grab yourself a strand, grab yourself some, you know, some of your own wire from your stash and just make some earrings. Treat yourself, treat other people, make some jewellery for friends and family. Make a nice gift. That'd be lovely. You don't have to have a reason to buy somebody a present or to make somebody a gift. Any reason's a reason, just to say, you're awesome, I love you, thanks very much for being my friend. Why not? Right! I love this. I really love this. In my bag, in the, in the changing room, actually, I've got a t-shirt, two t-shirt yarn pieces of jewellery, actually. Two t-shirt yarn necklaces. Love them. Love the launch of it. Actually, one of them is with white t-shirt yarn. If my memory serves me correctly, Gemma Crow made it. And I love it. Did I mention I like t-shirt yarn? I think it's so good. I was super excited when I found out that we had a bundle of it tonight. And I've got a Kumihimo disc, if you wish. 
and cord endings. Now, I don't know if you've used t-shirt yarn before. Oh my word. I put a picture on the, the Facebook page ages ago. Um, I'll put it on again, actually, tonight when I get home, of myself. Oh, have I still got it? I think I might have deleted it. I'll find it myself lying flat along the row on the, on the ground with a whole yarn of t-shirt yarn completely straight out. It's a whole full length of me. It's an alley length. It's an alley length. A length of alley is one t-shirt yard. It's, uh, well, I'm 5.4 inches and a half. Sam's got a wonderful thought for you. Now, this was made by um, De Brudge. Let me show you this. Yeah. It was from a pillow. She made a pillow because we're having a, a home show kind of idea. And she made this from T-shirt yarn, the red one. A big heart to put on your pillow. Oh, How cool is sweet. That? That's lovely. T-shirt yarn is so easy to work. Even I can do it. And if I can work with T-shirt yarn, anybody can. Yes, even you, Producer Tom. Seriously. It's genuinely fun. It's easy to do. And you don't, do you know what? You don't actually have to even do a lot with it. I've got one of the pieces. It's just literally, it's just two threads of it with a, a pendant on it. It's so lovely. And it's like a T-bar pendant, like a toggle. T-bar toggle, and it makes it the pendant. It's so fun. You've got here, your Kumihimo cord endings and your Kumihimo disc as well. So these are coming with it. It's a great bundle. You can use the Kumihimo disc with it if you wish. You're getting two, four, six, eight, nine individual t-shirt yarns. They're all single colours aside from this one, which just looks like a seashell, doesn't it? Something you would see at the beach. Well, the shape of it and the colours, maybe not the actor. You're not going to actually see that on a beach. I'd be very excited if I went to the beach and saw loads of t-shirt <laughs> yarn. T-shirt yarn. Like, brilliant. The ship like a t-shirt yarn. Yeah. Um, Shirley in Cambridge has messaged in to say, um, GM, uh, GM should do something. Ali, what time are you doing the t-shirt yarn? Yeah, uh, please. Great show so far. And hello and welcome to Karen for the first, uh, first time meeting her from Shirley in Cambridgeshire. Thank you. So uh, Karen says thank you and hi back. She did, but then obviously now, now she's back to the wire working. She said it a moment ago. <laughs> no, you're fine, you're fine. We came to you after you said it. Um, so apologies. Um, thank you so much for getting in touch with us tonight. We love a wee bit of t-shirt yarn. Isn't it fun? If you've ever worked with t-shirt yarn, tell me your favourite thing about it. Drop us a message because there'll be a lot of people watching tonight who have never, ever tried t-shirt yarn and don't have a scooby what to do with it. They are brilliant. They really, really are. All of it together should be £56.45. However, it's my producer Tom's bundle and he can do what he wants. And he literally is. I, I think I imagine Martin Smith liking this purely because of the graduation of tone of colour. £34.95 for what was it? Nine, two, four, six, eight. It was nine individual. You can call them skeins if you wish. However, you wish to know them. But you were getting about. Well, what's that? Five meters on it? Five meters on each one? Because I'm five meters and four inches. And it's the length of me. That's how you undo it. And then you've got the option here to just separate it like so. It's really, really lovely. They're all individual. They've got little ties in them. You can just untie them to start working with them. So that's obviously tying it all together. So you would just untie that and start working with it and enjoy it. Oh, I love it. Have you tried t-shirt yarn no, before? No, I haven't. Oh my God. Have you ever felt it? No. Does it feel really this silky? Can. It's lovely. It's really lovely. Oh, it's so light. Yeah. As well. It's literally t-shirts. Yeah. It's beautiful. I would crochet with that. Would you? Mm. A big and open crochet. Oh. That's lovely. I love those colours. They're lovely aren't together, they? aren't they? Yeah. Baby blues. Baby boy blues. And yes. Yeah. Nice colours all together. Great for Very new beginnings. Perfect for the summer. Do you know what I would do? I know how to t-shirt yarn. I know how to t knit, finger knit with t-shirt yarn. But genuinely, there's this particular brand for £59 
they sell bracelets that wrap around your wrist twice with a popper on it and it's it's like um it's not leather but it's that kind of idea and it's split into five sections and it's five sections that are all separate and then they come together so it wraps around your wrist twice and they've got sparkles on it so you could do that and literally just put it around your wrist wrap it around your wrist twice and just sew gemstones into mm. it and that particular designer brand maybe you wouldn't even need that many maybe you could just half it and just have some strands it's so comfortable to wear you can create really big loops with t-shirt mm. yarn and it's super light well you saw how much that yes. how light that was yeah it's lovely you can add gemstones and just wrap oh my gosh i want my jewelry out my bag so i can show you if we recap it i'm gonna go and get it i don't want to let it go i love it i'm not gonna no How many are there left? I, really, I didn't even see the price. I don't even think I looked at it. Did I say that? 34 in fact, I want this. I really want this. Okay. I really want it. Will I give it to Sam or do you want me to put it over here? Give it to Sam. Thank you, Sam. <laughs> They're balancing wow. in between your fingers. Right, loads and loads coming up for you. Colombian Emerald is one opportunity to time. Look at this colour. Oh, the deepest, strongest, richest, natural Colombian emeralds. Ten carats, they're just divine. Wait till you see these. Have you ever seen a Colombian emerald that intense in colour? Cannot wait. Not yet though. One opportunity's time. Silver gold and rose gold connect. Oh! These are, I'm going to get my wee... Um, Matt for you these are fabulous so you've got each color has the same one somebody's gonna mix these all up all right let's get in here do 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 oh so I'm gonna get a wee bit of each one so you've got the rounds and so you get the storage box in this as well which I always find a bit awesome because you don't end up really paying for the storage box I don't think when you get these findings depends you can have a look at the price points and see what you think you've got hearts you've got rounds you've got what I know is a paisley pattern you've got triangular shapes or diamond shapes in there as well Woo! these are like crinkle cut crisps but they're not they're the rounds what do you think you know the healthy ones yeah you know you get those baked ones the healthy baked ones which are like sour cream and chive yeah those ones so I've got it in every colour I think I, have I missed one no I think I've got them all oh there we go so yeah oh that's brilliant showing them all there actually you're getting all the different colours you've got the rose gold you've got yourself the gold colour and you've got yourself the silver so there's the other rounds so 200 pieces in total so they're double sided. Can you see the connector holes in there? And you've got these ones. These are like almost like wafers the way they're connected, uh, the way they are. They're like a wafer that you put with your ice cream. You've got the hearts. They're wonderfully textured. Look at those. Whoa, it's almost like gold leaf, isn't it? The way that's been textured. You've got little spots on these ones, like little raindrops in the leaves. 1995 for two hundred textured connectors they're all textured in different ways they're all full of quality they go up all the way from the smallest which i believe is around 12 millimeter up to the largest which is eight, uh, 22 by 11 millimeter so very very sizable for all of these you're getting all the different colors i love this loving all the different textures this one's almost like an animal print it looks a bit more like an animal print in the silver actually so even though they're the same connectors not these two sorry the one i'm about to get for you in the silver it looks different actually just the way it's been textured the texture is the same but I, I notice it differently on the silver i don't know why and you've got the rose gold as well all the different colors you get 10 of each one which is why you're getting 200 in total and they are brilliant connectors 0 0.09 of a penny each gosh that's a saving isn't it or you could look on it in another way in that 20 at a pound each and the rest are free that means you get 
183. <laughs> That's fabulous, isn't it? If you want to do, and you can make necklaces with connectors, can't you? You can just connect them all the connect way around. Them all the way around, yeah. And you could do the three tone necklaces, which are super popular at the moment. All the different colours, you can do one of each one and then alternate that all the way around with different shapes. 200 of them is plenty to get your teeth into. Are you into connectors? Do you like connectors, Karen? I haven't used them. No. But I look, I look, they're, they're really, really good. They'd be a, a real statement they would, as a they? necklace. Even the colours graduated together would be lovely. I like that. I think mm. that's a great idea. Graduate the colours, you've got 200 to play with. I don't think you'll get bored <laughs> for £20. Absolutely pounds. not. No, no. no. You've got plenty to be getting on with. Even if you just think, actually, I want, I'm just making those into earrings. You don't, heaven forbid I say this, we don't actually need gemstones, do you? Some people don't want gemstones in their jewellery. They just want jewellery. They just want finding. Imagine gold findings with that connected to the gold finding. And then if you wished, a little droplet from a gemstone from below, like a, a, just a simple wrap loop, and you've got stuff, a, a really stylish pair of earrings, and you've got the option to make 200 pairs. Well, I tell you, that would be 100 pairs, because you, yes. you need two for each ear. Well, depending on what you want to do, you might not need two for each ear. You might only have one ear pierced. You might be gang bang off. <laughs> you might be. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready for a star buy? Well, you're, you're going to have to wait because it's not coming up until about half past seven. But I do have a showstopper for you. Yeah. I could not believe this earlier today. When I came to work, well, I'm always excited when I come to work. Let's put it that way. That's, that's a given. However, when I find out what our star buys are, I get really excited. Then when I find out what our super showstopper is, oh, it makes my day every time. And the buying team always giggle at me, I think, because I'm always popping in their office, showing them what I've got and, and getting excited and asking their opinion on it. Purely because, well, they've gone through the process of choosing it, deciding to buy it, and then for me it's lovely for them to see what actually has, has been delivered. Obviously what they see at the time they're hoping to get, they're hoping to get that's exactly what they, they ask for, that's what they expect. But, well, I think it's always nice to see the fruits of your hard work, so I always love to take it and, and show it to the team. This strand, in fact, I launched... Um, and it's super popular. When I originally launched this, there was what, 85 or 86 of these available. And this is a reorder of that same strand. Now, when I launched it, it was in 2015. Um, and it sold out instantly. So if you've just tuned in, have a look. If you've been watching since 5 o'clock, I can't believe it's quarter to 7 already. Uh, you've been watching this all night already. Um, we've been giving you a heads up on this. She knew it was coming. So it was August in 2015 when I last had it. 2015. That's a really, really long time, isn't it? August, two th that's just shy of a year, isn't it? A whole year. Imagine you got this last year and oh, look at that color. That's what we were all talking about with the buying team. We've had lovely Colombian emeralds with great clarity in them of, of late. However, to get that colour, you very, very, very rarely see that strength of colour, how intense it is. They are striking. Aren't they just? Mm. What do you like about it? Is it the colour? Or what is it? It's the vibrancy, I think, it's just, it just pops yeah. so much. It's, um, it's sort of a happiness on a strand. It's lovely. It makes you smile when you look at it. It's really lovely. And isn't that what we want with our mm -hmm. gemstones? When they mm. arrive, we just want to be in awe. We want to enjoy them. We want to, I mean, whether you know anything about gemstone jewellery or not, it's, if it stops you in your tracks, then I think that's it's something worked. special, mm. isn't it? Because mm. anybody can have a gemstone. Anybody can have black, plastic, or, or faux. It doesn't matter what you have. It's, it's the impact that it has when you look at it. And the striking green. 
It's definitely that. Coloured by vanadium, you're getting the, the minerals that, that also colour your Brazilian um, emeralds as well, actually. Vanadium gives you that intense rich t richness. The more intense the vanadium, the more um, intense the heat and the pressure under the ground and the circumstances where it's formed naturally, the darker the stone will be, the stronger the tone will be, the more intense. But you can have a really, really, really gorgeously saturated gem with a, a light tone. This has got the perfect medium. It's not too dark in its tone in that it looks dull, but it's also not too light in its tone that it looks pastel. It's as you said, Karen, it's striking, it's just right. It's ticking all the boxes on tone and saturation and vanadium properties in it. It really has got everything I want in colour. It really does. It's natural. It's from Colombia. Colombia. R-E-O-N-08 is the code. Now, with all that in mind, we're thinking of a price. What would you expect for natural Brazilian emeralds? And then think, these are from Colombia. So you look for the same properties, vanadium to give them the colour, but you look for something even more considered, even rarer, thought to be the world's renowned emerald. That is the colour that it's renowned for. That is the quality. It's got luster, it's got intensity, and it has wonderful opportunities of clarity within it. But it's that colour. It's all about the colour. It's like when you look at a Salon Sapphire, it's all about the colour. Same with a Burmese Spinel or Burmese Rubies. It's the colour you want. It's the intensity. But not too dark a tone that it looks dull. You've got it all here. So what's the price going to be? Do I have to have had to save months for this? Is it one that the card company is going to phone you to find out if you've used your card or if it was someone else? Two by one to three by one millimeter. Whether you use your 0.25 millimeter threads, whether you use your beading thread, whether you use your featherweight head pins with this, it's something that I feel deserved to be used. I can look at it all day. I'm in love with that saturation. And I'm not a green person. But when I first saw emeralds from Colombia, Colombia, $29.95 was not the price I was thinking of. What do you reckon? What do you think? Is that a treat or a treat and a half? I think it is. Now, I know lots of people, we were talking about this earlier because there's football games on and lots of things on. Yeah, and I always think, well, at the end of the day, when you go to watch a football game, just because it's on today or there's those games on, how much do you spend to get a ticket to go to the football? It's expensive. It can Very be, Very yeah. expensive. Depending on how good the team are and where you are, you can be looking at quite a pretty penny. And then when you go to the football, I'm sorry, I don't know who you are, but if you go to the football and you don't get a pie in a bob roll, or a pie in something, or some, some sort of food at the football, there's something wrong there. You gotta have that's the whole point. That's the whole reason I go so I can get my steak pie and my bob roll. It's not I'm not joking. You don't you don't go, you just go for the pie and bob roll. You just hang out in the, the And that all adds up. Hey forty pounds to go to football and then you have a pie and a bob roll. You don't watch the game, just eat your pie and bob roll. No, I like to watch the football as well. Um some may debate about what team I watch, whether it's actually class as football or no, it's not. They're brilliant, I love them, they're the best. Um Carol's in North Hampshire. But if you think about that, you wouldn't begrudge somebody going to watch a football game, would you? No. So then they can't begrudge you for treating yourselves at £30 for world-renowned emeralds that are totally natural. Is it, if you play around a round of golf, you'd be lucky if you can get around a round of golf for about £40 for 18 holes. Yes, it's four and a half hours of your day. Maybe a little bit less. But what do you reckon? Do you deserve a treat? I think you do. I think we all do. I treated myself yesterday. I got a new phone cover. It is. It's sparkly. Well, it's sparkly on the internet. I don't know what it's going to look like when it turns up. But it's sparkly. So I thought that'd be fun. 
I got it because I keep dropping my phone, so I thought I might protect it and make it last a little bit longer. The last one lasted really long, Karen. It dropped in my soup and still stayed alive for another three months. Really? Yep. My uh. curried parsnip soup and it stayed alive. Still talking to my brother through the phone while it was in my soup. Anyway, Carol's in Northamptonshire. Catherine's in now. There's something wrong here. I've got a lot of people concerned, and I understand your concern. Doesn't look real, does it? Looks too good to be true. Twenty nine ninety five for totally natural emeralds. No oiling, even that, which I don't class as treatment really personally, but it really hasn't even got that. No treatment at all. The colour is there, the quality is there, totally natural emeralds. Colombian emeralds. You've got an authenticity certificate if you wish, it's 25p to prove it. Totally natural authenticity certificate if you wish. You don't have to have one, but you've got the option. For 29.95, does that price seem real? No. It doesn't seem real, does no. it? They're just stunning. Aren't they? They look much better in the studio. You can't see how poppy they are. No, the and colour. The camera, the colour out. pop, really, mm. almost like the colour's bleached from them on the TV yes. because of the studio lights. Yeah, you're right. I've just had a look at the big TV and then looking down at my hand. So for that reason and that reason only, because it doesn't look like it should be this price, um, and because it's kind of hard to get around, we'll put the price up. We'll put it up to where it should be, which is probably around, what, eight to nine ninety five. I wouldn't do that. You know me far too well for that. How about... How about for Colombia... Colombia. Just to own a Colombian emerald. I've got a thought. Bear in mind, what day is it today? A Monday? Mm. With the last weekend, late week of the month? And it's the longest day tomorrow, so I think you've got to treat yourself. I think so too. I didn't know that. 21st June, isn't it the longest day? It is now. <laughs> if it means he'll go lower, it is now. There we go. Even more reason. Tomorrow's going to be really long. Really long. So imagine you're sitting tomorrow and you're thinking, oh, but I've got a Colombian emerald coming. It won't oh. make it quite so long, will it? No. You can enjoy it a bit more. Oh no! It's so low, it's so wrong. If it wasn't believable at 29.95, I don't think you'd believe it at 19.95, but I don't think anyone will mind too much if you're taking nine pounds today. Woohoo! Cats and Hampshire, how amazing is that? You can get two, two now for that price. Uh -huh. That's so fabulous. Lots of multi purchases coming through. Cheryl's in, Joyce's in, Collector's in, in Shropshire. You will need to treat yourself out in Alaska. You're there, Hertfordshire, City of Bristol. Call us as soon as you can. What was that? Sorry. Clap. Oh, a clap for Alaska. I thought you said a clap for a laugh, and I was like, a clap for a laugh. I don't think I've seen a Simpson film. The Spider Pig one. Spider Pig, Spider Pig. Right, in that film, you do a clap for Alaska. I don't remember that part, I just remember the spider pig part. Spider pig, spider pig does whatever a spider pig does. Can he swing from a web? No he can't, because he's a pig. <laughs> <laughs> you started it! Uh, 19 pounds and 95 pounds, these need to go, so call me as soon as you can. Zero hundred six triple four six. Have I got Colombian emeralds tonight and I've got pearls coming up. You can make a Colombian emerald and pearl piece for under £50. Way under £50. If you've got pearls at home and you're not treating yourself to Colombian emeralds at 19.95, then I'm thinking you might already have some. And at that price point, I would still buy some more. Um, what do you reckon? You look like you're up to something naughty. No, I'm not. I'm trying not to make a noise. Oh, you, you could so cute. Make as much noise as you want. It's fine. Double buy on those. Multi yeah. buy. Much, much, much better value than the football. Yes. Much think better. about it. And at the end of the day, what happens if they lose? You're a winner with those. Yeah, exactly. No, I don't mean it. I'm not talking about your particular game tonight. I mean football in general. You pay all that money and you lose. You come away like, oh. And then you have no money in your wallet. You're like, oh. The only good thing out of it is that you might be full because you've had a pie and a bottle. Other than that, do buy a programme though because the poor programme sales have to stand there. Programs are good fun. When the team's losing, you read the program. Oh my word, is that what you do? At 19 pounds and 95 pence. Oh yeah, I've been to a football game with you, Tom, haven't I? 
Why not? I'm from the one. It was super early in the morning. Yeah. Um, Nineteen pounds and ninety-five pence. He had a, a, bov a beverage of the alcoholic variety before going to the football. He did, and he doesn't even remember I was there. <laughs> um, enjoy it. Enjoy. It. Oh no, no, not that one. I wasn't invited to that one. No, I wasn't. That was the one game I wasn't invited to. No, I wasn't at that one. Hmm. I was at one of them. Um, the one where they won, I was at that one. Um, £19.95, £R-E-O-N-0-8. R -E -O -N the colour is there, the quality is there, and the multi-purchases are so there. Lady Anthea's in, Jill and Stephen's in, Lauder's in, Hilda's in. I've got Joyce, I've got Cheryl, I've got Audrey, I've got Angela, I've got Ross, um, and Rose, and Barbara, and Collectors in Shropshire. Patricia in the city of Bristol, lovely to see lots of regulars coming through. Linda's in there in North Yorkshire, Stella's in there, Tatiana's in. Back in, great to see you, having a great night tonight. Philip is in Bristol, Carol is in Northamptonshire. I've got Gloucestershire, sorry, Kent. Um, Giante, I hope I said that correctly. Lovely to see multi-purchases. Dawn is in there as well. I've got Lanarkshire, Victoria. Great to see you, showing an interest in there. Oh, and Kent, you've already checked yours out. Loving your work, that was quick. Um, Hertfordshire, Sunny, Devon, Greater London. I've got Alaska still showing an interest. Hertfordshire, Dumfries and Galloway. Hertfordshire again. Hi to my mum and dad if you're watching in Portugal. They were in Portugal the other day and they were watching. They said they were watching the show. How cool is that? Um, what do you mean they didn't email in? I've only just sorted out an email address for my mum. Bear with them. They're sorting out their technology. £19.95. They're still amazed that they can watch the Jewelry Maker in, in another country. In fact, they're back now. Oh. They're watching on the TV. Hi, Mum and Dad. £19.95. <laughs> um, We've got a really, 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 really short break. I have to have one. I don't want to have one, but I need to have a wee sip of water. And you probably want to go and have a, a wee top up your tea. Drop us a message. Let us know what your first job was. We're doing a, a little bit of fun just to find out. And also, let me know if you've ever used t-shirt yarn, if you love it, because I love it. And it's been on the show tonight. It's just fabulous. We've got Karen's demonstration coming up on the other side of this break. You don't want to miss it. It's a fabulous night, and her kit is just gorgeous. What she's done with it. Well, it's another level. You won't want to miss it. Lots and lots coming up after the break. Don't go anywhere. And have you guessed what that gemstone is at 9 o'clock? You have to guess. We're having a mini clearance. It's going to be awesome. I think having bespoke jewellery always makes things unique. Um, the fact that you can add a couple of flowers onto a basic necklace or, or add some more beads on... There's nothing better than a bride who can actually make her bridesmaids gifts and favours. It's, it's lovely to see people coordinating their dresses with their bracelets by making friendship bracelets for each other. You can now book Jewellery Maker workshops online. Just head over to our Jewellery Maker website and click on the workshop link. We have a wide range of workshops from beginner to intermediate covering a variety of mediums. Once you have found a workshop you'd like to attend, simply click on the book now button. Fill in the required fields and then press continue. This will take you through to the payment page. If you have any questions, you can contact our workshop coordinator, Wendy, at any time by emailing workshop at jewellerymaker.com. We look forward to seeing you. If for any reason you're not satisfied with your purchase, you have the benefit of our no quibble 30 day money back guarantee. Just complete the returns form enclosed with your goods and send them back for a full refund. Are you new to jewellery making? Not sure where to start? Then head over to our website and check out our Get Started page. Watch the welcome message from presenter Carol and find out all about Jewellery Maker. Watch one of our easy to follow tutorials where our guest designers will teach you the basics and give you the confidence to start making earrings, bracelets and necklaces. If you prefer to simply have a go, then check out our starter kits. They contain everything you need, including instructions, tools, gemstones and clasps, allowing you to create your very first jewellery pieces. You can either watch the video tutorial or follow the step-by-step -step instructions to give you plenty of inspiration. We also have an array of beginners workshops that you can attend here at our studios and join our experienced designers and get a taste for this fabulous hobby. 
We will guide you through the basics to get you started making your own beautiful jewellery. Everyone is welcome in the jewellery making family, so start your jewellery making journey today. So I haven't had chocolate, but I had some peanuts. That's not really breaking my diet, is it? Is it? Peanuts, I didn't have any chocolate, I had some peanuts. No, they weren't chocolate peanuts, they were spicy paprika peanuts. My mouth is on fire! Um, lots and lots coming up for you tonight. I'm trying to be healthy, and I'm just trying to eat healthily, but I've not even lasted a day yet. So, all right, it's going to be fine. I'm Ali, if you've just tuned in, and I have the wonderful Karen Gray with me tonight. Karen, it's your first ever Late Show. Are you enjoying it so far? Yes, I am. Yeah? Very much so, yes. It's Would you come uh, back? Yeah. Yes. Um, I'm going to show you everything Karen's got in her kit, and then we're going to have a look, and we're going to have a demonstration, and boy, oh boy, do you want to see it. It's fabulous. I'm going to start off with the... Oh, do mm. I start off with the wire, or do I start off with the gemstones? I'll do with the wire first. Let me show you the wire first, because... The gemstones are pretty special. Not that the wire's not, but we do get to see wire now and again. So let's get through the wire and show you what you've got. You're getting different gauges. 0.8 millimeter gauge, you're getting 10 meters off. And it's your copper wire, which has been silver plated. So 0.8 mil gauge, 0.4 mil gauge, 100 meters, again, silver plated. Then we have 10 meters of the Soft wire. Now this is super popular. It's one millimetre in gauge, 10 metres in length, and it's not on a reel as it's our new soft wire. It's lovely. So 0.8 and 0.4 mil you have each uh, on the reel. They're both silver plated. 100 metres in the 0.4 and you're getting 10 metres in the 0.8. Then 10 metres added to that of soft copper plated wire. Again, plated with silver. And that's one millimetre in gauge, 10 metres of that. So that's 120 metres in total. Two different types of wire, your normal wire, or your round wire, should I say, plus your soft wire. Then, mm, I get your gemstones, and I just love them. The combination is gorgeous. I brought this uh, natural strand of Peruvian opal, I believe, before, and it was so popular. It came back as a reorder. It was a deal of the day, sold out been reordered again and it's now in this kit so if you've ever seen it before or ever worked with it before you will know how fabulous it is or you may have missed it out and this might be your your well it might be fate that you're watching tonight and the fact that you might be able to get this as part of the kit it's lovely which you see totally natural peruvian opal what a treat it's lovely isn't it totally natural and just fabulous now this is called Midsummer Madness, this collection. To add in some natural pearls, well that would be a treat, wouldn't it? Oh yes, they work so beautifully together. The glow and the colour of Peruvian opals. I think Peruvian opals have to be one of my top five of opals. Might even be in my top three, you know of all the opal types you can get in the world. Mm -hmm. I think they're amazing. I think they're lovely. Like you said earlier with the emeralds, it's a happy strand. It is, yeah. And they're lovely. They're different. They're great. Great in colour. Yeah. And having a graduated strand as well gives you so many more options. I guess as a jewellery maker that must be quite mm -hmm. important mm -hmm. to have that. To have options must be good. Otherwise you might just think, well, I have to make that and that's all I've got. So as you say, you've got options, which means one person will work with a kit one way and then somebody else will get the exact same kit but because of the options with the graduation, might make something totally different. Mm. Yeah. Quite bespoke, this kit. 
Then we've got lovely, glowing, gorgeous moons. These are just fabulous. Really different for you here. Genuine shell, mother of pearl. And these are really pretty. White shell moons, they're 16 by 11 millimeter. The Peruvian opal graduate, 40 carats, they go from three by, si three by one to six by three mil. 28 centimetres, and then you've got the white pearls, 6, point, 6 by 5 to 7 by 6 mil. Oh, yes, please. Now, when you see what our Karen has made with this kit, it completely put, makes it come alive. You can look at them all separately, and they look lovely, and I can look at the wire, and I think that's great. And then, then I think to myself, I want it all, I love it all, but I, I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> then when I see what you've made, not only do I want to copy you, but it makes me think of ideas that I like as well. Mm -hmm. It makes me think, well, actually, I really like that, and maybe I would add that to it, or maybe I would do that as well, or maybe I would use that with a bubble bracelet. It gets me really, really excited. So if you're like me, uh, I know many of you are designers, and you, you are fantastic designers, just like our Karen. But many of you also will be first timers. Many of you will be looking at this thinking, I love all the gems, but how would you put it together? And, but you can't go wrong with these colours, no, can you? Absolutely not, no. And that's part of what we try to do with the kits. We try to put the wire and the gemstones or findings or whatever it might be, in this case, wire and gemstones together, so that no matter what you do, that will work. It works. The stones will work, the wire colours will work, and the gauges can work together. Yes. If you add all of these wires and gemstones together you'd be looking at only 47 pounds and 70 pence now i know how popular our soft wire is and how exceptionally popular our pearls are and peruvian opal i know this pearl, peruvian opal sold out i know we reordered it and had it as a deal of the day and it sold out again and it's been reordered again for this kit now this kit has a really good quantity but never enough there are 80 of this kit. What do you think? How about we have a look? You're not putting the price on yet. Can we look at Karen's jewellery first before you put the price on? Karen can see my producer. He's got his head in his hands, <laughs> right? He's screwing up his face. I think he's a little bit nervous about what he might do. He's trying to work out a price point for this. He's, he's loving all of the pearls, the moonstone. Uh, sorry, not the moon, the moon and the stone. It's the shape of a moon, sorry. Um, and the Peruvian opal. And the jewellery that you've created, Karen, is such a selection. Something for everybody, all totally different. It's three or at least four different ways of minimum of looking mm. at that same kit and working with it completely differently. Yeah. You've got so many options. For a kit that has so many options, have you got any wire left over? Um, I have none of the one mil. Okay, the soft wire. of the point four because those are 100 metres. Yeah. Wire weaver's dream. Um, and some of the point eight, I didn't use much of the point eight. Some of the opals left few of the round pearls oh, wow. and a few of the shells. Mm. They're, they're not gem heavy, but, well, actually, they're, well, they're, they're not are. bad. To be fair, not. that necklace that you've made, the one we're actually going to be demonstrating there, the pendant, the one in the middle, that's got this lovely sort of figure of eight link chain that you've made. Did yes. you make that out of the yes. one mil wire? Yes, that's the one mil wire. Wow. Could you have made that with normal one mil wire? Is it because it's soft one mil wire you're able to do that? No, I've done it with normal one normal mil wire. wire as well. The soft wire is just easier right. and quicker, much, much quicker and much easier. But no, you can do it with the normal okay. one mil wire as well. He's been debating about this all day. £20.19.95 for the entire kit. Fourteen ninety five for that Peruvian oval, isn't it? Oval, not oval, opal. The Peruvian opal alone, I believe, to be fourteen ninety five minimum. These will sell it. You've got to get these before they go. If you're not getting these, then somebody else says. So you will need to be as quick as you can. Um, this is a dream come true for me, to be able to have all of this and then to have it at a price which 
for me, is really, really affordable for a kit. It is. For when you've got that much wire, and when you've got um, as many gemstones as you have, pearls and opal. Opals are October's birthstone, pearls are June's birthstone, so if you're mm -hmm. into creating jewellery for birthdays, then that's an option for you. If you just want to enjoy the gems, are they nice to work with? Lovely. Really? Well, pearls are me anyway, I love pearls. Okay. Um, but with the opals as well, that just gave them that extra little push and an accent and just brought it onto a different level. Even though I haven't used the opals in all of the mm -hmm. pieces, but they were just lovely to use um, to complement the other pieces, so you could mix and match and wear them together. Or separately, it's they, they were just lovely. I completely agree. And this is one of the first times you've ever made a sort of bubble style. Yes. Wasn't it? And I yeah. love it. I love what you've done. I love the simplicity of just the single wire and then having that sort of bubble, the, the mm. focus coming down to the moonstone there. That, or the moonstone. It's the shape of a moon, but it's a shell. Um, I'll move your earrings just to the side. They're so pretty. Of course, they look really bridal. We've got bridal weekend coming up. They would be oh, beautiful. That's true, yes. yes. <gasps> I love that and the movement that you can get from that. I just think that's so gorgeous. As I say, it's the first time I've, well actually it was the second okay. attempt because the first one didn't work so I had to Aww. do them again but no it worked the second time so I was quite pleased with that. It's so lovely, so so lovely. Karen, I'm going to let you take it away because um, you're going to show us how one. to make this middle one aren't you? Yes. <gasps> what a treat. So for it you need some opals and some pearls which I have here, the opals are still, I've still managed to keep them on the strand. So Loving that, your work. But that, apart from the end ones. Oh yeah. <laughs> they've come off. It's all right, that's okay. And just a couple of the pearls, just to give it an accent, and then the pearls in the bring chain. Mm. And I'll pop it down there. That's lovely. Wow. So. Because I can't always remember how I did them. It's gorgeous. <laughs> Even well. though I've done some, here, here's a bits I did earlier, but. <laughs> like Blue um, Peter style mm. Now, it's deceptively easy, it looks quite difficult, but it's made with three lengths of wire, mm -hmm. um, about 18 inches, but I've cut three lengths that are slightly smaller because we don't need 18 inches and I'll be poking you. Okay, um, that's alright. And we start with Keep the... Keep me awake. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking, only because it's a late show, that's all, I don't know. I'm and really we're starting it. with the bail piece right. that's just going to curl from the back over to the front. Mm -hmm. So it's a an easy simple weave now the point for I think Laura meant Laura suggested this and it works the point for if you unwind it and leave it it can boing and right. it'll slinky everywhere mm -hmm. so it's a good idea just to cut a notch ah, into the plastic so you can just the, and there isn't one on that and you can just pull it in as you're using it and then um, right, anchor it somewhere so yeah. it doesn't just go haywire because otherwise it'll just go everywhere and you'll end yeah. up with a knot, a big mm, mess. A waste of wire. And, um, and your time. Yeah. So it's the point for weaving wire and unravel about a metre and then pull it back into the notch that you've made. Mm -hmm. Sometimes as well it's a good idea just to weigh it down there yep, so that it stays where tools. it's supposed to. Okay. Take and one of the wires mm -hmm. and anchor on the point four five times and just to check is that the one mil soft wire you're using this is the one mil soft and wire the point yes four. and the point four thank Sorry, you no no you now that is it's um a weave that a lot of um guest designers use it's a three by two but the no a five by two mm -hmm. but the five wrap is only on the middle wire right so you've wrapped five times around that wire it's in the middle you need to add in a wire to the bottom and just kick out the bottom part. Take the wire, it's coming up to the front of you, take it round behind both wires, over the top, round twice and then back in between the two wires and just scoot it up together. And this wire will try and coil itself again. Just so be aware that you could end up with little knots. So you must be get rid of those before they go into huge knot, into tiny knots because the wire will break. Okay. And then five times around the middle wire, what is going to be the middle wire, 
you can see how soft it is. It is pulling and it's warm in the studio as well, so it's making yeah, it, it ultra soft. It misbehaves soft. a little it bit does, in the studio, it does doesn't it? It a little bit, yes. It's um, almost as if you're trying to do a live demonstration and it's just playing And it's playing just up. not, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nylon jaw pliers are a good one, so you don't mark, mark the, the, the coloured wire. Bring in the top piece, what would be the top piece, and kick it out. And then wrap once and twice. And then back between one and two. And then wrap around five times around the middle wire. Again. It seems quite therapeutic. I'm it's finding lovely. it quite relaxing mm. just watching you. It's a nice weave. It's um, a neat weave mm. and it's nice to it, it's easy to manipulate once you've got it woven all woven even a long woven piece you can manipulate it around nicely really um so then you come down again to the bottom and over once up and around over twice between one and two and then round five times And then back up and over the two and three twice. You need to keep that going. Theoretically, t into the, it, that needs to. Oops, don't put it too tight. That needs to be in the centre of the wires. Mm -hmm. um, the outer wires will pull along very easily because they're only wrapped a couple of times. The oh. centre wire, you'll have to give a little bit of a or wiggle it. Mm -hmm. And it will pull ah, along. Okay. Until it's in the centre. And you need to weave about four inches, a good four inches, to give you the bail and to come round and to give you the start of that decorative flourish there. Mm -hmm. And I won't do that because it's fab. everybody will be a slave. Oh, no, don't be daft. So you just continue that. Yeah. I'll just pop these on very quickly. We've got some wire for you here. And varying gauges, just in case you wanted a different colour, um, or maybe you've got some of the parts of the kit, so we'll add this in. So you've got the point four. just to let you know, the kits are very, very popular, they're flying at the door. I've got half the stock already gone, so do bear that in mind. Mm -hmm. um, we've only got about 40 left, if even that, so there's quite a lot in baskets, do just take them out when you can. So there are only 30 of this particular bundle, you're getting the point four millimetre gauge wire in 10 metres. They're all copper. You've then got the point eight mil again, 10 metres. Then you've got, I believe this is the one mil, 10 metres, and then you've got this cheeky chappy on the top, which I'm, I'm waiting to find out, but I think it might be... Looks like a point 0.6. Might be a wee cheeky point 0.6. Should be, and it is. So all of them, point 0.4, point 0.6, point 0.8 and one mil. 10 metres of each, 40 metres in total. Every gauge you would need. Sounds like a plan to mm -hmm. me. Good bundle. Lovely bundle, lovely copper, I love copper wire. Yeah, do you like it for 9.95? Yep, 40 metres. 40 metres. Mm -hmm. Producer Tom likes making bundles because when he adds things together, he's allowed to take the price down. Uh-huh, right. What a treat. Check it out as soon as you can. Lots and lots of you on the phone lines. That's the way to do it. Um, Join me on the phone lines or join me on the web. Lots of you coming through. So £9.95. Whatever you do, do not miss out. So 0800 644 655 on jewelrymaker.com. £9.95 for 40 metres of wire. All the gauges we need. 0 0.4, 0 0.6, 0 0.8 and 1 millimetre there for you. So whatever you do, don't miss out. If it's something you fancy, the code on it is KOG... C83. I was reading it just as it disappeared. <laughs> Enjoy it. Lots and lots of you there. Do check out as and when you're ready. And whatever you do, do not miss out. Karen, I'll let you take it away again. Sorry for right. interrupting. So here's a piece that I prepared earlier and I made okay. a mistake there. But, um, about four inches. And we need to can make. Can I just hold that up so everyone Sorry. can see? No, you're oh. fine. It's not a problem. There we go. Fabulous, thank you. Thank you. And we need to make the bail with this. So go um, about 
it, we've got about four inches going about an inch mm -hmm. and just with your bail making pliers you can use round nose pliers you can use um, the ends of your pliers the handles mm -hmm. are a good one to, and just gently pull it round and just pull it together so that's that creating a lovely sort of pear shape uh, yes it gives um and it gives you a flatter yep, side, uh, so the uh, back the front. and the front. So, so this one can go to be the front. And then what you need to do is to just to shape it. Okay. And as I say, the, with the soft one mil wire and this weave makes it lovely to be able to just gently pull it round. Wow. So that it follows, goes into a, um, away from the down part of the bale mm -hmm. and the other nice thing about the wire is that you can curl it round beautifully it goes round on itself just gently you can make a lovely circle going round you may need to just you get that lovely easy curve and pull it round and it pulls right the way around and you can put it tighter and that's where we are there and that's where you can sew the pearl into later ah okay i then separated the wires got the three wires take one out of the way ignore it ignore the three at the back and then with these two two wires I wanted to give a little bit of interest and um, as it is so soft you can beautifully just curve curl it curve it round and the same with that one but just slightly following it round that way as I said, my husband said it looked like a seahorse. Oh, I think it looked like a lovely shell. Can I just ask you just to move your hands a wee bit Sorry. further forward? No, no, it's fine. It's just so we can get um, a better shot with the camera. It, You're um, doing perfectly. You, you tend to find yourself yeah. working backwards. I don't know how you do it in the first place. Never mind. I'd have to have it right up next to my face. I do normally at home. Yeah. <laughs> so this, the, we have that shape now that we're going to do a figure of eight weave, which is on... Do you want to hold it that way? Or that way. It, it's on there, but it's just slightly hidden. But it's going down behind that. Underneath. Yeah. I'll hold that up for so you. There we go. So I see that, that one there in the middle. Yes, yes, just coming down. Gorgeous. So beautiful jewellery as ever, Karen. It's from Deborah. Oh, thank you. Gemstone addict out in Greater Manchester, that was very kind, we all agree. Thank you very much for taking the time to drop us a message. So this one is the um, figure of eight, and we'll do, I think on this one I did three by th two by two, except the outer, what would you call that? Outer, outer wire, yeah. Outer wire has a longer length so you'll have to wrap that three times and only two times ah uh, yes only to twice, cover the two distance. times twice on the bottom wire so wrap around a couple of times it's coming up underneath the bottom wire take it up in between and just gently push it into place then it comes up over the top of the top wire and three times round now I don't want to rush you but I'm thinking you've got the next stage of that I haven't have, you yes so if you would just you would just continue that down you wouldn't would you continue that until you get to um, a natural place where it meets okay and then you Perfect. would go into and there's one I did earlier yeah because I want to make sure we get to right brilliant. I went into then I crossed the wires over because it, they naturally wanted to cross yeah. okay and went into the um, five by two on two wires now if your husband saw it at that stage I would get where he's thinking of the seahorse yes 
He did, and he said, "So oh, maybe that at that stage, was when like, I was, yeah. I'd got that far." And he said, "Oh, you've done a seahorse. Yeah. Thank you." Right. <laughs> but you can pull the um, woven part round so that it follows nicely that shape that you've done there, and then with the five by two, I would do maybe an inch or maybe slightly more. And again, you can pull that round so that it goes over the top of the woven piece that you've just done and then you will you would bring that out and sh shape that again as I say it's so beautiful to you and just pull it round and that was it was into here that I channel set the oh the opals, Peruvian the opals the blue opals so I did a, a little bit of a um, a figure of eight weave until I had enough until the space was big enough to start adding. Ah, opals. based on the size of them. Based, I yeah. see. Um, and I didn't start with the really, really tiny ones. I went for some slightly large, slight, just in off the end. Yeah. Um, so you got the kick of the colours coming in because they were so lovely together. They're gorgeous. So that was you just the channel set those into there. That shows them off so beautifully. It does. And then the wires, once you've channeled, do you want me to put one in? Yeah, go right. for it. I'll just open that out slightly. So it's an idea when you're doing the channel set to bring the wire up on the outside of the um, bottom wire. Mm -hmm. Get one of these stones. Just don't know so it will fit in properly. <laughs> My producer Tom's just telling you how much he was telling me to tell you how much he loves it. He's like, This is brilliant, I love this technique. This for he, he's a newbie kind of to jewellery design, ah, if that makes right. sense. So he's like, oh, I'm really loving this. Feeling, Thank that, you. He, feeling <laughs> that he can um, he can give it a go, eh? Can't wait to see yours. You made fun of mine the other day because I tried to do a kangaroo and he said it looked like a squid. A squid? Mm. Uh huh. That's not very nice. So sorry. It turned out to a kangaroo at the end, apparently. So we've come back down to the bottom wire behind the bottom wire. Thread on. I'll we'll go from the one from this end. The nice thing about doing them from the um, strand as well is that you get the graduation of the size but also the colours, the different colours, you don't know which one you're going to pick up next. Right. Which is lovely. So taking it up over the bottom wire, lay it nicely in between and then go over the top of the top wire, put it nice and tight, go around again and then take the wire back, right down the back and then over so once you've attached it like that, you would just continue doing it all the way up. All I'm just conscious way. of time, so I just yeah, want to sorry. make sure. No, no, you're fine, you're fine. Don't want to rush you. So you would just continue doing that all the way up to the top. And then I took these two wires behind there with the, obviously, ah. as a nice, with a nicer shape. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you would take the time when you're at home to work on mm -hmm. that shape and get you the, the shape you want. And then what I did with one of the wires was I hand coiled it just to wrap Ah, around the bale so that it just gave stunning. a little bit Can of you see that there? interest. That is really gorgeous. So you hand coiled that and then wrapped that one around the top, as you see, for the mm -hmm. interest. Just for one of them. And the other one that I just, um, I can't remember how I got rid of, I think I just tucked it behind yeah. the bale you wires did. there. Just coiled, gave that a swirl as well. Uh -huh. And then the remaining bale wires, I wasn't quite sure what I was going to do, and you can see at the back, I finished the five by two by five by two, mm -hmm. and then I brought the wires. I think I took a little bit. I think I took them round that way. No, I didn't. I brought them round that way, and then just to, to neaten them off, and then did exactly the same weave. Ah. The three. You maybe can see it. Yeah, yeah, we can see. I'll turn it that way so you can see. So this part here we're talking mm. about. Yeah. 
exactly the same weave, then I brought it. Is that the part there? Yeah. And then I can't remember how I did the rest of it. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know they what? They flow so quickly. I think you have done a wonderful job, Karen. I absolutely love it. We've had so many comments. Everybody loves it. Thank you. We just had a, a message. I don't think you saw it because you were talking us through it. What, Lorraine and Essex messaged in to say, what was that? Absolutely love it. Gorgeous. Thank there you. it is again. Thank absolutely you. gorgeous. Thank you. Well done you, and thank you so much. We have so much, so little time of an evening, the fact that you've managed to show us, because Tom and I, my producer and I, were thinking, there's no way we'll be able to see all that in one. That was amazing, wasn't it? Massive well done, Karen. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. Brilliant superstar. It's so lovely to have you on the evening show. Um, I'm going to show me over this way. Karen, you're going to hang out this way. I am. you got your seat. You can chill out. Oh. Relax. All the hard work's over. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, we've got a beautiful piece of jewellery already made by Karen. Oh yeah, she didn't just make a kit. No, no. She's been busy lady. I don't know how you've had time to do this. I don't know when you managed to have fine time to do this. This is from our Star by Strand, which is coming up at the end of this hour. It's a premier strand. There are 200 of these available. It's going to be underwear. You want me to tell everybody that's going under £10? I don't believe you. Under £10, this strand. Does not seem right. Oh my goodness gracious me. Every single one has its own individuality. I'm loving this. I can't wait to ask Karen why you chose that one out of the whole strand. Is there a reason why you chose that one? Or is it just the first one you came off? No, there was a reason. I think it was the way that the a lot of them had the stripes going down. Yes. Um, and that just didn't... It had them sort of more going across and it looked a little bit more dappled. And yeah. I it would go with the rose gold wire. I think that's... No, it's champagne coloured gold wire, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. It is. Yeah. It's stunning and it goes beautifully well. Almost looks like flowing water. Mm. Almost. It's a stunning piece. This is made from our Star by Strand, which is coming out, as I say, in 10 minutes' time. Cannot wait for that. Can I just show you the deal of the day? In fact, no, I'm not going to show you. You don't have to wait. DVD wirework bundle. Now, oh my gosh. How would you feel if I brought you, wait for this, right? An hour of tutorial with one of your favourite designers. Mm -hmm. Imagine I gave you that for £5. That's fine. And then imagine I gave you another DVD with another one of your favourite designers for five pounds, hmm. right? So that's two DVDs for 10 pounds. How about I give you a third DVD, another hour's worth of tutorial from more of your favorite designers <coughs> for 15 pounds for three DVDs? Fine. How would you feel if I added in another four and didn't add on anything to your price? I'd go with that. Would you be happy with that? <laughs> I'd go for that. Buy three, you buy three and you get another four. Seven DVDs for the price of three. Did I just say that? No, it's all about wire. No, there's another one. It's just slipped down. I'll try and balance them. Oh, last time I did that, it worked so well. It's seven, you put too many in. Um, let them not complain, and this is brilliant. Right, let's have a look at them all. I've not put them in order because I've just knocked them all over. So there we go. So let's have a look at this. Apologies if they're not in order. Wirework DVD <coughs> mega clearance bundle. Oh my word. So this is Wirework Edition 3. Within this one you're getting the introduction, the basic weave, a woven bangle, netting technique and caged beads. So you've got DVD Edition 3 for your wirework. We've then got Edition 1. See, I told you it wasn't going to be in order for wire work, which is making there, as you can see, a tree of life. You've got spiral ring, spiral earrings, tree of life, herringbone weave, wire frame pendant, and woven cuff bracelet. You've got addition one of sculpture with wire. You've got in here your scroll technique, wire work box, wire work stocking, and a wire work bell. That's quite festive, this one. Getting you in time for your Christmas. Um, we've then got. Wire work rings. I'm in this DVD. Um, I've got adjustable rings, wire swirl rings, solitaire ring, Aztec ring, figure of eight ring, and the prong set ring. 
I probably, I bet you're all thinking, that's great, you're in it, Ali, but we want to know all the designers that are in them. I'll tell you, I'll go through that in a minute as well. Um, we've got for you Twisted Wire. With this one, it gives you an introduction to making your own jump rings, hammering twisted wire, separating strands, gizmo pendants, and weaving with twisted wire. Then I've got wire ring edition two, adjustable rings, double ring shank, layered rings, bird's nest ring, flower ring, and finishing touches. And then the final of your seven DVDs is Wirework Edition 4. It's giving you your butterfly pendant, your feature cuff, your feature ring, your weave earring, and your ear cuff. Amazing combination. Five DVDs. So I put them in order. There's a Wirework Rings Edition with Gemma Crow and me. Buy three and you get four for free. How good is that? How amazing is this? What a bundle. Um, it's a must if you can. So we've got Wirework Rings Edition 2 and 3. And we've got 4. So we've skipped Edition 1. Um, and then we've got Edition 1 for your Wirework and Edition 3 for your Wirework. Edition 1 for your Sculpture. And then we've got Twisted Wire. There's so much for you. Which DVD is that one you're showing just now? This is why we're at edition three you're looking at just now. Who's in that one? Is that Vicky Carr? Vicky Carr and our lot of binding in there as well. These are some of the treats in it. Oh no, it's Carol. Oh no, it's Vicky Carr. There's Alice and Terry. It's jumping. We're seeing them all getting confused. This is a sculpture one that we saw the tree in. Um, you've got yourself Alice and Terry in there. You've got a gorgeous Lucy in there too. There's a wire box, trinket box. I think that's fabulous. So as I say, each DVD is normally £4.95. Mm -hmm. To give you three DVDs, that's normal price, £15, £14.95. Um, well, actually, it's just a bit less. Um, it would be just shy of that, a couple of pennies shy. But to have, and there's a little booty stocking. Now, I have this DVD, and I want to challenge myself to make something for my Christmas. I wanted to do it last year, did not have a chance, didn't get there. Um, £14.95, you are getting seven DVDs, that's seven hours worth of private tutorial from your favourite designers for £14.95. You've just seen a selection of them, you've seen Gemma Crow, you've seen Laura Binding, and you've seen, oh, in fact, I don't know if you saw Laura Binding, but you saw her or designs, um, she was, you might have seen her, um, and Alison Tarriott, that's just to mention a few of the guest designers, you've got seven DVDs, all under £15. What do you mean under, sorry? What's wrong with you? I'm sorry, are you feeling alright? Hold on, I, I apologise. I've just, my producer is standing up, Karen, can you see him? And he's tall. He is super tall. <laughs> and he's on a platform. He's got a super platform there. Uh -huh. I was super excited about this bundle. I thought this was an epic bundle. My producer is super excited about this. However, there are some spaces. How many of this bundle did you make? 351. Right. You're crazy. He's, he's trying to psych himself up for this. He's decided that he's not happy at 14.95. So he'd rather you bought two DVDs, <laughs> two DVDs, and then got five free. I see. Uh -huh. What do you reckon to that? Buy two and get five free. Nine pounds and 95 pence. If you haven't got a treat of a DVD, that's what? Two, four, six, eight, ten. They're not even two pounds each and you got two free. Let's do this again. 150, 250, that makes three pounds. 4.50. This is still not going to work. At £9.95 to get premier, brand new in their packaging. They're not used. It's <coughs> not like you've gone to a car boot sale and you're getting them second hand. They're brand new for £9.95. Well, if you get in trouble, we'll all get in trouble, Tom. We're all in it together. I love this. 
Jane in Greater Manchester is onto something here. She's bought four bundles. <laughs> so Jane in Manchester has, what's that? 25 DVDs coming your way for 40 pounds. No, no, that's not right. Four times seven. 28 DVDs coming your way. This is wrong. So if you've just tuned in, there are, all you need to do is like, or not have, two of these DVDs and this bundle's epic for you. Have you got any of our DVDs yet, Canon? I have, I've got quite a few. Why right. I work once and um, I bought my granddaughter Mark Smith macrame ones because oh. she was into the macrame at the time. Brilliant. Um, and yeah, she's watched that quite a few times. So, and it is one you can watch again and again, mm, and if yeah. you forget, or if you think, actually, I'm going to do something else technique wise for a while and then do it again, that's pause, rewind. You can have it for as long as you want. You can watch it on your computer, you can watch it on your laptop. So, have you got Wirework Edition 4? No, I don't think I've got that one. Okay, um, there we go. There's one for you. Twisted <laughs> Wire, have you got that one? Yes. Got that one. Sculpture Edition 1? Nope. Nope, there you go. Well, that's you. That's me, done. That's it. Tip out. Um, have you got Wirework Edition 2? No. Nope. Right. Wire rings edition. So there's another one you don't have. Um, wire work rings edition three. Yes. Got that one. Wire work edition one. Yes, I've got that got one. Got that one. Wire work edition three. No. There you go. So <laughs> that's two pounds fifty each for each one of those, and then you get those three, which you've already got. You can give us gifts for free. There you go. Free? What do you reckon? What would you like? Something new. It's not borrowed. It's got some blue in it. A wire, maybe you know somebody who's got a wire bundle. Like tonight, maybe you've got a wire bundle. We did a wire bundle for 40 meters at 9.95, which I have to say feels like a real giveaway. Mm -hmm. It feels fabulous. It's still available. If you're looking at this thinking, you know what? Can you get me some wire? I'm gonna get me some DVDs. 20 pounds for seven DVDs. I've not upped the price on this, by the way. I'm going to say, and wire. <laughs> 40 metres of wire. As you said earlier, Karen, perfect gauges, 0 0.4, 0 0.6, mm -hmm. 0 0.8 and 1 mil. Yeah. And then you've got seven DVDs to play with. I mean, that's seven hours of your life that you're going to have plenty of fun with, and then you can rewind them all again and do them all again. I think you'd be lucky if you got through all of these within the, ne the end of the year. That would be an achievement, I think, to have that amount of time. Mm-hmm. Um, we had 300 of these DVDs opportunities available. It is madness. Buying early for Christmas. Well, to be fair, this DVD, where has it gone? The sculpture edition has got a Christmas stocking in it. And it's got a trinket, bo trinket box. It's got the most wonderful wirework bell in there. Brilliant DVD. DVD offer. I've got two of the discs already, but the price allows me to give gifts and still be saving money. How amazing is that? To be able to give a gift and actually make money. <laughs> James, shoot, 71 pence each, Ali. Uh oh. Didn't think about it like that. Think of the amount of work that's gone into every single one of these DVDs and there's 71 pence. You buy a can of fizzy juice for more these days. Mm. However, it's great for those of you who can get, I think it's brilliant gifts. And at the end of the day, you never know on Facebook who might be saying, oh, has anyone got the Wirework Edition DVD? Even if you sold it for a pound, you'd make money. We didn't think about this very well, did we? He didn't think about it. He just stood up and then just went, yay, so Wirework Bundle, let's go through them again. Your sculpture DVD, which as we said a moment ago, Alison Terry, um, and you've got our lovely Lucy on there. Scroll technique, wirework box, wirework stocking, and wirework bell. You've got wirework edition three, and that you're getting the instruction to your basic weave, your woven bangle, your netting techniques, and your caged beads. Uh, was that with Laura Bain? I think it was. Um, you've got adjustable rings in here, double ring shank, layered ring shank, bird's nest ring, flower ring, finishing touches, and that one is your wirework edition two. You've then got your wirework edition four, which is one of our newer ones. Butterfly pendant, feature cuff, feature ring, weave earrings, and ear cuff. Then you've got introduction, spiral ring, spiral earrings, treat of life, herringbone weave, wire frame pendant, and the woven cuff bracelet. 
I'm in this one with Gemma Crow. Um, you've got adjustable rings, wire swirl rings, solid ear rings, and state rings, figure of eight ring, and prong set rings. And with this one, you've got making your own jump rings, hammering twisted wire, separating strands, gizmo pendants, and weaving with twisted wire. And this is your twisted wire DVD. Many of you will have twisted wire at home, but you might not have the DVD to work with it. It's a great idea. There's a lovely Carol and a gorgeous Jan who's going to be on with you, if my memory serves me correctly, on Saturday morning. Love, 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 love it. Many of you, as I say, will have twisted wire. You can twist your wire yourself. You don't have to actually have purchased twisted wire to use it. Brilliant treat or a brilliant, a brilliant treat? Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, so much love. Seven DVDs. So many multi-purchases multi there. Enjoy that. Right. I don't want it a star buy already. That means it's nearly the end of this hour. I'm not telling people it's under ten pounds. Or did I just do that? Star buy. <laughs>  
a strand that you would wear maybe during the day to an evening piece. Isn't it something different? Now, it's a premiere, as I, say, as I mentioned. Oh, I just found on the internet a serpentine belt. Oh, how funny is that? It's not an actual belt. It's for automotive engines <laughs> called a serpentine belt. <laughs> how funny is that? It's a continuous belt used to drive multiple peripheral devices in an automotive machine, such, such as an alternator, a power steering pump, water pump, or an air conditioning compressor. So there's another way of <laughs> serpentine. So that's not actually what we've got. We've got genuine serpentine, the gemstone. How funny is that? I had no idea. Ha! Huh. That is funny. Well, there we go. Apparently, it has benefits. I don't want to offer it to you based on its benefits. I think that's something that if you're into that, you will mm -hmm. obviously plenty of access to the internet. You can have a look and see if that's something you're interested um, or not. But it is a wonderful gem. So many people have it for healing. Um, and it's many people know it as noble serpentine. You can call it that if you wish. You don't have to. The rich greens, usually it's green, but sometimes you get yellows or sort of browns in its colour. Um, and it's thought to be derived from the fact that it's got like serpentine-like movement and swirls within the, na the natural gemstone. You can get transparent gem um, serpentine, but I quite prefer this. I quite like the natural markings in it. I think the transpar transparent almost looks like a, a kind of green apple-y colour, mm -hmm. which is nice. But then this is different, and I, I like it. of interest. Yeah, I like yeah. the interest. I like the difference. Seven ninety five is all we're looking for. Now they're flying out the door before the price even come in. Um, Barb is in in California. Oh, I met a lovely girl from California yesterday. Super lovely. Her name was Amber. Really, really nice. Um, this is really, really nice, and I'm loving the fact that you've got it already. I'm just thinking of all the colours that we've got at home that this would go really, really nicely with. I think this is gorgeous. Imagine your creams and your beiges and your chocolates and your browns i think that would look really really nice with it i think it's lovely what are you thinking copper wire Ooh. i always go to wire copper yeah, wire antique bronze wire would look nice with it yeah it um would. but i just thought um, to do the one for the show that the champagne uh, champagne gold is just such a soft color yes and it complements the, the shape and the color of the stone it really and the does. pattern on that one in particular um but yeah, even a darker coloured wire, maybe a black if you had the, because you've had black Ooh, wire. Yes, in, we have, we mm. absolutely have. Black, and that could be quite masculine as well. You could, could. macrame, round. Ooh. <laughs> that sounds yes, that good. Was, that it? could work. And we've had some, recently actually, we've had some beading thread in different colours as well. So uh, maybe you wanted, mm. I don't know, if you want to try that and do extra different weaves as well, because you mm. can weave with your beading wires as well, can you? Um, or you're beading threads, sorry, not you're beading wires. Um, 400 carats, these are flying at the do door. Sinead's in, Geraldine's in, Barbara's in, Philip is in, Elizabeth's in, Mary and Jerry are in, Susanna are in, Pamela's got two, Lynn, you've got yours, Joanne, you've got yours out in Londonderry, Argyle and Butte, I've got Greater London, Hertfordshire, Hertfordshire again, Devon, you're in there as well. It's a hugely busy opportunity tonight and it's so lovely to see. I just want to see if there's any price points online for, for what you're maybe buying, but this... And this isn't one you would miss out on if you... Ooh. Oh. £95 for a boho serpentine ring in silver. Huh. That's one. Just one stone. Just one st And it'll be small. Oh. There isn't many serpentines in quantity that look like this. <coughs> Elsewhere, for shopping-wise. I mean, there's natural clear serpentine, but I prefer this. Well, there's one actually using copper wire, like you said, and it looks lovely. It looks gorgeous with the copper wire. These are fantastic. Do you know what I'm noticing looking through here? There's so little serpentine about of this natural form. So little. 400 carats is a huge carat weight. I counted them earlier. Was it, how many was it we you got? I've forgotten now. I wanted to say it was like four, 15, 16, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14. 40, I love them. Reminds me a little bit of a snake as well. Don't know whether it's the way it reminds me of a rattlesnake. I don't know why. Like the tail mm. of a rattlesnake. 
56 pence for individual serpentine. What's lovely about this isn't just the, the unique quality and the beauty of it, it's a premiere, nobody else has got it. It's the first time I've brought it in this size, 30 by 40 carats, uh, 30 by 20 millimetres, sorry, 400 carats. It's a big size, they are natural. You can see how big the drill holes are there. I appreciate we've zoomed in a little bit so you can get a closer look at it. But you can see just how sizable the drill holes are and the material we've used to, to put through them. So they are very, very size. I mean, that's a plastic sort of cord we've put through almost to, to thread them, to drill them. So they are very sizable. And they are wonderful. I think they'll match every skin tone. I genuinely think they'll go for everybody's skin tone. I don't think they're too much in strength for any other. Oh, what's that? Is that That's the one on mil? That's on the one mil. <gasps> really easily. On one mil with the silver. That's lovely with silver as well, isn't it? It does work, yes. Well, I like that with the silver too. And the stones are just so lovely. The different patterns on both, both. the back. Both sides, they're all different, so you've got double, yeah. even, even double, double. Double the amount of mm. like, sort of looks that yes. you can create. You could do a sort of twisting piece or a piece that you could turn around with one weave in one direction, turn it around and have something spiral they're maybe lovely. on the other side. They're really special, and I cannot congratulate you enough on these. I'm really, really chuffed for you. For that price point, I didn't think they would go under 10. I didn't expect them to. But at that price point, those of you who've got it, well done. Um, Shropshire is in there, great. It's a fabulous price point, isn't it? I really want to see it with some woods, with some sort of tiger wood or ebony wood. I think that would look really nice. I think it would really suit it. Really spectacular. And again, the way you've just used it, for me that's 14 individual pendants. Yes. Totally. Mm. And it's 7 95 If you were to charge, say you charge 7 95 for one pendant, I mean, that's 14 of them there. You know how much you want to charge for your time, for your working, for your wires, for your threads, depending on what you're using. But for that price point, knowing I'm struggling to find serpentine of this quality anywhere else, that in itself makes it even more exciting. Something that not everybody has. Isn't that what we look for as jewelry makers? To make something different? Yes. Different, and but you can with that. That's just stunning. That's what you want. Something stunning, something that's different, and yet under £10 and affordable. Amazing. Have we got a break to go to? No! Really, really short break. Really, really short break. On the other side of it, we've got a very special opal strand for you. Oh yes, you don't want to miss it. Um, nine o'clock. Has anyone guessed what the gemstone mini, mini clearance is? Nine o'clock. Nobody's guessed it right. Nobody's guessed at all. Nobody's guessed right. Mm, maybe after the break I'll tell you what some of the guesses were and you can work out whether you've guessed um, or whether you want to send your guess in. Maybe I might do something special and do a dibs, I don't know, never know, never know. Um, so as I say, a really, really short break uh, and absolutely love that. Karen's just fabulous. She'll be joining us after the break, hopefully you will too. See you in a sec. Thank you. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker by liking our Facebook page and join over 55,000 like-minded people. Did you know, no matter how many times you purchase with Jewelry Maker in the same day, 
you'll only be charged one fee of postage and packaging. Select our standard delivery for just $2.95 or, if you'd like to receive your goods sooner, upgrade to our premium option for $4.95. Morganite was first discovered in California in the early 20th century. News spread quickly and it became of special interest to George Frederick Kunz, a well-known and respected gemologist and gem collector from New York. In 1911, Kunz later discovered the gem in Madagascar and suggested naming this pink variety of beryl Morganite. Along with emerald and aquamarine, Morganite is now one of the most popular gemstones from the color beryl family. try and get brides to think about being a bit more creative and designing their own jewellery. I think it's nice to have something different and nice to do it on a, on a cost effective price point too. You can spend so much money on your wedding day so if you can do something that saves cost you can buy a more expensive pair of shoes say and then make your own tiara. It, it is really important, I think, for most girls that they don't have the same as their friends. Oh my word, it's such, such a privilege to have this for you. This blew my mind. It doesn't even look real. It looks like somebody has put all the most important parts of an opal into a mix and created the ultimate opal and then done it again and again and again and again and made the most spectacular strand I've ever seen without a shadow of a doubt. This opal isn't your average opal. It's not even just a graded opal. I have to be fair that me personally, the grade on this isn't high enough. This I would expect to be a minimum of a... I don't even know how you would do a septuplet, like at least seven, eight times your A's. This is not just an A or a double A or triple A opal. The highest grading we do is a triple A. This is off the scale. It's not even on the scale. I think double A, no disrespect, but I think double A is nowhere near doing this justice. Honestly, I would not say this if I didn't mean it. I said it to my producer a moment ago and I mean it wholeheartedly. This is the best, the best without a shadow of a doubt. There is no second to this. The best faceted Rondell strand of opal from Ethiopia I have ever brought you. It's, in fact, opal from anywhere. It doesn't matter whether it's Ethiopia or not. The best opal of this caliber, of this type, sorry, not this caliber, this type of opal. When you see this, I hope to goodness it comes across on TV. But I also hope it doesn't come across just as good as it is. Because when you get this home and you see the price you're getting it for, I want you to literally be doing somersaults, whether you've done a somersault before in your life or not. There were only ever 104 of these. And there's a space. Oh. 
it's a limited edition. So what was that? 104 worldwide were ever, ever, ever purchased. They launched this morning. These are the final 10 in the entire world. Oh my word. You can see purples, you can see greens, you can see oranges, you can see everything you look for in an opal. I'm just going to get a wee blackboard and put it underneath. Just so you, wow, I'm sorry for any sort of flecks of dust on there, but it is the ultimate, it is the best, and I don't mean that with any disrespect, it's the facets, do you know what's so amazing, the way they've been cut, each facet has a different colour, like you've got an orange triangle there, you can see a green one, you can see a blue, you can see a purple, you can see pink, this isn't just a small section. Let me move it along here. Again, they graduate from a three by one. They go up to six by one. My jaw is without a shadow of a doubt dropped. I didn't mention this all night. And the reason I didn't mention it is honestly because I thought it was too good to be true. I didn't think for a second I would have this. I honestly thought they're going to sell out before I get to the late show. I won't have a chance. So I didn't even look at it. In fact, if you're in the studio with me, you'll know I didn't look at it. My producer Tom said, we've got it coming up. And I didn't say anything because I thought, I'll, seeing is believing, I'll wait till we actually do the star buy. And if it comes as the deal of the day, if it's there, then I'm going to do it. Now, Honestly, in my profession, you know what, I don't like telling my professional opinion um, on prices because I think it's not fair, because um, I'm not here to imply a value or worth, I don't like doing that. However, it's not going to be at that price, I'm pretty sure, because I know Jewelry Maker, I've worked here for long enough, um, I know it's not going to be anywhere near where I think it should be. Honestly, if this was had a clasp on it, just like this, it's 13 inches, so you'd need a little bit of chain. See, um, I would put it with nothing less than your precious metals, and I would have it with yellow gold, with a little bit of yellow gold chain on either side, and with a gold clasp, I would expect a minimum of... 800 pounds and I'm not even joking I have never seen an opal like this I j absolutely don't my producers just said you don't know the price of this because I haven't told you no those of you at home who have been watching all day will know the price of this because you you'll seen the deal of the day I haven't um I refuse to watch it because well I did because I thought I'm not going to get any there won't be any left for me there's only 104 made in the world there will not be any by the time the late show comes on or the evening show there's not going to be any 8 o'clock at night there'll be none left so just shy of all of them have gone there were 10 left for me I cannot believe my luck I don't see that price for any other reason than for you to really grasp how special this is I'm not ready and I'm not steady, but I presume you're going to bring the price in anyway. I don't want to see it. It's... Th 100... Th that's ridiculous. It's not even moving and it looks incredible. If I move it just slightly... There is no treatment. There is no dying. This is magnificent. <gasps> and I've only ever seen it in the studio. Oh, my word. Look at the pin fire. I haven't even seen it. Uh, why did the morning show get this? It's not even funny now. You're giving it away. If you have ever... Now, I mean this with no disrespect to any other opals out there that you may have or may have seen... If you are looking at this and you want the best Ethiopian opal fasted rondelles or fasted, just the best Ethiopian opal we've ever done, 
forget what shape it is, forget what size it is. This is, in my personal opinion, the best opal, Ethiopian or anything, that we have ever done in that quality of a jelly. It's just magnificent. If you want the best, that's the best we've ever done. I don't, don't say that lightly. Have you ever heard me say that? I maybe said it's one of the finest I've ever seen or it's up there at the fine. This is the best Ethiopian opal I've ever brought you. E e the best opal, doesn't matter what country it's from. I am amazed. I'm amazed that there's any space. I want to look at it outside. I want to take it outside. Oh my word. Can you see that every single facet has a different colour? Now, I'm looking at it and I'm looking at the beauty of it and I'm seeing it in a studio light. Oh my gosh, this is insane. <laughs> it's not even slightly coming across. This is ridiculous. Right, so, Karen, you've seen it on the TV. Mm -hmm. Have you seen it in real life? No. Okay, I'm going to bring it to you. Oh. Can I bring it to Karen? Um, you've seen it on TV, mm -hmm. right? Look at it for yourself. Oh. What do you think? I don't think I'd get anything done with these because you'd just spend all day just, oh, look at that. I'm just looking at it all day. They're beautiful. Have you ever seen anything like it? No. I think we've lost Karen. Uh, I'm in a zone, <laughs> the opal zone. It's they are beautiful. I mean, yeah. Without a shadow of a doubt, the best opal I have ever, ever brought you on jewelry maker. I'm going to leave it there, um, because we had 104 and there's there's space. They're beautiful. Enjoy. I'm going to take this way. You're not allowed to have it though. <laughs> I, if I oh. could, Karen. If I could, I would. They're beautiful. Gosh, it looks amazing from over here. <laughs> Thank you for taking the time to enjoy that with me. I genuinely do feel you have seen the best opal we've ever, ever done. Ever. Have I said ever? Because I genuinely think it's the best I've ever seen from Julie Maker. Ever. And I've seen one of a kind Ethiopian opals and one of a kind Australian Cooperpedi opals in platinum one-of-a-kind rings and pendants that have sold for four or five, six uh, and above thousand pounds. That, oh, that is up. Absolutely off the scale. Well done. Blowing my mind. Right. Bead mat. I love, oh, I love the feel of these. See the elven, I don't think goes anywhere without a bead mat. Seed beads, true two beads, your dual beads, this is a brilliant treat. If you use any of your, these, the 95p, yep, cheeky we add your order. I love these, I love watching Sarah Elvin do it, which is, we made the DVD with the um, CB DVD and the way she just like, dip, 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 dip. I love it, <laughs> I'm so easily pleased. Um, you like that too, Sam and Cameron's like that too. Um, now you don't get these beads, but this is an example. They stay where they are. I think it's because all the little fibres sticking up stop them from moving. Mm -hmm. It's really soft. They're lovely. It's an A4 in size. You can take it with you. It's brilliant if you just want to put things back in their pots. She says, I've never, never tried this before, but I've seen Sarah Elvin do it, and I'm thinking, if Sarah can do it, I'm going to give it a wee try. Oh, I don't know. I can't see. Oh, no, I'm scared. Oh, no. <laughs> Well, it's close. Bear in mind, would you not normally do it and look at it yourself? Ah! <laughs> okay, well, maybe I've got, get, I've got a bit confident there and then I kept going. <laughs> um, right, there we go. So, I have 95p for your bead mat. 
These are coming up at some point. My earpiece just disconnected itself. I've got a little bit of excitement going on. Oh, the seed beads everywhere now. Might be able to get some of those, take them home. <laughs> right, so add them to your order, start an order if you fancy. It comes as the mat on its own for 95p and the seed beads hopefully will come up at some point tonight because I think they're gorgeous. Imagine those in between those gorgeous opals. In fact, I wouldn't put anything with those opals. I've already told you I just have them like that. I love them. Right. <gasps> peridot. Who loves cheeky wee peridot? Me too. Eight carrots of peridot. Getting you interested. Getting you excited. Right, let's get them. Where did I put them? Oh, there they are. Oh, my word. <gasps> Microfaceted peridot. These haven't been seen since Boxing Day this year. <gasps> They're gorgeous. <coughs> These are so strong. You would think with them being so dainty at a two mil round, you wouldn't get much colour from them. <laughs> These are striking. Oh, a lot of love for these. It's almost full, but there are some dotted around Sobri. <laughs> right. Are you ready to own eight carats of gorgeous? They really are gorgeous peridots. <gasps> oh, hello there. Look at the fire coming through these. That is testament to the way they've been cut. Stunning peridot. Totally natural. That's all fire. That's the light breaking into its different colour components and bursting back out at you. The result of dispersion is fire. It's phenomenal. It's Did almost liquid. Yeah. They're really pretty. Do you like them? Mm -hmm. Not as much as these. <laughs> Not as much as your opal. Oh, I think we've lost the, the opals, guys. Need to do a wee search before we leave the building. Oof. Not just of me, Karen too. They're, they're phenomenal. Honestly, if I could, it, no disrespect to anything else I've had tonight, but if I could look at one strand out of everything we've had all night, it would be that one. Mm. However, these are pretty special. Mm. Wow. Again, for that size, though they are dainty, they're seed beads, they're microfaceted. I mean, they're s and so well microfaceted because you wouldn't see any of that fire if they hadn't been. You can't do that. These, no, no, stop the mask. Hold on, so, sorry. Excuse me, producer. Sorry. Hello, hello, hello. Um, hello, I'm trying to catch your attention. Hello. Uh, these were launched at what, 1995, 2195 microfasted strands. Look how long it is. It's not a mini strand, it's 29 centimeters. Please stop and think before you do this. Still lost, Karen. Sorry. <laughs> no, you're They're fine. Enjoy. Please enjoy them because they, they are the best I've ever seen. Please enjoy them now because you're not having them. <laughs> oh. They're gorgeous. Neither am I if it makes you feel any better. Oh. Not really. <laughs> 9 95 Catherine Hampshire just got three. These are gorgeous. If you do any seed feeding and you don't have microfaceted peridot, then this is an unbelievable chance. We get our peridot from Shanghai and Hunan. Hunan peridot, Hunan. I used to sing that all the time, but then we don't have Hunan peridot for me to sing it. So if you've never heard me sing it before, that probably means I've never presented Hunan peridot for you. These are gorgeous. The color is there. The fire is what is getting everybody excited. Fire is what we look for in a diamond. You don't usually expect to get this much fire from a peridot. Do you know this is one of the very few idiochromatic gemstones we offer to you? Have I just bamboozled you there? Idiochromatic, what does that even mean? What does it, what does it even mean? And idiochromatic means its colour is derived from its basic composition. So, for example, the series emeralds. Remember I was telling you it's vanadium that gives them their colour, the properties of vanadium when it's formed. This gemstone, this emeralds could be formed without vanadium. You can get morganite, you can get aquamarine, all different irons or different things that you can create that gives you different colours. Vanadium is what you get in um, Colombia, but it's not vanadium that gives it its colour in Zambia, for example. So this strand cannot be this colour, it cannot exist without its basic composition, which gives it the colour. It's phenomenal. So nothing's, no minerals are, are 
adding to it later, its basic formation, its basic structure creates the colour. It's so special. It is so gorgeous. And it's just stunning. Another big wow! Whoa! Whoa, whoa! I don't know whether that's for the, the opal or for the peridot, but either way, they're both wow! I'm in love with those. Imagine I were to create ruby faceted drops with those. Ooh. Be a little bit special. <gasps> what is happening? Oh. I'm in heaven. Oh my gosh. Wow. Are they juicy berries or juicy berries? So they say they look a bit like raspberry sorbet. They're lovely, yeah. aren't they? Absolutely with you there. Mm. I could just look at these all day. I wish I could too. You still having fun with those opals? Do you know what I just saw Karen do? Literally, that. She's just rolling the opals just back rolling and forth. Them. They're just absolutely stunning. They're gorgeous. Oh, what have you found now? There's a real gold flash in one of them. It's beautiful. Oh, love it! Right, let's get you some. Rub you cannot just put a big sign that says clearance and turn rubies into a clearance opportunity. They weren't clearance opportunity a minute ago. No, they weren't. Karen, can you do that? Yeah, because he's bigger than us. He's bigger than <laughs> us. This is true. I think the two of us added together might make Tom say, uh -huh. mm, yeah. to become one. <laughs> right. Spice Girls. Sign to become one. Are you ready? So, hold on a minute. We've got rubies at a brilliant treat, because we don't get rubies very often. And we've had Colombian emeralds earlier that were just rock bottom low. Yeah. I always get concerned when you say clearance next to a strand of the big four. Okay. That's not our price. Is that our price? How am I supposed to know that's not your clearance price? Would you be... I mean, you've seen how many is on here. It's 55 carats of rubies. They're so three by two. They go to seven by four millimeter. July's birthstone. So hold on, are you telling me we could get these in time for July and these could be individual rat looped charms? They could be, couldn't they? The colour, the intensity, They're the saturation. Colour. Aren't they? Mm. That's just shy of half price. In fact, is it half price? No. Literally just shy of half price. And it's my birthstone as well. There we go. It's Karen's birthstone. So I will allow this price reduction. Even better then. <laughs> um, I'm going to have a wee count of these. Mm. Have you got your birthstone? Have you got rubies? I've got some very small ones, some rondelles. Some so you need some rondelles. more then? I do. Lots. There we go. Any of Karen's family watching or friends? <laughs> there we go. She needs rubies for her birthday. These are just gone reduced. Big reduction. Um, you could get two almost for the price of one now. That sounds crazy to say mm. that, doesn't it? July's Bristol, one of the big four, world-renowned ruby red. Everybody know what know, knows what colour a ruby should be. Ruby red, we know it. You just put clearance behind me and then, woohoo, there we go. 49 makes it okay. I wonder what I say to my I hope my boss is in meetings all day tomorrow because I do not know how to explain this one away. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. What's that? Thirty. 30. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Thank you, Karen. Most people don't listen to me. Two, four, six, eight, ten. What one now? Fifty. Fifty. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, 
two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. If you just tuned in, I'm not just practicing counting. I'm seeing how many we've got. We've got 80 so far. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Oh, one shy of a hundred. Ninety-nine rubies at forty-nine ninety-five. Would you ever consider offering a ruby for 50 pence? There's a ruby charm, 50p. 50p. Well done to every single one of you. You might even, do you know what you could do? You could get that strand and half it between you and your friends, 25 pounds each. Mm. And if you halved it in the middle, you both have the same amount of daintier and, and the larger seven by four mils. If you have to, you literally get about 50 each. 50 rubies each for about 25 pounds. Yes, please. Mm. So many treats. And then I were to say to you, Morganite of 50 carats. Yes, please. <gasps> Do you know, the one thing I wasn't looking for there were rounds. Morganite. Ooh! Do you know, putting them with that back, it almost like a lemon looks so pretty. What do you think? I'll put them on the blackboard a wee, in a wee moment as well so you can see the contrast. Ooh! Peaches coming out like there's no tomorrow. That's why I love Morganite. Peaches and pink. I can't think of another gemstone that gives you that. Peach moonstone, is it? But it doesn't have the pink. pink. It's yeah. just got the peach. Mm. Do you like more? They're very pretty. Yes, yes. I had some in one of my early kits, and they were just lovely. Oh wow! Really nice. I was very lucky. Do you think you would have? Do you think you would have gone for more it if you hadn't sort of almost been forced? I guess with kits, you kind of forced to work with what you're given. So, do you think you would have gone for more normally if you yes. hadn't seen it firsthand? Pink, pinks and um, lilacs and reds and blues are my mm -hmm. colours anyway. So yes, I would you have would gone have. there. <gasps> oh. Love a morganite. Did I tell you? I call it the pink emerald. In the industry, it's called that. You're, you're okay to call it that if you wish. Um, or you can call it pink morganite if you wish. It's up to you personally. Right. Um, I've only got 37 of these in stock. The colour is without a shadow of a doubt there. How do you think they would look if you got those microfaceted peridots in between? Very spring like. Yeah, it would be, wouldn't mm. it? I like spring. I think I try and do that quite a lot without realising putting spring colours together. Mm. I like those colour combinations. Oh, and then it would give, because these are plain without a facet, it would give you a little bit of sparkle in between. Oh, I like this. Oh. What do you think of those two That together? works. Do you think? Ah. Oh, I'm a little bit in love with these. Because neither of them overshadow the other. No, they don't. They just do complement each other so well. Work so well. Oh, so in love. And with all the micro fasting of the peridot, it shows the quality of those that they can stand next to a pink mm. emerald or morganite, however you wish to know it. Oh, this is everything I look for in a morganite with the peaches and the pinks and one stone. It's all there. So, oh, it, I thought that was a prey. I thought that was a What do you mean, where is it going? I don't know what to do anymore. I don't. Oh, is it? I'm gonna, I don't like it. Two, four, six, eight, ten. I like it, but I'm just gonna pretend I don't. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, three. Is it 33 or 23? 33. Is it? Mm. Which is even more than I thought. That's not even a pound of <gasps> That's not even a pound of morganite. You can't do morganite for less than a pound. I can and I just did. Cheesy <laughs> baguettes. What? Cheesy baguettes. Oh, nobody watches Chewing the Fat in this place, do they? Nope. It's a TV show called Chewing the Fat in Scotland. Maybe it's only aired in Scotland. Probably. Well, it was really, really quickly. It was a, it was a sketch where there was a bunch of, um, I think they were all working construction builders were all out having their lunch and they all had the sandwiches and they all had like corned beef or like cheese or ham in a sandwich. 
And they're all asking what each other had and saying, oh, I've got beef, I've got corned beef, I've got ham, I've got a bit of meat. And then they said to this a person who's renowned to be quite posh in the show, and they said, oh, what have you got? And he went, oh, cheese baguette. <laughs> and then everyone went, ooh, cheese baguette. So when someone's being a bit posh, Scotland would go, ooh, cheese baguette. <laughs> so maybe you had to watch it to find it funny. <laughs> Can someone please message me in and say they know what I'm talking about? Because otherwise everyone here just thinks I'm crazy. Oh. Even people who do know it probably won't admit. They'll be like, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna back you up there, Defoy. Just leave you hanging. Um, Catherine Hampshire is the only person um, that's managed to get a hold of those. Enjoy them. Not ever. Not ever, but right now. <laughs> so enjoy those. I want, uh, hopefully there's one left. I want one. Oh, I really want one. Turquoise. Oh, you can't just do that and then do... do you have to take this away. You can't do clearance now. It's stuck there. For how long? For the next hour. And a half. What, till 10 o'clock? You're going to do clearance? Even the star buys. My producer... I love that. I'm just going to put it full screen so everybody's just like... It's clearing. Um, these turquoise are stunning. For me, I was thinking £119. They have only been waxed. That's all. No enhancing in the colour, no dyeing, no reconstituted turquoise. They are round. They graduate. I want them. I'm sure you will want them. And they are under £100. Have a look at turquoise elsewhere, even with ourselves, and see our price points. Faceted like I've never seen before. Wait till you see these. These are stunning. They've been waxed and that's it. Now, gentlemen, uh, sometimes ladies too, but wax on the hair daily. Wax isn't something I count really as a treatment because it doesn't change the colour and it doesn't enhance the colour. It just is, is part of the luster. It would still be that colour whether it be waxed or not. But it is there, and that's why I'm telling you. I have not seen a fasting like this. This makes me think of turquoise as an evening gemstone, a real red carpet spectacular. Imagine one of those in a ring. How stunning are they? All individual in the markings. They're just fabulous. I'm going to have a look on here and see on our own website. Oh, I'm typing jewellery maker into our own search box. I'm trying to type in turquoise. I want to see if we have any other turquoise on the web like it. Oh, there we go. What do you reckon? Would you like to own turquoise? So we do. We've got some turquoise. Rondelles. Fasted rounds. What's the carat weight here? 55 carats. So, so far with this, we've got the biggest carat weight of fasted rounds in the building. Oh, that t-shirt yarn comes up because it's turquoise colour. We have no other fasted rounds of this carat weight as yet, but there's a page two. Let's have a look at page two. It's showing me Amazonite because it's turquoise colour. Okay, this is it. The only turquoise that we have in the entire building available to us in faceted rounds of this carat weight I've got for you now. There's a price on the web for a turquoise strand. Is it this one? Let's have a look. Oh, hold on a minute. There's one other price, oh sorry, there's one other fasted turquoise strand on the web. That's 40 carats in rounds. That one is at 74 pounds 95. 74 pounds 95, 40 carats. So smaller carat weight, 74 pounds 95 pence. Our price on the web already, and for those of you who want to get it just now, you can see it's £64.95. It's an extra 15 carats. Clearance is allowing this to happen. They start at 5 mil, they fast it and graduate all the way up to 8 mil. 18 centimetres on your strand. For 55 carats, the largest carat weight of rounds we've got at the lowest price we have available. Are you treating yourself? Are you treating someone else or are you thinking about it? What I love about this particular strand is that they're all different. You're getting turquoise. It's from the USA. Um, oh, why does it say irradiated on it? Do 
Just going to have a look because the information I had said it had been waxed. I just wanted to check because obviously I wouldn't want to mislead you in any way and um, I just need to check that. So, £64.95. What you're seeing here Yeah, I do. Okay. So is the certificate there? So apologies. Um, on screen, it's incorrect. It says it's irradiated. It's not been irradiated. It is just waxed. Um, we will explain that um, via email to our gemologist in the morning. But um, it is the certificate you will get is waxed only. Um, apologies for that. It must have there was some confusion at some point, um, uh, and that's. Obviously not what we want to see, uh, but I do sincerely apologise. As I said earlier, it was waxed and it still is waxed. There is no irradiation, which is what the I stands for in brackets. However, it is incorrect on this particular opportunity. I think it's always best to check. So, we are going down because it says clearance. Even though we were lower than anything we've got on the web at that price point, 54.95 is all we are looking for. And you've got a strand of genuine turquoise. Should we count them? What I love about them is, sorry, what I was in the middle of saying was all the different markings. Some people love the brown markings, some people love the black, some people like no markings, some people like it to be um, mixed. You've got it all. Some people in America, I know, collect them just for having the black. They call it like a spider turquoise because it looks like spider vein or webs within it. It's really cool. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, oh, did I count that one? Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, ah, two. Four, I'm starting again. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight. Twenty-eight turquoise. I prefer this one, actually. I don't know if you can see. But it's for me, it reminds me of Iranian turquoise. Persian turquoise, however you wish to know it. Because it's more of the brown veins. I love it. A pound and ninety-six pence of turquoise. Oh my word, enjoy it, treat yourself, and whatever you do, do not miss out. When is turquoise ever in a clearance? You can't do three carats of black diamonds. As a star buy, do you fancy some rose faceted black diamonds? It's going to blow you away. Wait till you see this, star buy. In a <laughs> I saw that you flashing your little clearance thing. Don't think I didn't see it, Director Ryan. <gasps> I have just sprinkled my hand with black diamond solitaires of three carats. Black diamond solitaires. Got that many. Wow. I'm going to put them on my bead mat so you can see. Oh. Wow. Do you know what's amazing about these? They're black diamond solitaires. Um, never before have I brought you black diamond solitaires. These are gorgeous. So perfect if you want to. <coughs> I, I just glue them without a shadow of a doubt. They've all got flat bottoms and they're all fasted in what they've called a, a rose cut. It doesn't show them off there at all, does it? An idea just how, you can't see how sparkly they are. They're all with a flat bottom on one side, like a cabochon almost, and then domed on the other. But you would, you would have to glue these, I imagine. I don't know how you could do a prong setting this dainty. Um, they're varying sizes. There's three carats. Can I pick one up with my, uh, let's see if I can with my gemstone grabber tool. Wow. These are stunning. 
How would you use them? What would you do with them? I'm not sure. To be honest, they're just so beautiful. Um, my first thought is sort of a gypsy set, uh, gypsy rub setting in sterling. Oh, like a sterling. flush setting, so yeah. setting it below, yep. Mm, in sterling silver. Um, but the, they're just, I think I'd just look at them with these, <laughs> with the opals. You're just going to sit with the opals and look at black diamonds and opals. All day. All day. Mm. Just hang out. They're just love. You can see the real shine on those that doesn't come across on the television. It doesn't, does on the it? screen, it's lovely. There's a little bit more there, but not quite as much. Do you know, I'm looking at them that much, I've just noticed how silent we are that I can listen, I can hear the air conditioning. That's how much in awe I am of these. I'm just like, wow. Now, this is a star buy. However, imagine, look at that as a solitaire. <gasps> oh my word. It's bigger than most people's engagement ring. Oh, sorry. It needs polished as well. That's how stunning the quality is. They're gem quality. Oh my word. Three carats of diamond solitaires for $49.95. I have approximately 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 15 black diamonds. Fasted with what is known as a, di a diamond cut. And the ultimate luster coming from these. Deep, intense, stunning. Simply stunning. Ooh, lots and lots of people treating themselves to apologise. Some of them have flipped themselves over. Just flip them back. They're everything I look for in a black diamond. Luster, solitaires, faceted. Lustrous, of course, is the main thing we look for in a black diamond. A lot of people look for diamonds and see diamond-like luster, black diamond luster, adamantine-like luster. These are actual diamonds. You don't need to look for a diamond-like luster. These are genuine diamonds. For £50. Pounds. And I have approximately, as I say, 15 Oh, a message in to say, I got these a while ago. Not used them yet. Just bring them out to look at them once in a while. <laughs> TV screen is not doing them justice. Amazing price from someone who's already got them. Love that. Thank you for taking the time to message in. It's a busy night. It is collectible. It is rare. It is black diamond. And it is 15 of them coming your way. Wow. I'm in heaven. Wow. Just wow. Did I mention wow? Um, one Minute Wonders. Do you know what One Minute Wonder is? Have you ever seen a One Minute Wonder? No. No. So what we do is try and bring you as much as we can in a minute. So you get a minute to see it at the price we're going to look for. And then we move on. You can still continue to get it. It's not we're moving on because we don't want you to get it at that price or we're trying to rush you. It means we can go very low and we can bring you small quantities of things that we know are very popular or big quantities and be very low in price, but we can give you more of a selection. So you can see more treats in a quicker amount of time. So you get more variety and you get our lowest prices as quick as possible. Sound like a plan? What's not to like? There we go. You can take as long as you want to get them. But if the quantities are low, bear that in mind because they might sell out before you call or whatever. So do if you really, really want something, call early. If you don't mind whether you get it or not, you can take your time. And I'll always let you know quantity-wise if we've got a lot. So for an hour and 15 minutes, it's one minute wonders. With what? Ethiopian Oval Nuggets. Oh, these are gorgeous. Sweet to see this nuggety goodness. Mm -mm -mm. Now you've just seen the best opal I've ever offered in the world. So it's going to be hard for any opal to look good enough after that. But these are fabulous. Wait till you see. Now there are 92 of these available in the world, so you have got a chance. Maybe you fell in love with the previous Ethiopian opals, but you just didn't have £100 set aside. I understand that. I appreciate that. But you, maybe you still want Ethiopian opals. Nuggets are wonderful. In between pearls, these look amazing. If you manage to get the first kit, or the only kit of our night, with our gorgeous car, maybe... Maybe you fancy some opals to go with it, with the pearls and the shells. But the clock hasn't come in. 
So that means that wasn't your price. Really? <laughs> the clock is in. You have one minute to see it, and they're only six ninety-five. So if you're thinking, I'll think about it. V D S F sixty one is the code. Jot it down. If you know you want to get them, bear in mind we've got ninety odd of these in stock. Do not delay because even though we've got a good quantity, it's six pounds and ninety-five pence. So that good quantity probably won't be there for very long. Do you like them, Karen? They're really pretty. They are, aren't they? Yeah. They've got the Lots fire. Of sparkle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's because of the angles as well mm. of the rough nuggets. It gives you that opportunity for, for sparkle too. So with over 30 se or less than 30 seconds available, lots of you coming through, Sonia's in clear. So do remember, there are 90 of these in stock. We only get a minute to see it at that price, so we can go low, but it just means you have to remember, either write down the code or, or get it on the web. VDSF61, super, super busy, super, super popular. Whatever you do, do not miss out, all righty? 130 carats of rubies are coming up in plain rounds now, in one minute wonders. So do continue to enjoy it, I'm gonna do rubies. There are only four in the world of this. Oh, I need this in my life. Is this the one that has a star ruby effect in it? Are these Indian rubies? Oh my word, these are incredible. Uh, I believe I may have brought you this strand before. No, I haven't, all right, I must have done one similar then. <gasps> the weight of it. Is that our price? Is it not? 150 carats, the price isn't in because the clock's not on yet. 18 centimeters, you get a minute to see it when it goes to his friends. These are like a Bordeaux rich natural ruby. Natural rubies for 50 pounds. They're Lovely size. What's it, aren't they? Lovely good size to work with as well. Eight mil, is that something you look for? I mean, it's your birthstone again, isn't yes. it? Yes, yeah. It's almost like Tom knew that. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. They're so lustrous. Two, four, five. That's 25 of them. For what? A pound, not even a pound each. No, not even two pounds each. Sorry. My mask went out the window there. I can't, I can't even speak. Best of luck to you, the code is VYUD52. Why, exactly, why would you do that? VYUD52, at eight mil round, that's 130 carats divided by 25 stones. They've all got a huge carat weight. In fact, they've all got, ha hold on, hold on, hold on, stop, are these royal rubies? They must be. Oh, yes, oh no. A two, a two carat ruby is a royal ruby, which is exceptionally difficult to get. If you've got 25 rubies here and 130 carats, they are way over two carats each. The minute's over, oh well. Can't believe that's just been said. Look at what. What are we doing next? Uh, nothing as yet. Which? Snowflake obsidian. Okay. Mm. Oh my word. What do you think? Gorgeous or gorgeous? Whoo! Snowflake obsidian layout bars. They are 25 by 15, uh, sorry, 25 by 17 to 43 by 13 millimeter. They're like, I think they look like little ties, the shape of them. Yes. yes. What do you think? Mm. I love the way those ones sit. The way it sits on the, the strand doesn't quite show them off, but they work beautifully, almost like a necklace like that. I think they're stunning. Only 14 of these available. £10.95 without a clock. So therefore, I'm thinking, are you off again? Oh, of course. What a silly question. <laughs> From 10.95 to 6.95. Why? No reason. Because he can. Because he can. Exactly, Karen. Because he wants to. Because he wants to. Why is he going to drop that price so low? 
Love it. Uh, 25 by 17 mil to 43 by 13 mil. Catherine's going to go three already, making these even more limited editions. Sinead's in, lovely to see you. Uh, Lancashire, I've got Madeline showing an interest in yours. Your best of luck to you all. I think they're fabulous. I really do. And the fact that that sort of volcanic ash that's giving it that wonderful pattern. It's so different, it's so unusual and so pretty. Thea's showing an interest in Hampshire, Greater London with us as well. Tatiana's showing an interest in London as well. I was in London on Saturday and Sunday. Yeah, I went to London, then travelled from London to Belgium. So technically I was there. Even if it was briefly, I was still there. £6.95 and, pence, and you've just got yourself some of the most wonderful layout bar designs. Love it. Right, Ahmed. Oh, these are huge. How many? 250 carats. Seriously. <laughs> do you like? Love. Yeah? What do you... Oh. They're beautiful. Stop a minute. Stop. These? You know how we talk about the split in colour? These are... The way they've been cut... Hold on. With this gemstone, sorry, this is fascinating. The way these gemstones have been cut, you try and get a 50-50 split in this gemstone. That's the best you can possibly get when you get 50% of an amethyst colour and 50% of a citrine colour. Um, for those of you who know it, I do apologise. Most people tend to get a sort of 60-40 split. You don't ever really get a 50-50 split unless you're paying big figures, all right? Normally with these, you'll get sort of maybe a little bit of one colour and a little bit of another colour and it'll be like on the side of the gem or sort of horizontally. This is like these pairs are split down the middle, 50-50. They look stuck. Wait till you see this. Not all of them, but the majority of them. There is no two ways about it. The ones in the middle are like perfect splits in the middle. Look at that. Can you see these middle ones here? Look at that, a perfect split down the middle. And this one. And then this one over here. These are, so these are not 29.95, are they? This is, we don't grade our ametrine. If we did, this would be some of the finest ametrine out there. Um, ametrine is natural. Mother Nature created it. And to create the perfect blend of both amethyst and citrine, you've got some fire coming through there as well. They're really well drilled as well because it's not right at the tip, so you've actually got somewhere to wrap if you want to do a brilette style wrap as well. Mm. What do you think of these? Oh, they're beautiful. Stunners. Absolutely. Oh, I need them, I want them, I must have them. Uh, you cannot reduce the price. That, it was, for me, was thirty four ninety five for those. I need to lie down already and I've still got another hour to go. Over another hour. This is wrong. Um, Cecilia from County Clare Collectors and Grade. I'm so chuffed for you. I'm over the moon. I really am happy for you. Don't get me wrong. But I do not feel that that is a price that's acceptable for what we've got. I think it's far too low. Maybe it's because I know it's too low. Maybe that's the difference. This is just wrong. 23 available worldwide. And these are the last 30 seconds. Oh, I want to try them. Can I try them on? Everyone with it in the baskets, you need, oh sorry, I caught my microphone there, you need to check this out. These are gorgeous. Did I mention these are gorgeous? 18.95, what did I say? Oh, there's 19 on the strand, sorry, I thought I'd said the price wrong. I thought I was saying that it was 18 and it was actually 19, but no, there's 19 on the strand. Sam, when did you get time to count that? Love your work. Love it, she's on. Um, enjoy those. That that's just wrong. I do love stars. Oh, I love these. You are. It's all the ones I love. I love that. Come on. <laughs> In the nicest possible way. Come on. Um, fancy jaspers. Fancy that. Lovely greens. Which you see these? What do you think? Flowers that have been hand carved. I really quite like these. Maybe it's because I think I, I know what I can do with them. I'm not worried about, oh, what to do. I think, oh, I can make a ring with that. I could just wrap a wee bit of wire through it and wrap it around and stay in place. What do you reckon, Karen? Stay where it, I, yes, I agree. No, nice earrings. Would it work with peridot? With the little... I absolutely think, though. <laughs> I love that. It's gone. Um, I think oh, it's, it's gone, gone but oh, I completely agree. Sorry. So no, so I apologise. I completely agree with um, you. It'd be stunning. Sam, you're a superstar. It's gone, yet not gone far enough away. Oh, that's a stunning combination, Karen. 
Love that. Go together so well, they just complement each other so well. They really do. And for 6 95 my goodness gracious me. I'm going to count, you've got 16, I don't even need to count them, it tells me. 16 pieces, 16 millimetre round, 130, it's probably you're all thinking, yes, I don't have to listen to two, four, six, oh, you've just had to do it, sorry. <laughs> six pounds and 95 pence. This is fabulous. Ugg P86, UGGP86. I'm Jason Dorset, and you're straight in with the multi-purchase. Loving your work there. Thank you so much. Outer Hebrides, and maybe even the Peridot. Uh, so that was a pair of maybe even the emeralds. Colombian emeralds. What a treat. No. Opals. <laughs> no. Yeah, no, they're no. my opals. I <laughs> think we've lost the opals. <sighs> Neon. Oh, that's the star buy, isn't it? <gasps> oh, yes. 48 carats of striking blue. Wow, what do you reckon? Two by one to four by two mil, 38 centimetres, and it's got tassels, which means it's special. 48 carats. You've got the intensity of colour all the way through the strand. You've got clarity. You've got appetite. It's got nothing to do with being hungry doesn't. You would think it would though, call it an appetite. You would think somebody was hungry, found it and then be like, oh, call it that, I'm hungry. There we go. Nothing to do with that. It's coming from the Greek word apateo, meaning to deceive, because when everyone found it, they, th they got it confused with other gemstones. They didn't realise it was a gem in its own right, so they thought it was some other, other gemstones, like red zircon or sometimes the, the natural, or not natural, because you can get natural neon as well. Um, the Sky blue appetite, or I just call that appetite, that's what I know appetite as, is very often confused with periva tourmaline. So because it's a gemstone that nobody first of all knew was its own stone, they called it uh, the gem of deception. But $27.95 for totally genuine neon appetite, 48 carats, this is raw. It's a really long strand as well, 38 centimetres. I'm trying to think of what other gem could give you that striking colour, but I can't, uh, no. I can't think. Even some of the coated topaz don't look that colour. I don't, I don't know if you could get an alternative to that, really, the neon app. I think you need to get that one. If you like that colour, that's your only really option. There isn't another colour like that, is there? It's really quite special. And the price point. Where was it supposed to be? Because you moved it that quickly. I didn't catch it. $39.95 is its original price. And we are down to only twenty-seven ninety-five. It's not every day you get tassel strands of neon appetite. In fact, it's not every day you get neon appetite. It's very sparkly, isn't it? Mm. Is that something you look for in your gems? I usually go for the colour first. And blues and greens and browns, oranges, yellows aren't colours that I go for, but they are absolutely stunning, aren't they? Just seeing them in the flesh, so to speak, really make does make a difference. It does, doesn't yeah. it? Um, I've got the, let me get my cloth back. How many have I got, please? 41. Tahitian pearl. Wow. Virtually flawless. There's two tiny pits in that whole stone of 12.25 millimetre round. There's your drill hole. How sizable is that? How clean is that drill hole for a pearl? Think of the colour. Stunning, isn't it? So much of this is flawless. How smooth the surface is. You don't uh, what I find amazing is a lot of people call it black pearl. It's not black pearl. It's coming from the Pink Tata Maxima. Um, well, have you heard of the Pink Tata Maxima and the Pink Tata Margaritafera? So you've got the golden lipped oyster and the, uh, the black lipped oyster. So what you're getting from a Tahitian pearl is a black lipped oyster, one of the world's largest oysters. And the reason the pearl is this colour is because the lips of the oyster have created the colour for it. It's not been dyed, it's not been coated. So years and years and years of this 
pearl being in the French Polynesia and of the layers of nacre that the, the mollusk has, has produced due to a foreign being being in the ooh, um, being in the what is it called? In the mollusk, sorry. How funny, there's one loose floorboard, I think, in the entire studio, and it's the one that the camera's balanced on. So anytime anyone walks past, it's like, um, apologies about that. Got distracted there. Um, I've not just got one for you, I've got two. Can you see, because these are natural, can you see how this black lipped oyster has got darker lips? But what you can see with this one is a bit more of the pink through it. And the purple again. Fantastic luster from them. You can even see the light reflection of that luster. Fantastic drill hole as well and sizable. Again, a 12.25. Barely any pitting. There is pitting, but it's barely there. For you to get a completely flawless Tahitian pearl, you're looking at your easily, your, your four figures, high three figures verging on four for one. And then you get a third. Put this one in. In fact, I'll put it around this side so it can fit in. Can you see again, slightly darker? Just, they're natural. They're not going to be identical. I don't think that's the reason we get them. We get them because they're all the way from Tahiti, from the French Polynesia. We get them because they're totally natural Tahitian pearls. We get them for their luster, for their size, for their color. That's 50, not even 50 pounds a pearl. Now, have you ever seen a price of a Tahitian pearl? Do you get any Tahitian pearls by any chance, Karen? No. no. <laughs> Actually, I've never heard of them. Have, have you never? No. no. Very few people get the chance to. It's, you don't get them often in the high street. You get them now and again, but it's not a, a common gemstone. It's quite special. It, it's quite considered. And before Jewelry Maker was around, I didn't know anywhere where I could buy a loose Tahitian pearl. Nowhere. Um, and only in the past couple of years have we started doing them. We haven't had them from the beginning. Mm -hmm. We've only had them for two, maybe, maybe two years. 18 months to two years we've had Tahitian pearls. They are so spectacular. They are so special. This type of pearl, many people are aware, aware of how pearls form. Many people are, um, and forgive me if you do know this, but for anyone who isn't aware, it's the pearl, or the mollusk, should I say, protecting itself. Something's crept into the mollusk. It's been foreign to the mollusk, doesn't know what it is. Um, so what it does as a pearl, or as a, a mollusk, it protects itself. So it releases a layer of nacre. And every time it releases a layer of nacre, the foreign being, which then becomes a pearl, gets bigger. For one millimetre to form in thickness on a pearl, that takes on average for the mollusk to create that one year for that to form naturally. So a 12.25 millimetre pearl has taken how many years? Over 12 years to form to that size at one millimetre per year. That is a very, very, very long time. And bearing in mind how perfect the conditions need to be for that to be perfectly smooth and to be flawless. And they're not perfectly flawless, but they're not far off. They're the closest we've got. The price we have Tahitian pearls here for. Totally genuine. You've got an authenticity certificate if you want one for 25p to prove these are natural, genuine Tahitian pearls from the French Polynesia. These are a must if you can. They really, really are. I'm going to have a look quickly at Tahitian pearl prices. You've got a minute to see it at that price, or well, actually 40 seconds, but please do your research. P please have a look anywhere else. Because this is not a price we look for in Tahitian pearls. Tahitian pearls. I've done the shopping. £325 for one Tahitian pearl on its own. Has a diamond with it. £4,999 for a 12mm Tahitian pearl necklace. Oh, sorry, 11 to 12mm Tahitian pearls in a necklace with an 18 karat gold clasp. £7,900 for a Tahitian pearl necklace with an 18 karat white gold clasp. You can see 18 karat white gold, 18 karat white gold. A thousand pounds with 18 karat white gold. Three pearls. Really, really short break. 
On the other side of it, more one in minute wonders. I don't know how we're going to do that. I've got some appetite coming up. I've got these amethysts coming up. I've got some rose quartz coming up. Diopside is the gemstone that we're bringing a mini clearance of. Don't go anywhere. I'll see you in a sec. There are four easy ways to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join a community of over 54,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions, send photos of your designs and enter our Wall of Fame competition. Or if you need any help or advice, you can email our friendly help team. Make sure to get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates for items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. I think having bespoke jewelry always makes things unique. Um, the fact that you can add a couple of flowers onto a basic necklace or, or add some more beads on, there's nothing better than a bride who can actually make her bridesmaids gifts and favours. It's, it's lovely to see people coordinating their dresses with their bracelets by making friendship bracelets for each other. No matter how many times you purchase with Jewelry Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one fee of postage and packaging. Select our standard delivery for just $2.95 or, if you'd like to receive your goods sooner, upgrade to our premium option for $4.95. goodness gracious me if you've just tuned in where have you been it's lovely to see you i'm ali defoy i've got lots and lots of treats coming up for you tonight in the next 50 minutes we've got some one minute wonders but i also hear that we have a clearance now i love this gemstone i really do and i'm not well originally until i saw this i wasn't a green person I didn't like green gems i think it's because i hadn't seen anything that blew me away but i'd only looked in my local high streets and that's no disrespect to them but 10 years ago, 15 years ago, I don't think the high street jewellers were what they are now. They're, I think they're, they've changed very much, as have we, um, which is brilliant. This treat is just spectacular. Have you ever fallen in love with a gemstone that's made you change your thought on colour? Mine was this. Are you ready to own it? It's super gorgeous, it's very special, and it's going to be yours. Which one would you like me to start off with? Some Brazilian diopside. Have you ever seen diopside before? Gorgeous. Not in the flesh. Let so me show speak. you this. Diopside nuggets. Ooh. Rich, gorgeous, and green. Isn't all? It glows. It glows like there's no tomorrow. Now, let me explain the difference. And you'd be thinking, what do you mean difference? Difference between what? You can get diopside originally in the world, you could only get it from Russia. Coloured by the, the mineral chromium that gave it its colour. 
and it was called Russian diopside or chrome diopside. But then, only recently has it been discovered that you can get diopside from one other location, and that is Brazil. It's not coloured by chromium, but it gives you the same colour. You can get bigger sizes from Brazil than what you can get from Russia. However, you can't get as much clarity from Brazil than you do in Russian. So it depends what you want. If you want clarity, then go for, Brazil, uh, go for Russian. If you want size, definitely go for Brazilian. And if you just want the gemstone, then go for whatever you like the most. For whatever price suits you, whatever shape suits you. This, now, for anyone seeing diopside for the first time, I don't want you to think diopside is easily £9.95. I think you've gone a bit backwards in the way you're doing this. This is not the price we do diopside usually. This is the most affordable diopside I imagine of the whole show, right? It is clearance, but this will be the most affordable. They're Brazilian and the Nuggets. They're phenomenal. Get your teeth into them. Get your hands on them as soon as you can. How many have we got, please? Six, oh, 16. Right. Catherine's got two. Manchester's in. Shirley's in. Nottinghamshire's in. Geraldine's in. Greater London's in. Neil in South Yorkshire's in. It's a stunning colour. And it's the gemstone with a glow that changed my mind about gemstones. It really is something different. Claire's in Berkshire. Claire in Oxfordshire's gone and got two. Sonia's in. Scottish Highlands. Great seat is busy tonight. Catherine's in Lanarkshire. Ooh, ooh, one left. Enjoy it. You, we've just given away, well, I personally feel that's a giveaway price point. I hope you don't mind me saying that. I think we're about to beat the clock as well. It has gone. It's sold out. Well done indeed. Congratulations. It's the only Brazilian dioxide of the night. You've seen it? It's gone. Can you tell me, are they faceted? What are they? Faceted drops. 90 carats of faceted drops of chrome dioxide. Now this is from Russia. Have a look at the colour and have a look at the colour. These are huge. I've just gone past saying that Brazilian dioxide doesn't have the size, uh, has a bigger size than Russian and then look at these. Anything over 50 points in a dioxide from Russia is exceptionally rare. The price point changes when you go from 48 points to 50 points, half a carat. They start at a 5x4, they go up to 9x5, and it's a 19 centimetre strand. Now, this is the price point that most people expect to see for diopside from Russia. Coloured by chromium, which is why it's called chrome diopside. Are you ready? 90 carats, totally natural, faceted wonderfully, with a huge reduction from 99 to 69.95. Why? because he can put a clearance side behind me and say one minute wonders, that's why, that's how. Um, they are the very last in stock. We've only got a handful of them. We don't have a huge quantity of these. So do check them out as soon as you can. They are on a first come, first serve basis. 0800 644 655 or julianamaker.com, whichever is more convenient for you, whichever you prefer. But that colour, that rarity, can I count how many is on here? I've got about 30 seconds. Let's get my go. Two, they're so big! So big. Uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. These are huge. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 2, 3. 73. Is it? It's not even a pound each. Enjoy. Too low. Too low. Faceted pair, oh no, these aren't faceted. <coughs> Are they pairs or <coughs> faceted pairs? These aren't, I've got, okay, pop the graphics in and I'll work out which ones we've got. Plain pairs, you missed it, right, that's fine. We've got an order and I don't want to mess up because they're all chrome diopside, they're all Russian diopside. I don't want to put the wrong graphics in with the right. Mm -hmm. I need to make sure they're 100% perfect. So do accept my apologies for, um, for just making sure there. But I'd rather be right than, than not. So these are the ones we're doing now. Plain pairs, 45 carats there. 5 by 4 to 8 by 4, 18 to... 59 95 Totally natural. Chrome diopside. The sizes are there again, and we're off. What do you mean, by Ali? I'm not going anywhere. You're the one that's doing the. If 
if you ever wanted to take advantage of the fact that there's a football game on right now, my producer thinks that the prices need to go lower because of that, then take my advice and go for it. Is that why you went lower? How do you know they're not winning? Hmm? No reason, but you know they're not winning. Okay, I've got 25 seconds. Let me in you. Let let me in you on a secret. Let me let you in on a secret. There we go. My producer genuinely thinks that lots of people will be watching a football game right now. I think he thinks everybody's going to be watching this game that England are playing in. You can still watch on the app, on the tablet, on the smartphones. Doesn't have to necessarily be watching. I think he thinks everybody's watching. I don't know how many jewelry makers watch football. I do. But not when Chrome Dire Upside is going to that price. So his reasoning for dropping your price points is because, oh, there's a football game on. So this is going to happen for the whole World Cup. European Championships. How are yours to know it? Oh, yep. Oh, sorry. Apologies. I do have faceted pairs there as well. Mm. Oh, my word. So we've gone from faster drops to plain pairs, now to faster drops. Faster pairs, sorry, faster pairs. Have I missed something? I love that. I'm just going to do it while you sit there and look confused, is what I've just heard. I seriously don't think that many people are watching the football that you can go to 39.95. I genuinely don't think anybody's watching the football. If they are, they're still going to be getting involved. Is this a joke? Oh my word. Well, there we go. If there was ever a chance to take advantage of my producer's thoughts, do it now. Three left. Enjoy them. If everyone checks out, they're gone. In fact, they're more than gone. They're oversold. We don't have enough. Two left. One left, 25 seconds to see at that price. R, E, C, D, 60, you don't have that time. They're going to go before then. I'm sorry about that. Well, I'm not sorry if you got them. I'm over the moon if you got them. But if you're like Karen and I, you missed out, then I'm really sorry. Now you want to do nuggets. I don't even have time. To, I feel like I don't have time to explain this gemstone for you, but you can ask me on Facebook whenever you want. Um, this. Tell me the, these are natural, right? Patricia's message in from Bristol. Hi, lovely Ali. I'm doing both. No score yet. Lots of kisses. Thanks, Patricia. I love the both boys have just gone. Thanks, Patricia. You didn't know the score. You did that to find out, didn't you? <laughs> oh my gosh, these are so cheeky. They're like, yeah, we did. That is a terrible deceiving plan. They were deceiving. They just wanted to know the score. Can you believe that, Karen? Yeah. <laughs> Oaks. They both just said, oh, crumbs. Crumbs or crumble, which is what I feel like happening around me. My whole career is crumbling. How can you do this? I can't speak. I don't know what you what you expect me to say when you take chrome dial upsides to eighty six pounds and ninety five pounds. It is not eighty six pounds and ninety five pounds. It's eighty six centimeters. Sorry, it's <laughs> nine pounds and ninety five pounds. Oh my word! And now you've got faceted rondelles up next. I've got seconds on this, and I've got space. I uh, lean London Greater Manchester, Sylvia Greater London, Hertfordshire. You've got to check them out quickly because this isn't. Nobody's going to hang around at 9.95, right? Oh my goodness gracious me! Oh, this is my. Uh, I've got a penultimate, but one treat for you now. In Chrome Dial Upside, we've loads of other treats, but Chrome Dial Upside wise, I need a lie down. 35 carats of rondelles. Oh my gosh. They're pretty. Aren't they gorgeous? Mm. Oh. oh, this is why I love this stone. It glows. 
So it's starting at 29.95. Why would that happen? Can we just leave it there then? Look how gorgeous they are. Oh, I want them just like that. It's that depth of... I don't think there's another gem that can give you that naturally, that colour. That, that lovely green. Mm. It glows. It makes me think of Superman and Kryptonite. Also makes me think of Alex Mack. Alex Mack, the TV programme, the girl that... She broke into like a chemical plant and then she turned into liquid. It's not a Scottish programme. I think it was American. £24.95. pence. You're in trouble. We did have nine. Catherine and Hampshire came in and got three. I've got two left. Clutches and Kent, West Yorkshire, Hampshire, Derbyshire. Uh, one left. Gotta check it out. It's not even gonna last 20 seconds, this one. As quick as you can. I don't mean to rush you, but there, there's one left. Oh. Enjoy that. That was the fastest sellout so far, I believe. Of this hour, anyway. Don't panic if you missed out on that one. Stay in the line, because I've got fasted rondelles for you now, again. Ooh, look at the colour! 30 carats chrome dioxide. These are all Russian. I've only brought you one Brazilian. The rest have all been Russian. Um, <laughs> Russian, as in quickly. We've been rushing. <laughs> Did you get it, Very Karen? good, yes. Did you like it? Yes. I even impressed myself there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Right, have you got any more of these or no? <coughs> Five. Oh, my word. Of course I'm not ready. I don't know what to say. I'm a little bit nervous. Oh my word, look what's coming up next. And imagine you put that together. Oh, I didn't even see the first price. Now you're going again. Oh, I did see the first price. I just didn't like it. <laughs> Four, three, two, I've got two left. Um, Catherine's in, West Yorkshire in, Suffolk are in. You've still got a 30 day money back guarantee, even though the price is at 27.95. Please don't think you missed out yet. Always give it a try. If in doubt, give us a shout. Um, City of Bristol's in there, Manchester showing interest, Derbyshire. I've only, oh, multi purchase has just come through there. Now I've only got one left. Oh, it's the last chrome dioxide of the night. Enjoy it before it goes. It's gone. I hope you got one. I really do. Oh, uh, that looks amazing with the specetite garnet. Are there two specetite garnets here? Can I show you the, ron the, round the rondelles as well? I'll try not to fall off my chair at the same time. Oh my gosh, I love this combination. How good is that? Wow. A little bit of heaven right now. They look like honey. They do, don't they? Mm. Oh, right, I'm going to take away your comb down upside. And take away your second space type garnet, because that's not yet. Now this gem, this is rare. Have you ever seen pre price points to test the space type garnet in the world? Please look, just look. Don't look at what we've got on our screen. Well, look at the colour, look at the quality, but please do not look at the price point. Now, there's going to, the first thing that comes up when I type in specetite garnet is a ring at 18,000 pounds, 789 pence. Oh no, 18,789 pounds and 73 pence. And it's used. It's not brand new, second hand. Nothing wrong with second hand jewellery, just when you expect to pay 18,000 pounds for one. Single stone. It's an Asher cut. It's a type of cut in a gem. £384 as a loose single stone. There's a ring. That's the smallest best type garnet I've ever seen. £474. It says it's 9 carats. Next ring. 18 carat gold. £1,325. Single stone, loose cut, cushion cut, £667. All I've done is type in specitite garnet on the web and clicked shopping. That's all I've done. You can do it. Type into your search engine and type in shopping. And just look at the first few that have come up. 
Well, look at all of them. You don't have to just look at the first few. Have a look at the prices. Have a look at the colours you see. And then see if yours has got everything you look for. How is that £50? That's a nugget. Sorry. For a strand like this, for the quantity that you have, the amount, it's all about the colour. Now, is this natural? Yes. The colour is totally natural. That wonderful honey that you were suggesting there is everything you look for. Some people call it mandarin garnet or orange garnet or specetite garnet. It's from the Spessart region of Bavaria originally, which is why it's called specetite garnet. That is where its name came from, where it's derived from. It's so collectible. In the industry, its true name is Specitite Garnet, which is why we call it that, because we're accredited. Well, I'm accredited jewellery professional. All my um, presenting colleagues are. We've got a gemologist at the company. We've got two um, accredited jewellery professionals on every shift of the contact centre as well. Many of our producers are being trained at the moment in, uh, in time to be accredited jewellery professionals as well. Um, I did it with a closed book test in four days, and then they told me, oh, you can do it as an open book test which made me very sad. Enjoy it. I have space. Let's put the rondelles together. Two totally different strands of space tight garnet. Let's have a look at our quality control. Can you see any difference in the colour, the clarity, the quality? Totally different. One's faster drops, one's rondelles. It just so happens that we put them both on the show tonight. Hadn't seen either of them prior. We just saw that they were both specetite garnets. Can you see that perfect quality? Where's the clock? You can't say Ali's probably going to shout at me. When have I ever shouted at you? Maybe shouted to you, not at you. You're going to hide a grown man of Tom's <gasps> Well, I know why you're trying to hide now. Hide your face. I'm not even speaking. I'm not saying a word. was that ring that wasn't one word that was a few can't handle this Catherine's got four I love your work it's one left and I've got about 20 people on the web you got to check this out you cannot wait it doesn't change your post and packaging or shipping and handling if you check this out and then you add to your basket it's one post and packaging in any one day oh my word you are... Oh. Just brought you arguably one of the rarest garnets in the world. Now I'm about to bring you another. It's a phenomenon stone. Very few stones are phenomenon. It is a colour change stone. It's not a colour shift, which would be lovely. It's a colour change, a complete change of colour. How phenomenal is that? It changes by different light situations. So with the naked flame and candlelight, maybe you're out for a dinner and then the lady comes around or the gentleman comes and lights your candle at your table, all of a sudden this gemstone will change. And it isn't just, oh, it's got a bit of a hint of a different colour. It completely changes colour. It's incredible. It's stunning. And you've got it. In a night where it's one minute wonders, clearance, and Tom, our producer, thinks everybody might be watching the football, so he needs to go lower. I don't think this is true. However, that's what's happening. So take advantage of it. I would. Gorgeous greens, all of like tones. And then when the light hits it, you're going to get, well, actually, I don't know. You could get a purple, you could get a red. But it's so fiery. Almost like a demantoid garnet, the amount of fire getting from it. 31 carats, totally genuine, natural, colour, change, garnet. You can't change the price. The clock was in, Annie changed the price. Is there a lighter around, a naked flame? Has anyone got one? Have you got one? Can I borrow it? Sorry, I want to see what colour it goes. Thank you so much. Uh, 
Oh my word. The most gorgeous pinks and wonderful peaches and strawberries. I don't know if you'll see it. There's air conditioning, so it might blow the flame. So apologies. Um, I'm just going to hold it in front of it and see. I'm not going to do it that way. It's hard because the air con. Can we turn the air con off? Uh, sorry, it's blowing the flame. We've got 15 seconds. There's no point. Oh, wow. There's only two left. Can you see the changes? Yes. Well, you're just going to have to wait till you get it home. It's incredible. It's incredible. Thank you so much. Sorry, I used probably quite a lot of your gas there. <laughs> but it made a difference in my life. Thank you. <laughs> Which rondelles? Of what, Jim? Is this like a competition of doing the rarest garnets and one minute wonders and seeing how many you can do in a section? Zavarite garnet. Do you know why it's called Zavarite garnet? Because it comes from the Zavo National Park, originally, in Kenya. It was actually found just outside the Zavo National Park. Um, it wasn't actually in it, but because it was so close to it, and when um, Campbell Arbridge's, <laughs> um, uh, bless him, found this gemstone, he was actually going to Tiffany's and Co. with another gemstone um, to show them, to show George Frederick Coons. And his wife had said to him, take that one with you, because he'd found it years and years and years and years previously. And he took it with him. And um, they decided at Tiffany's and Co. to launch it and call it Zavarite Garnet because it's from, it was from the Garnet family. It's very rare. Most people expect garnets to be red, mm -hmm. um, which is where it comes from the, the word um, pomegranate, from the pomegranate seed, because it was actually thought to be a pomegranate seed when it was found, but it was actually not. It was garnet. Anyway, um, to get any other colour other than red in a garnet is quite collectible. Um, and then you get gemstones like this, which are naturally green. As I say, from the Zavo National Park in Kenya, it was found just outside of that. But because the colours were so reminiscent of the national park over there, they decided to call it Zavarite because it was reminiscent of those sort of the, the national park that, that they live right next to. It's a stunning stone uh, and found by the late um, and tragic loss of Campbell R. Bridges. He didn't, he didn't, he wasn't lost finding this gemstone. Um, there was another reason for that, unfortunately. But this gemstone was found by a very special man. He just happened to be Scottish too. Huh. I imagine the price point is going to go so... Oh. Now this gemstone was launched by Tiffany's & Co. It's still in Tiffany's & Co. Um, they still have it as one of their gemstones. I don't even want to look at the price points they're, they're selling it for. But you can do it yourself. And please do. Because the price points... All you need to do in the internet is type in TS and it comes up. Zavarite. Oh. And type in Tiffany's and Co. because they launched the gemstone. Wow. Um, well, my producer's like, it's super rare. Nobody thinks it's rare because you've just put it £27.95. It doesn't look rare, does it? This is so spectacular. Shopping. Zavarite garnet. Oh my word. This gemstone is put with rarities like fire opal and diamonds and rubies for £18,799. It's so collectible. If you've got that, hand on my heart, congratulations to you. Pat yourself on the back. It's a phenomenal gem. I don't even have that gem. There are four Sterling silver sheets. You gotta be quick. Woo! Um, it's a solid sheet of silver. Have you mm -hmm. seen any of these before? Not on here, no. Oh I've my used, gosh. I've, I've used silver a lot. Have you? That's my background is in sterling silver. Is it? I didn't know that, mm. Karen. Mm. So you'll know what's a good price for sterling silver sheet then? Maybe. Is that something you buy a lot or not really? Not at the moment, no. Not it's the okay. wire I'm getting at the moment. I used, ah. I used to buy a lot of this sheet. Okay. So 20 years ago. 
Oh, wow. Need to get you back into Silver Sheet. We don't have that much, but that'd be lovely to see mm, you play with it I'd as like well. I'd to play with it. Mm. <laughs> whether you want to make pendants with it, whether you want to make charms, whether you want to make rings, whatever you want to do, it's solid sterling silver. It's a square sheet, 76 millimeter, thickness approximately one millimeter. We cannot get enough of this. £49.95 for four of them. Ah. You like it? I do. Good thickness as well. One mil is a really good thickness. Does that make it easier to do anything different, like for rings or for...? It's got more structure. It's a lot firmer. We can hammer it and thin it out anyway, but it's um, a really good, solid thickness. It, it gives you a good piece. So when you want to cut shapes out of it, for example, it's not going to bend and sort of distort no. because it is solid. And as you say, if you want it to be thinner than one mil, then you could thin it out by hammering it. That's a good plan. I didn't realise you could do that. Um, lots and lots coming. I've got Norfolk Town and Weir, um, Turfane, Essex. I've got Greater London already getting theirs. There are only three of them. Only one's gone so far to Greater London. Last time I had this on, we, well, everybody thought they'd missed out. They were meant to be, was it 14 I had last time? And I had three left. Enjoy it. Ooh, London blue topaz. You don't get this very often. Is this the same strand I had the other the other week? It is, yeah, because I was gonna say we haven't got much of it. It's the same one. So we don't have any more than I thought. It's a still it's still the exact same strand. I don't have any other options available. I genuinely don't think there's anything else on the website, but I'll have a look. Patricia, stop egging them on. Patricia in Bristol, my producer, has said thank you for keeping him updated with the score. <laughs> um, it's saying what, sorry? Ah, uh, okay. So we're, we're not allowed to show your whole message. Um, but he does appreciate it, if that makes sense. Um, enjoy this. Enjoy it very much so. Oh, supposed to be reminiscent of a midnight sky in summer in London. Now, I lived in London for many years. Now, I don't see the sky ever looking like this. <laughs> I would go out quite a lot if it looked like this. Uh -huh. Didn't look like this. No. But I love the thought. Yeah. Do you like the colour? Do you like the sparkle? It's got the sparkle. It's lovely. It's really intense, isn't it? Really deep. Really popular, it's very beautiful. coveted. Mm. It's not one we get very often, but when we do get it, boy oh boy is it popular. I used to work on a previous show and <laughs> any time any of the London Blue Topaz arrived, and quite often in rings, it was always being yellow gold, they always, always, always had everybody running up to the scheduling team and saying, is there, is there any, any London Blue Topaz? We would do a whole hour just on London Blue Topaz. It was that popular, super popular. And <laughs> Ryan's like, yeah, it was awesome. Everybody, it was always, always super busy. If there was any London Blue Topaz in the building, every presenter wanted to be the one to present it because they knew everybody wanted it. And obviously, as part of my job, I want to bring you what you want. Obviously, that's, that's something I'm going to want to do. So with only a limited amount of these we don't get London blue every day I appreciate it. it looks considered compared to other treats that we've had but I genuinely don't believe it's considered for what you're getting at all can I just point out we've not done the um, some of our star buys is that okay all right that's awesome what are we doing next Ooh, infinity symbol with faceted ovals of Tulele garnet to go in them. Gorgeous. So you get the loose gem and then you set it yourself. You get two of them, by the way, you don't just get one. Now there are oval setting and it's set on the horizontal, so you would set them that way. Mm. Sterling silver, four by three mil, 90 points uh, for your two garnets. Tangerine garnet, many people know them as Tulele garnets for this quality and this color from this location as well, Tanzania. Four by three millimeter. Stunning. Now, 
Again, these are going to be one minute wonders. Karen, have you ever set gemstones? I know you used to work with silver yourself. Did you ever mm. set gems? Yeah. Was it hard to do? Something not like if you've this. got the right tools. Okay. Um, it's not that difficult now. No. So say for this with <coughs> the prongs already on there, is that something that would take hours work? No, it should be. Um, it should be a fairly quick job to do that with the prongs already on. The yeah. stones are ready made. Yep, and they're the right size. Mm. They're designed especially for this mm. particular pair of earrings. Shouldn't be a problem. So all you need is a gem setting toolkit, which we have, and you may already have. And you set them. Fifty sorry. Fifteen ninety five. You can't oh he just goes forget about that. Don't want to forget about it. Thirteen pairs left. What would be the gram weight on these? Twenty one millimetre length, width of nine millimetre three point seven grams of sterling silver. 1.8 grams of silver quite, per ear. Um, that's quite sturdy piece. It's not going to be too heavy, though. No, it's the a perfect really medium, isn't mm. it? Mm. And then you've got it's all of that pretty. detail. Aren't they? Yeah. Super pretty. Um, lots of multi-purchases. Imagine what you could sell sterling silver earrings with genuine Tanzanian tangerine garnet or Tulele garnet, however you wish to know it. It's a location many people know is a very collectible garnet. I don't even want to talk about the rarest in collectability because I feel like a fraud. Because at nine ninety five, the price the price doesn't do it justice. So I would be if this was me watching it from home and I knew nothing about it. I'd be like, yeah, right, is that rare? It's ten pounds. Can't be that rare if it's ten. Well, what is it? Honestly, when I used to watch shows before I joined ten years ago, I was thinking, yeah, right, can't be real, can't be genuine. How's it that low in price then? Because we buy in bulk. We get things designed specially for us and buying in bulk. And when I say bulk, I don't mean 10 or 20, I mean thousands. We buy thousands of carats of gemstones, which allows us to get that price point down so low. Otherwise, there's no way we could do it. Um, rose quartz run. Oh, rose quartz, quartz run. These have only been on ever with Xena, I believe. I believe Xena's had them all for you. Um, super, super envious. But I've got them for you now, so I'm all right. I'll get over it. Loving, loving rose quartz. Anyone who's a regular viewer, you will know I'm obsessed with this gem. It's, it's worrying, actually. It's a little bit, it's been 10 years. You would think I would get over it at some point, but no. I just love it. Uh, uh, yeah. Do you like it? You like your pinks as well, pinks. don't you? Mm. <sighs> it's just an easy colour. It's not hard to match with anything. It, it doesn't works overpower. Yeah. What do you think? It works with most colours. It does. I genuinely think it works with everything, but that mm. might be me being slightly biased. <laughs> Maybe just you like, like it so much. Yeah, I'm just obsessed with it. I think it's probably a bit more accurate. Right. I, I, all the time, any time we come, have we got any rose quartz today? Is there any rose quartz? I feel sorry for those of you who watch me all the time because you literally are any rose quartz it is. Well, it's actually better than my previous channel because any time rose quartz arrived in the building, I launched it and it was my star buy every single night. Every night, my midnight mega deal was rose quartz. I felt so sorry for anyone who watched because they would literally be thinking, is that mm. all we have? Like, if, they, if you enjoy watching me, or maybe you could only watch at that time of night for whatever reason, every night you were, <laughs> you were subjected to rose quartz. <laughs> and I felt so bad. So I do feel better, and Julie Mickey, you don't get it all the time. Just whenever I can get my hands on it. Seven pounds and ninety-five pence for your drums. There are three hundred and twenty carats rose quartz. I love it because of the glow. I love it because it has everything I look for in a, a gemstone that epitomises femininity and elegance and pastel and soft. It's not a sweetie pink. It's not candy floss no. pink. It's not overpowering. It's just easy on the eye. It's lovely. Uh, and for one lady who does not like pink at all, our, our lovely Alison Tarry guest designer, she does like rose quartz. Yes. Whether it's because she just feels for me that much because I <laughs> literally every day harp on. I'm like, you like rose quartz though, don't you? You do. 6 95 your clock is coming in. Yes, you did, Tom. Tom said it was a normal opportunity. Oh, wires got crossed. This is your price. Your clock is in. Um, enjoy it. Treat yourself. 
Enjoy them. Out to Hebrides, Kerry's in Devon, Barbara's in Gloucestershire, Charlotte, Lancashire, Justina's in Lincolnshire, Vivian's in Greater London, Neon's in. I've got Neil in, I've got South Yorkshire. It's lovely to see ladies and gents in, whether you're getting them for yourself or whether you're getting them for um, Julie that you're making. Maybe you know somebody. Have you just turned on the telly and this channel's come on and you're thinking, what on earth is going on here? What's this? Um, what are all these clocks and buzzers and what is it? <laughs> Countdown. Um, it's much easier than that. Um, 0800 655 is a free phone number from UK Landlines, many other mobile providers. You can call us on that, press your button one, we can talk to you about this if you want it. It's £2.95 for your post and packaging in any one day in the UK, so you get as much as you want or as little as you want. Add it to the same order. Or if you're shipping it elsewhere in the world, do check if you want to speak to the contact centre or alternatively on the web. Choose your currency, whichever you want to use, and then join us via that way. But £6.95 for that stone is too low. But you don't need to worry about that. Amethyst. I've been mentioning this since about Whoa. half past five, maybe six o'clock. We had a look at these, do you remember? Mm. If you just tuned in, Karen Gray, our guest designer of the night, she's a superstar. It's her first evening show with me and I'm having an absolute ball. Are you enjoying it? Really, yeah, very much, very yeah. much. Um, we've got a wee cheeky amethyst for you now. Do you like an amethyst? I mean, you like your pinks and you like your purples, I don't you? I love amethyst, yeah. Do you? Mm. If you had to choose your top three gems, what would they be? Labradorites first. Yep. Then amethyst. Oh. Um, <laughs> pearls. Ooh. Mm. That would be a lovely combination together mm. as well, wouldn't it? Labradorite mm. pearls, amethyst pearls, amethyst and labradorite. Whoa, good selection there. These are fabulous. They're so dark. They're so rich. I like amethysts that have um, a really deep tone, really saturated, and then have the, can you see these hot pinks just like yes. slashing? Is that what you like in them? Mm. What do you look for in an amethyst? Um, it's, I like the deep amethyst, mm -hmm. but I also like the very pale lilacs. Yes, the lavenders pale, and the lilacs. The lavenders. Um, but I do like the dark ones. And I like to see the graduation in colours in, within a strand as well. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to pair them up for earrings. Yeah. <laughs> Is that what you're doing right now in your head? Are you just like, oh, those two go? Oh, those two, that size. Is that what you would do with them then? You would make the earrings? So the smaller ones, yeah, and the others I would use wire, but mm -hmm. not completely to wrap Sorry. them. Sorry, Karen Gray, <laughs> use wire. Hey ho. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I would use them in some way with um, some sort of wrap mm -hmm. around them, but not so enclosed so that they, yeah. could, they would still Ooh, hang. Yeah. Oh, still have almost movement. like a frame around mm. them. They would still have movement. Oh, I like the sound of that. These are delicious. Really deep, really intense, and so lustrous. Usually you would get the colour or and not maybe the luster, or you would get the luster, maybe not the colour, or you get all of that and not the size. You've got it all, you've got the size, you've got the luster, you've got the colour. 1995 is not a price for amethysts of this size. They go up to 19 millimeter. They're, they're literally like twinkling lights they're fabulous the color is there and they're natural which therefore makes me even more excited natural gemstones that mother nature has created just like this oh look can you see all those wonderful flashes of pinks and deep and oh just wonderful ay are you 18 now we had how many 51 of these available, so you have got time to call if you haven't joined Philippa in Bristol, Elizabeth in Glamorgan, Neil, Lizeth in Germany, all regulars, great to see you. Um, guten Abend, I think, is good evening in German, I hope it is. Um, sorry if it's not, Entschuldigung, if not. Um, Hertfordshire, Essex, Missouri, oh great to see you, joining us from all over tonight, lovely to have your company, out in Lancashire. Great, see, check those out. They are fabulous. I've still got space on those, so do bear that in mind. Right. Uh, what was that, sorry? Swiss blue topaz. Oh, it matches the colour of this, doesn't it? <gasps> like it. Pretty. Now, London blue topaz was reminiscent of the sky in London at midnight. What do you reckon a Swiss blue topaz is meant to be reminiscent of? The sky above the Swiss Alps, you got it! Wow! Whoa. Very collectible. Very popular. Really lovely. Oh. It's 
6 by 4 to 8 by 5 mil, 9 centimetre strand, 40 carats. It's all about quality. You've got quantity, you've got plenty on there. They're all of this exceptional quality. They start very sizable. They start at 6 by 4 mil and they go up to 8 by 5 millimetre. They are big. They're not shy and retiring. Oh, I'm in heaven. I could just look at these all day. Do you know how much you can... Well, actually, I was seeing charms last night for £59 and there was no gems on them. No gems at all. And they were plated metals. I like plated metals. I don't have a problem with them, but I don't expect to pay £59 no. for a small charm of plated metal. No. Nope. I want to see if I can find any Swiss blue... Swiss Blue Topaz engagement rings coming up. £84 and £95. Oh my. They're lovely. These look nicer, I think. You can't just drop the price. Even my producer is like, that wasn't me, it was our director. Blame the director. You can't pass the blame. You cannot. I think it's wrong to pass the blame. Spliss, sorry, Swiss Blue Topaz. <laughs> I can't speak now. <laughs> <laughs> I want to find Spliss to... <laughs> you want to say it? Yeah, I want to. <laughs> um, a Swiss Blue Topaz pendant. £79.20. A char... Oh, a pendant. That's got diamonds. Oh, £150. Drops. £180. They've got diamonds. £145 for a pendant. Charms. It's just £32. Look, there's one online of a wrapped look of a Swiss blue topaz pendant. It's not a pendant because it's got a jump ring and a little bit of wrapped wire. So they've done a real light wrap at the top of it, put a jump ring on it. So wrapped loop, created an eye loop, put a jump ring on it. £9.16 for one. Well, you've seen how many you've got, but more than one there. Did you see emeralds? These are big. Oh, these are lovely. They've got a silver tassel. I don't know when the last time I saw a silver tassel was. Extra, extra special. 2 by 1 to 5 by 3, 25 carats of genuine emeralds. Oh my word. Zambian emeralds, 27 in the world. Is that all we've got left or is that all we ever had? 27 in the world. Is that it? That's luxurious, isn't it? That's special. One of only 27. Mm. Now, sometimes I love being able to listen in my ear to my producer and my director and whoever else is in the gallery. Other times I wish I didn't hear things. Like my producers just said, oh, this shouldn't be in a one minute wonder. We should definitely shouldn't be in a clearance. We should probably spend some more time on this and realize there's six minutes left of the TV show. So that's slightly concerning. Uh, and then he goes, oh, well, huh. <laughs> oh, well, huh. Okay. Um, <laughs> oh well, <laughs> is what I've heard. And uh, put it this way, you know what a silver tassel means if you're a regular viewer. Mm -hmm. If you don't, it means one of our most exquisite, collectible strands. When was the last time you saw a Zambian amethyst? Well, actually, I had one last week, but that was in a gift box of three, and there was only a few left. Do you remember that? It sold out. Everybody wanted it. It was crazy low. It was a gift box with Zambian, Colombian, and Brazilian amethyst. Oh, collection. Are you ready for this? Let's go. 89.95. The clock that is just stationary. <laughs> um, the clock is there. I can see it. It's right about there, my little friend. It's not working. 
<laughs> not, I was tapping it, I was knocking it, I wasn't punching it, I never punched anything in my life. Oh, that's a fib, that's a massive fib. I did kickboxing with the gym instructor once, so I punched a mat. Really hurt and I didn't do it ever again. <laughs> then my nails went right through my hand. I was holding my thumb like that and oh, really sore. You're not supposed to do that with your thumb, you're supposed to do that, but I put my thumb in and I thought I broke my thumb. Is it broken? Is the clock broken? Are you okay? Talking to the clock. It's not working. I've got two minutes left on TV. It's a one minute wonder. How are you going to do this? I, I don't even want to know. I want to see my little screen to see who's involved. No one. Well, it's because you haven't been... Hasn't set my screen off. Goes to 69.95, but it's... 22, it's a limited edition of 27. I don't know where they've all gone. You've got them already. I've got 22 left from 27. That's all we had in the entire world. Um, collectors in Cambridgeshire, London, Sam, uh, Sandra, sorry, showing interest. Cambridgeshire, Missouri, showing an interest in there as well. Lots of you. It's gone from 27. It's a limited edition. You can get that on your authenticity certificate, can't you? A limited edition of only 27 in the whole world. How special is that? You wouldn't do anything with those. Would you not? Would you no. just look at them? Mm. I keep mine in my safe, my emeralds. I, d I just look at them. Mm. I bought a safe just for them. Really? Yeah. I bought a bicolored tanzanite and a Zambian emerald strand and I just look at them. It's the only reason I got a safe. That's silly, isn't it? I put my passport in it now as well, just for, <laughs> to fill it up. <laughs> <laughs> to use up some of this space. You're getting totally true and natural Zambian emeralds. Enjoy them, treat yourself and do take advantage of that. Um, Karen, you're back with us on Tuesday, if my memory serves mm. me correct. Uh, late show. On the late show. Mm -hmm. I think that will be with either Hannah or Zena. I'm not sure who is on right. that. We think it's Hannah. Karen, you, we think it's Zena. I don't know. <laughs> either way, Karen will definitely be there. Um, have you enjoyed yourself? Very much. Thank yeah. you very much indeed. It's been lovely. Thank it's you. It's been lovely having you, Karen. Thank I've you. really enjoyed not only meeting you, but seeing you work. It's just been a pleasure. So thank you so thank much. You. Thank, thank you. Thank you for staying awake with us till this time of night as well. It's a wee bit, a wee bit late, isn't it? Past most of our bedtimes. Um, take advantage of all the treats. I've had a lovely day with you. Thank you so much. Um, thank you to all the team. Becky especially who's done an extra long day. So thank you for that. Um, we'll all be back tomorrow night. Um, I'll be back. Well, I say that. Karen will be back with you on Tuesday. I'll be back with you tomorrow night with our lovely Sheila. She'll be on uh, live from five and I'll see you then. If not, I'll see you on Friday for the wedding show. Yay! I think having bespoke jewellery always makes things unique. Um, the fact that you can add a couple of flowers onto a basic necklace or, or add some more beads on, 